just change our text. You guys can go ahead and start looking through the store if you would like right now. Okay. All right, I think we're good there. So a um, couple new things I added into the store. I obviously have um, a bunch of Ginter. Um, somehow I never had 21 Chronicles draft football, um, but I have some of that in the store now. I have 19 or 2021 Donruss Clearly Basketball. Um, I have 2001 SP Authentic Golf Hobby Packs, in case anyone would like to chase. I mean, it's a long, real long shot, but if you're feeling gambly, um, you can chase Tiger Woods' only numbered and only autographed rookie card on uh, there. And then I re-upped on the 2001 um, Upper Deck Golf. The um, I had I actually had rack packs last time, but the rack pack box went up. So I basically built my own rack packs this time. Um, it's the same exact contents, but it would have been cheaper for me to do it this way as opposed to buying the actual rack pack box. So um, it saved us about seven dollars a pack for me to just buy the sp authentic preview packs and the um the upper deck hobby boxes and then basically create my own rack pack so those are in the store as well um i still have a lot of the national convention stuff um wild card we've got the panini uh packs thin and thick we've got i have one on its vip box left um the wild card ones surprisingly uh, these i think are the best ones some of the best ones out there are these things. This is the Wild Card 30th Anniversary promo pack. Um, those have been going up on the secondary market significantly, and so I have I actually have some of the sealed boxes of those as well. Um, <laughs> excuse me. Let me get some lighting in here too. Jeez. Um, but yeah, not too much in the way of new product outside of those couple items that I just listed. But. Um, you know, I, I didn't grab any NT basketball. It's a little bit more expensive than um, we usually have here as far as um, things that I fill. So I did not want to grab that because I could only get it by the sealed case, and I did not want to open a uh, – I didn't, I didn't want to make that expenditure because um, I don't have a ton of confidence that I'd be able to fill it today. So um, I'll leave that to someone else. But uh, for those of you that are looking for Ginter, it's in there. It's uh, It's cheap. Um, I think I have two pack lots at 20 bucks and four pack lots at like 37. So yeah, that's a, uh, that's pretty much everything. So hopefully we can, uh, we can grind out a nice stream here. Maybe I would like to do at least six hours today. Um, and then hopefully I want to stream maybe three days in a row. So we'll see how we do, but all right, Josh is starting us off with one of those wild card packs I was just showing. These things are awesome. The Pop-Tart filled packaging here. <laughs> All right, Guilty. Guilty's interested in the gold standard group break, so we could uh, do that right after this, buddy. All right, Josh, give me number one through nine. Number one, okay, right on top. Here we go make you a slip for today and if anyone else is interested in um gold standard football group break 115 a spot guilty said he's already in for one so i didn't i usually don't add those into the store until we uh get a little traction but if anyone else is interested in doing those just go ahead and post um in the chat once we get like we have one or two more people to say they're in i'll add it in because that'll probably go pretty quick all right good luck buddy the only thing about these things they suck to open ah. There we go. You see that? Like it, uh, <laughs> it almost separates the two layers of plastic that they used. Okay. All right. Starting off with Rondale Moore. Very nice, Jalen Waddle, fifty of seventy-five. And right behind that, boom! They never fail. Jalen Waddle auto. We are on a crazy Jalen Waddle run. That's like our fifth Jalen Waddle auto um, from Saturday into today, including a jersey number. And then obviously we just hit the numbered Waddle there too. How about Lawrence? Yeah, I'll take it. <laughs> I will take it. And Mac Jones. So they only made 250 total boxes of this stuff. So print run, very, very small on all these. I would assume the base cards can't have a print run more than a couple hundred. So, 
You're very welcome, bud. It is a fun little product that uh, most people don't know about because they've never seen it. <laughs> um, <laughs> you'll notice I am still uh, still fighting this cough a little bit, but other than that, I'm doing well here, by the way. So, um, yeah. But if anyone else is interested in gold standard football, hit draft. Guilty's in for one. So these are those four spots left. The way that'll work is it'll be a snake draft, technically. I know I wrote down hit draft, but it'll be a snake draft. There are seven cards in there. Um, so the first three people will each only get one card, and then spots four and five will um, snake back around, and they'll each get two cards. What's up, Jay? Shimmy? Bethany? Yak? What up, what up, what up, and what up? Um, so we did one of those the other day. It was fun. Um, I've got a couple boxes that left here today. Bath! Bath! <laughs> What's up, hoops? So yeah, um, if anyone has any questions about anything, feel free to fire away. Josh, keeping us rolling here, my man, with some white sparklies. And um, I will think I'm thinking for tomorrow. Just so you guys know, I'm um, experimenting with them. Um, oh, that's what I forgot to. I forgot to put my bangers in there. How many do I have left? Seven. One second, guys. Sorry, I'm talking to myself. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So eight. I'm gonna have uh, Bub's baby bangers probably tomorrow. Just a base. It'll be a baseball only version this time. Um, but they'll be they will be cheap. I want to keep them at fifty bucks or under. It'll be the same concept. You'll be getting a couple cards and then a pack. But, all right, Josh, baby bangers. <laughs> all right, buddy, give me a number one, two, or oh, do I have two packs? I think I only have two packs of white sparkle. Two packs here. So give me top or bottom on white sparkles. I thought I had three. Top. All right. Let's see if we can hit an auto. This is one of the, uh, the only things that has eluded me here in our, uh, our many, many breaks has been saying it over and over and over again. I just want to hit a white sparkle auto, and I just can't, can't seem to do it. We did one in, uh, that's actually not true. We hit one in UFC a long time ago, but. All right. Here we go. Starting off with Willie Adonis. Followed by Yu Chang, rookie. Or Yu Chang Chang as he's listed on his Bowman Chrome card. And Anthony K rookie. So a couple rookies in there. Still no auto. We'll get it one day. K, Chang, and Adamus. What's up, Trev? Trev, I can't remember. Was it you who won the upper deck shirt that I forgot to ship? Morning, Brady. I can't remember if it was Trev 8 or the Trav. It was one of you, and I can't remember who it was, and I've had it sitting here and morning, afternoon, whatever. It's all just, it's all relevant, I guess. Okay, it was the Trav then. I couldn't remember if it was Trev 8 or the Trav. It was in a group break, and I forgot to ship it, and cool. Cool, 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 cool. Oh, Bethany's going to try some Ginter. All right, Bethany. Let me grab a box here. So this is what boxes look like this year. And as usual, it's a three hits per box. It's going to be a mix of relics, autos, printing plates, yada, 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 yada. <laughs> Okay. Meetings all day. All right. That's cool. You know I'll be here, Bethany. Uh, whenever you're done, I'll probably still be on, so I would not worry too much about that. Let me shuffle these guys up. What's up, Mega? Keebs, what's going on, everybody? Thank you guys for checking out the stream. I appreciate those of you that have uh, been following the store. I know that's a new feature here.
I've got more shirts to give away. So be on the lookout for that. I've got a couple more. Not the upper deck one, but. All right, Bethany, pick left, right, one through 12. Let's get four. Not yet. I'm still waiting on those. Still waiting on my shirts to come in. Um, but I have a couple more Panini shirts. And I might have a couple blowout card shirts. So I'll probably grab some of those for tomorrow. I only have uh, shirts on the way. Just started with shirts. I figured uh, go with the cheapest option first to see how they do um, before I uh, <laughs> dive into like hoodies and stuff and hats, which just take up a lot of space. All right. Walking, the walking Massachusetts billboard. I like that. I'll get you one of the signs to twirl on the corner. <laughs> All right. See, this is our first uh, first look at these. We'll do these first four packs, just pack by pack. So, All right, Trevor Bauer, Verdugo, Koch, which looks like a brewer and entrepreneur. That's what he looks like, and that's what he is. Uh, good thing I, I got that. That's the Sam Adams guy. I actually knew who that was. Larry Doby, Brubaker rookie, Tommy Lasorda, a Verlander Mini, which is the Allen and Ginter back. At least I believe that's going to be the Allen and Ginter back. And the Murad. Uh, Ricky Henderson. It's kind of funny that it doesn't say the uh, the player name on the front. And I'm just going to check and see where the short prints are. That way. So there's 303 Lasorda, so it should be that. It should be the last card in the pack is what I'm assuming. But we'll figure it out for sure as we uh, move forward here. Brim, Ron Santo, Aramis Ramirez, wow. <laughs> Galarraga, Capriellen, Zach Gallen. So again, yeah, there's a short print. So it looks like the short print is going to be the last card in the pack. Far, far away, Caldwell 47. Let's learn about this galaxy real fast. Located some 50,000 light years from Earth, Caldwell 47 is, is a spectacular globular cluster that contains many thousands of stars. It's notable for its blue stragglers, stars that appear younger than the stars they formed with, burning hotter and bluer. Photo credit to Hubble. Fun stuff. And Ryan Zimmerman, historical hits, March 30th, 2008. I'm going to say that that was the walk-off. The walk-off in the first uh, home game. Yeah. Boom. Yep. Left center walk off to beat the Braves in the first home game for uh, the Nats New Stadium. I only know that because they uh, they play the call on the radio all the time here in DC. So. That'll be a fun set to learn about. I actually am kind of excited for the historical hits ones. That stuff I'll file away. I don't know if I'm going to be able to memorize Caldwell 47's globular blue clusters or whatever, but Esteban Floreal rookie, there's our Joe Adele rookie, kind of hard to see the rookie card logos, I don't really like them in gold, they're uh, not very prominent and they're in a weird spot, um, so I don't know how I feel about that, but Pardo, Andre Dawson, Kiermaier, Luis Gonzalez, not a short print, another Verlander, that is the regular back this time, so that first one we saw was definitely the, uh, the A&G back. And the Arabian Orcs rallying back. Hunting and poaching rendered the Arabian Orcs extinct in the wild in the early 1970s, but captive breeding programs and strict protections enforced by the Saudi Arabia and the UAE helped bring these antelopes back. In 2011, the Orcs became the first species moved from extinct in the wild to vulnerable by the International Union for the Conservation of Nature. Dope. I love learning things. The Orcs. And our fourth and final pack, Duke Schneider, Lucas Giolito, uh, byung Hong Kim, or ha Song Kim, Rong Kim. That is rookie Kim, not old Kim. Reggie Jackson, there's the Trevor Lawrence rookie, because why not? Reese Hoskins, and a backwards Tyler Glass now. It just looks to be a normal mini to me, though. Doesn't look like there's anything special there. And the Arboreal Appreciation. 
Lord knows I love myself a good red maple. While a red tinge can appear on its flowers, twigs, and seeds, the red maple's spectacular scarlet to yellow leaves in autumn inspire folks to travel to scenic wooded areas to take in their beauty. It's the state tree of Rhode Island, but the largest at 140 feet tall and 7 inches in diameter was discovered in the Great Smoky Mountains in 1997. Fun stuff. Red maple. The state tree of Rhode Island. File that one away, buff. <laughs> All right. And I apologize in advance for those of you that are here just to see cards because I'm going to go slow with Alan and Ginter and read all the stupid crap on the back of every one of the dumb cards for the most part. Um, so. Uh, Shark, we only have one person who said that they were interested. I didn't put it in the store yet, but I can go ahead and actually put it in because we have enough people in here. I'll, I'll put it in for the gold standard, the football draft. Um, so the gold standard football draft is now at the bottom of the football section. I usually wait until someone expresses interest before I put the um, the product in. So if you want that, just go ahead and grab it. Guilty said he would be in for one. Um, so those are now in there if anyone is is looking for them. All right, Chris, give me a Father's Day pack. Give me a number one through twenty, my friend. Shark City's in. Chris says five. So you guys can just go ahead and uh, one, two, three, four, five. Just go ahead and grab uh, grab the gold standard spot. It's in the bottom of the store. So, all right, Chris. Good luck, buddy. Let's see if we can get you something numbered, maybe an autograph. Starting off with Kristen Yelich and rookie Casey Mize. Very underrated. I feel like no one's talking about Casey Mize and his sub 3.5 ERA this year up in Detroit. Even though they should be. So not a bad pack there to hit the Mize rookie. So thank you for that, Chris. My pleasure. And I apologize for you guys. I know I moved this stream a couple times on you. I had it set up for uh, Monday to begin with, and then the Tuesday, and then today. But I had a couple things come up here um, on my side that made me uh, made me push it back a little bit. But I do apologize for those of you that were looking for a stream yesterday or the day before, and then only to find out it got uh, got postponed. All right, anamorphic summer promo. Let me find those real quick. All right, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Give me a number one through ten, Anna. All right, bottoms. Make you a slip for today. Boom, good to go. All right, good luck. We have not hit an auto yet out of the, any of these. We did hit um, one of the draft rewind cards, and I think we got another one. Look at that. All right, so here we go. Maybe this one will be autographed. Let's see. Starting off with LeBron, Dominguez, and our bonus card here, draft rewind probably, Nico Heischer. 2017, first round, first overall. So nice little bonus hit. Last one we got was also a devil. It was uh, Yes for Boquist. Dominique Kubelik, guy scores a lot of goals, and Elvis Merzlikens, guy who I rode to the, uh, well, not to the championship, I finished in second. Fantasy second place two years ago. So, nice pack there with the two top shelf rookies, and the bonus t-shirt. I like those guys. I love hockey. I love all sports. Who am I kidding? All right, Marlins guys going Ginter. All right, Marlon. Give me four. Left, right, one through ten, bud. Uh, Logan, what do you... To chase who? Left, three through six, okay. Who are you looking for and what year? Depending on what you're looking for, if you're looking for a certain like rookie or something like that, or if you're just looking for autos, whatever it might be, I'll have a different recommendation. 
All right, here we go. Oh, let me get slip, Marlin. And for those of you guys that are uh, in here all the time, we'll have a. I have a nice, cool announcement um, coming for you guys. It'll be a couple. It'll probably still be at least a week or two away until we get it going. But I got something. Uh, working with Loop on something fun, something real fun. So, um, honestly, I would probably go with the wild. <coughs> excuse me. Um, either actually contenders, contenders draft picks. Um, excuse me, not contenders. Uh, Chronicles draft picks. Chronicles draft picks football is going to be probably your best value to get something uh, in every pack. Um, other than that. Um, I like the wild card 30th anniversary um, promo packs. So both of those are those are my two probably favorite ones. And then I would say probably Prison Collegiate Draft um, or Elite First off the line. Those are your four that I'd probably be looking at right now at the products that are out. There's not a ton out, so but those four are probably the uh, the best ones. So I don't think you can do better than that in Luminance. <laughs> All right, Joe Carter. Simon Baker, soccer coach, Tanner Hoke, Lou Gehrig, Ryan Mountcastle, rookie, The Kid, far, far away, this is Caldwell 4, The Iris Nebula, Wondrous Sight, spans six light years from end to end, wow, that's long, uh, Reflection Nebula, acquiring its brilliant color from the dispersed light of the central star, approximately 1,400 light years from the Earth, and I like this, the Lemon Shark, love lemons, <laughs> Nam. Um, but yeah, I will get to you, I'm going to do you next. Uh, so Namtip was on the Dolphins list from uh, Saturday night, so I've got his stuff here. So we're going to do yours next, buddy. So just hang out for one second. Yellow-brown to olive in color, the Lemon Shark is outfitted for camouflage in the shallow, uh, shallow sand-colored coral reef areas it prefers to inhabit. Adults can grow to about 10 feet, uh, but they are not a threat to humans. To the contrary, hunters have deleted their numbers in search of their meat and dorsal fins. Stupid humans. Why would anyone want to hurt a good old-fashioned Lemon Shark? Let me some lemon shark. I mean, you would think, like, friendly sharks. Like, that's got to be, like, you know, why would you ever want to go after a friendly shark? We need more friendly sharks. Uh, Josh Naylor, Mike Piazza, Al Kaline, Blyler, Rocky Blyler, of course, and our first hit. It's a Mike Yastrzemski base jersey. And a Ricky Henderson mini, followed by the Arboreal Appreciation, the Horse Chestnut, Horse chestnuts feature stunning oblong clusters of white flowers with yellow or red sand at their base. These flowering splendors typically grow 50 to 75 feet tall. With a spread of 40 to 70 feet, the most famous horse chestnut before it blew down was named the uh, Anne Frank tree in Amsterdam, about where, um, about which she wrote in the diary of a young girl. So interesting. Fun fact. Horse chestnuts. Sit down, students. Class is in session. Votto, uh, Jose Garcia, Stanton, Jackie Robinson, Sandberg, David Fletcher. Uh, I think we got a short print here because that is not Andrew McCutcheon. It's Uncle Larry. Or maybe it is not a short print. Maybe it's just uh, McCutcheon's alter ego has its own card. That's what it looks like. Yeah, so McCutcheon is Uncle Larry. That's kind of cool. And you got the Acuna Murad. So no, nothing to learn in that pack except that Uncle Larry's got a card. Taylor Trammell rookie, Jose Ramirez, Sam Huff rookie, Jason Biggs, Monahan, maybe you know, actor. I was going to say director. He looks more of a director than an actor to me, but actor it is. Dave Roberts, short print. World's largest, the giant squid. This thing, these things are huge. Uh, with eyes the size of dinner plates that allow them to detect the minimal light at their depths of the ocean, giant squids are likely the largest invertebrates ever to live on Earth. These dragons of the deep have been reported to grow 50 plus feet. They caught one not too long ago in, like, off Japan or something. It was, like, huge. It was, like, 70 feet or something crazy. But big boy for, for sure. And our final murad is George Brett. Thank you, Marlins. Fun fact. The horse chestnut and Frank's tree. File that one away. 
<laughs> All right, Bobbers has got a Bowman Mega. Give me a number one, two, or three, buddy. Number three. Okay. And then, still working on filling the gold standard football hit draft. Guys, go ahead and grab that if you're interested. It's the very bottom of the football section. I know we had at least one of, uh, one of them go. Sounds good, Bethany. I will be here when you get back. I can promise you that. Gold standard football hit draft is what we're working on filling as we get through these personals here. Uh, hey, Guilty, I know you said you'd be interested in the Gold Standard Draft. Um, it is now in the store for you to grab. So if you would like to grab a spot, go for it. Um, someone, I know that at least one other spot got grabbed. So um, if you want to go ahead and purchase that, it's at the very bottom of the football section. All right, boring packs, as I call them. Nola, Gallo, Vlad, Robert, and Freeman. Garrett, Mitchell, and Liberator Chromes. Morrill, Gomez, and Westberg are your prospects there. Patino, Trout, Castillo, Bellinger, and Donaldson. Espino and Adinso Reyes, Chrome first. Hancock, Cavalli, and Jung prospects. Bryant, Santander, Dahlbeck, Pache, and Ruiz. Peraza and Cavico, Chromes. Gonzalez, Tucker, Drew Waters. Bieber, Yelich, Murphy, Lewis, and Scherzer. Nick York and Yolbert Sanchez, Chrome first. Austin Wells, Ramos, and Freudis Nova. Yeah, I'm doing much better uh, health-wise. Um, the, the cough is... I've always had lingering coughing issues, like, uh, <laughs> forever. They thought I had whooping cough, like, 10 years ago because I just get this dry cough, like, this time of year every time. But... Other than that, I am feeling so much better, so thank you, Modern Medicine. So I know it's not my immune system, because that sucks. <laughs> All right, Mojo Pack number one, Gabe Arias Chrome first, Bayron Laura, a futurist of Nick Gonzalez, Andrew Vaughn, Taylor Trammell, and Pack two, Simeon Woods Richardson, Matt Thompson, Rookie of the Year favorites of Dylan Carlson, Alec Thomas, and Adley Rushman. So thank you, Bobbers. Haven't opened one of those in a while. Opened so many of those to begin with, and now uh, then we went a little while without one. But uh, I would assume so. It's either that or unless he's got a tops now. Um, I don't really follow the the Project Seventy stuff too much. I uh. I'll generally stick to pack pulled stuff, um, but I would assume that that'll be his first, unless he's got a uh, a tops now. All right, uh, Bethany's got former Allen and Ginter. Do you hear Bethany, or did you already leave? I can just put him off to the side for you. We'll just do. I'll just take four for Bethany. Put those off to the side for her from that box. All right. That is going to take us to T-Rex. Stadium Club Hobby. Okay. Let me find those guys. Where are you at, Stadium Club? Bum, bum, bum. A second, guys. I will find them. There they are. All right. Give me four numbers, one through 12, please, and thank you. Thank you, Irish. Just uh, showed up in the mail today, so I was happy to get that one in. Nine through 12. All right. I was saying earlier, I needed one really nice George. I have, I had a nice one, but I wanted one that was a little bit better. So I grabbed that guy. What's up, Easter Line? All right.
Card sticking a little. Okay. Austin Meadows, Christian Javier rookie, Sam Huff rookie, Blake Snell, Pujols, and an Esteban Floriel. Very nice. Black and white rookie. Oh, you're getting close to the, uh, the episode. Damn, you're getting close. Freddie Freeman and Jesus Aguilar. I think it's like season three, episode, like, I don't know, nine. Big fan of Botas, said no one ever. I like the Russell Helmet variation. Well, not variation, call it what you will. The whatever, card number 193 or whatever. Um, I like those, the Helmet ones. I think they look neat. Hosmer, Patino rookie, Chisholm rookie, Joey Bart rookie, Ahmed Rosario, and a triumvirate of Ozzy Albies. Giolito and Betts. Yeah, that was so funny. The the spiteful toe that he gave Verstappen um, on purpose so he can finish second on the grid because he thinks it's a better starting position. That was funny. Smart, it worked. Definitely worked. Sheffield, Zach Gallen, Trey Turner, Nick Senzel, Kutch. Nice. Kutch is a Stadium Club Chrome Refractor. And that is actually Kutch, not Uncle Larry. Followed by Victor Robles Red Foil, Tim Anderson, and Jeff McNeil. And one more. Aaron Judge, Mike Yastrzemski, Lourdes Gurriel. Josh Bell, Kiermaier, and a Kiermaier Red Foil, Devers, and Drew Rasmussen rookie. So nice cut refractor there. Those are not even one, and Floriel, neither of those are one per box. I think they're uh, one in one in two boxes or one in three boxes on the black and whites, and then the refractor, the refractors I think are about the same. So a couple nice hits there for a little four pack lot. So thank you, T Rex. Uh, he's both. Uh, Hamilton's both, <laughs> so that's kind of kind of the love hate relationship that uh, you know people uh, have with him, myself included, where I recognize it, but I, I recognize how good he is. But then other times I'm like, God, this guy is just like I just don't want to root for him. He's such a douche. But all right, so we got a couple spots gone in the gold standard draft, so I'm gonna start a card for that. Um, Real quick, let me get a pen. And for those of you that are interested, bottom of the football section, uh, Quidge is in for one, Sharkbiter's got one, so that gives us three left. Um, I know Guilty said he was in for one, but I don't think he ever went and bought his spot. So Quidge is in five. Sharkbiter's in four. And that takes us to Marlins, guys. Got a 19 chrome value rack. That is 19 regular chrome. Okay, give me a number one through four, buddy. <laughs> number two. All right. Um, oh, where do I have these? Okay. All right. Let's see what we can do with these guys. I'm just waiting for the announcement, man. I just want, I just want Botas out of Mercedes, and I just want George Russell in there. That way, I can sell one of my two Russells and use it to either buy more Max or maybe get myself a nice Lando. And yeah, that's definitely why they're there. Is straight cash homie. Straight cash homie for sure. All right, Marlins. Good luck, but let's see if we can get you uh, any of the big rookies here. Jesse Winker. Correa, Colin Moran Refractor, and a Nick Castellanos. Glaber, a Prism Refractor. That's nice. Otani, Rookie Cup, second year. I'll take that. Very nice card. Granky and Brandon Lowe, rookie.
Ooh, I think we got a numbered card, maybe. Looks like it. Or an auto. Kopech! Lindor! And I think we might have done it. I... <laughs> so this card is definitely... It looks thick. Okay. Faked me out, but we definitely did it. Drilled it. The Tatis rookie. It was weird. It definitely, you could see on the, uh, when I had them all lined up, it, was, it definitely looked thicker and, like, whiter. But maybe I'm just, uh, maybe I'm just blind. Maybe I just went straight six cents there and just knew that that was a Tatis. But what a pack. You got the Tatis rookie and the Otani. Where are my penny sleeves? Actually, we'll start off. We'll start it off now. We'll be moving these cards around throughout the entirety of the stream, but... We'll get Mr. Tatis up here. To start. And let's see our pink pack. I like Kopech. You just gotta stay healthy and throw strikes. Uh, a guy throws gas, but... All right, Joey Votto, Piscotti, Jake Bowers, Brandon Lowe, rookie, not too shabby there, and Francisco Lindor. Great pack with the Otani, the two Lowe's, and obviously the Tatis. The Red Sox drafted Kopech. He was there 20, what was it, 2016, 2016, I think. I think it was 2016. Yeah, he got traded for Chris Sale, 100%. All right, LM's got Ginter times two, so I'm going to use that a different box to be Ginter um, times two, as opposed to the Ginter times four. All right, guys, and still three spots left on the gold standard football hit draft. Just three to go. Bottom of the football section. 115. A spot. There'll be a snake draft, so spots four and five in the randomizer. We'll wind up getting two cards each. Shuffle these guys up real quick. I mean, I love Chris Sale. I used to collect him. Uh, I thought he was super duper underrated, and he still is underrated. People just—he's one of those guys. He's gonna pull like a—he's gonna go like full CC Sabathia. Actually, he's better than Sabathia. But at the, by the time his career is over, we'll be like, wow, like I don't even how, how is how did we put up these numbers and no one like really seemed to care. You know, it's gonna be one of those things. But um, go ahead here, LM. Left, right, one through twelve. Pick two. And let me make you a little, a little slip for today. Uh, now we have two, Shark. Two left. Yeah, people just, it's, it's bizarre to me that no one, like, really seems to care. It's one of those things where when you're so consistent and so good for so long without being the best, people just forget about you. They just expect you to do what you do. Um, White Sox market didn't help, but was it left five six? You said. All right. Good luck. Garrett Crochet rookie Willie Mays Moncada Bissinger, which is Buzz Bissinger. He's a journalist and author. Good for him. And a relic, David Bodie. He is a star third baseman of the Chicago Cubs. Not just the third baseman, the star third baseman. 
They must have known Chris Bryant was on his way out. And shout out to WM Eastern Lines Instagram. Shout him out. Ichiro is your mini. Ooh, I like this. Birds of a feather. Let's see. The Eclectus. They're among the easiest parrots to train for speech, picking up words and phrases more quickly than most other species. If they could come up with language themselves, they might be inclined to boast about their striking appearances. Their feathers resemble fur. Brilliant red for females and bright green with a candy corn colored beak for males. They do kind of look like candy corn, right? You have an eclectus for real? <laughs> That's funny. The good old eclectus. We got Brim, Tom Seaver, Ron Santo, Aramis Ramirez, Capriellen, Luis Castillo, and a John Lester mini. Rallying back, the Northern Elephant Seal. If I just showed you that, you would think it's a rock. If I took its head off, it looks like a rock. But the Northern Elephant Seal, confusing because it's two different animals in one, is a large snouted northern Elephant seal was once hunted in large numbers for their blubber, which was used for lamp oil. By 1910, it was estimated that fewer than 100 remained, all on an island off Mexico's Baja Peninsula. So, okay, this is now really confusing. That, one, it's an elephant and a seal. Two, it's called the Northern Elephant Seal, but it's located off Mexico. That's not very northern. Thanks to environmental uh, protection enacted by Mexico and the U.S., their population has now soared to an estimated 150,000. So, the world's most confusing animal. An elephant seal, the northern elephant seal, which lives in the south. Man, this thing's in a, in a, like, having like, a serious like identity crisis. Where does the southern elephant seal live? Seriously, like, how southern? I mean, it's all relative, right? But that was, that was an odd one. The northern elephant seal. From Mexico. Okay. <laughs> you say so. Alright, Easter Line's got a couple, so I'm going to do all three of those here. Um, give me number one through four on Marquee. Okay. Uh, give me one through uh, five on Chronicles. Three again, and <coughs> where are you, Chronicles? Where'd you go? Maybe over here. Sorry, I'm down there. We go there's Chronicles. Okay, and. I think it's one through four on a uh, yeah one through four on Pinnacle Jumbo three okay could have guessed all right we'll go in order of price on these guys no idea if you can change your uh, your username or not but two spots left in gold standard by the way everybody two to go two to go two to go two to go Two left in the gold standard hit draft. We'll do use Ginter after this. Use Ginters, I guess. All right. Starting off with Marquee. Good luck. Oh, I think we got a uh, Swirlorama. We do. I like the Swirloramas. Such a sucker for those patterns. All right. Starting off with an Acetate Rookie. Tristan Thompson. Swirlorama. Chris Copeland. And we think we got a Stars of the Night. So we got one of the, uh, the inserts here. It's Mellow. 
Very nice. I think you only get uh, six inserts per box. Two stars of the night, two of the all-rookie teams, um, and then two of the slam dunk legends. So, nice card there. Followed by a regular mellow, Iggy, AK-47, and the beard. All right, Pinnacle Jumbo. It's Giannis time. Please and thank you. As a reminder, two spots left in the gold standard hit draft. George, Pippen, uh, Ryan Hollins, Ronnie Brewer, Mark Price, Kyrie, Frazier, Tobias Harris, Nedovich rookie, David Lee, Dennis Schroeder rookie, Cephalosha, Kawhi, Steven Adams rookie, Ameka Okafor, KCP rookie. Nice Yao, museum collection, the Dufex. Matumbo, artist proof silver. My favorite cards in the set, Jam Fest, Larry Nance. Scoring Kings of Wilt. There's a nice one. LeBron awaiting the call. And Team 2020, Bradley Beal. Kobe, Durant, and LeBron. Those guys any good? One, two, three. Yay, nay. Jeff Green, Sacre, Myers Leonard, Clay Thompson, and John Jenkins. All right, 1819 Chronicles. See if we can get one of these, uh, those packs that deliver the Luca and the Trey. Had one of those the other day. Starting off with Drogic. There we go. Nice and easy. Trey. Boom. Uh, the current Lakers. <laughs> the uh, you mean the Los Angeles Geriatrics? True Holiday. Another Trey. Getting it. Dead centered studio. I like that. Shamit, Essentials, and a Goran Dragic Bronze. Those are the Fat Pack exclusives. Another one I like right there. My boy out of Villanova, Mikhail Bridges. That is the uh, premium card in this pack. This time it is from Phoenix. Wendell Carter from Panini. DiVincenzo from Luminance. Chandler Hutchinson from Playoff. Jalen Brunson from Luminance. Miles Bridges from Panini. Amari Spellman from Playoff, and our two score exclusives for the Fat Pack are Chandler Hutchinson and another Jalen Brunson. Very villanova -y pack there. And two nice Trey Youngs to boot. So, good stuff, WM. A couple really nice cards in there. Glad to get the trays for you. Then use up next with more Ginter. All right, you give me uh, two numbers here, one through 11, left, right. Four left, four right, all right. Good luck. Jose Ramirez, Josh Naylor, Sam Huff rookie, Jason Biggs, Monahan, Blyler, and an Ian Happ, or J.A. Happ, actually. It's twins. J.A. Happ. That is a Brook or a Ginterback. And the Blue Shark. Blue Shark has a cone-shaped snout and slim, graceful body set the blue shark apart, in addition to their distinct blue color, of course. Though not particularly dangerous, these slow-swimming sharks can be curious around divers. Blue sharks are also known to make incredibly long migrations, preferring temperature and tropical ocean waters around the world. Well, good news for them, everything's tropical ocean waters now. What's up, climate change? The northern blue shark now. Hot water everywhere. The Northern Blue Shark just chilling off the coast of Mexico. All right, Keston Chira, Soroka, Willie McCovey, Austin Hayes, Bob Clemente, Earl de Chapman, short print. Ooh, here's a new one. Good for you. Peas. I like this. Peas. Many folks just like to throw a handful into a casserole for a splash of color, but peas really should play more than a cameo role in one's diet. Rich in essential vitamins and antioxidants, they can help eyesight and digestion and stabilize blood sugar. Peas. Man, Ginter is so much fun. 
And historical hits, October 14th, 1985. It's got to be something involving a World Series. Or Let's see. The broadcast famously implored Cardinals fans to go crazy on October 14th, 1985, but they didn't need any urging. With St. Louis and the Dodgers tied 2-2 in the bottom of the ninth inning in Game 5 of the NLCS, Smith sent Bush Stadium crowd into an instant frenzy with a walk-off homer, his lone blast in 42 career postseason contests. Wow, that's kind of cool. Didn't know that. What's up, Anthony? Buff! Love Ginter. So much fun. No problem, you. Thank, thank you, you. All right. Still two spots to go on the gold standard hit draft. I want to pull someone to Trevor Lawrence auto today. All right. Um, we did that. We did that. Got that. We got that. All right. So WM's got another marquee. Okay. So I think you ran back the same little trio there, right? WM, another marquee, um, Pinnacle, and Chronicles. Uh, Lance's 49ers. Matt, if you uh, let me know what you're looking at, I can give you some recommendations. Sports and price range is uh, usually all I need, and I can kind of point you in the right direction. Uh, do you want number three, again, for each of them, WM? Pack number three. Same order as last time here. Football or basketball. Yeah, F1's a little bit expensive right now, unfortunately. Um, I would say in basketball... Ooh, basketball's a tough one. Um, football, you got a lot of good options. Um, if you're looking for like a nice assortment of stuff, I would go after a 2020 Chronicles Football Mega Box. Um, I think they're like right around 90 bucks. Uh, it's a good way to diversify your portfolio, put, potentially get some uh, some nice um, expensive stuff um, with the silvers and the chances at autos in there. Um, I think the 2020 class is really where you should be going right now for football because it's going to go up with all the quarterbacks that are in there. Um, and F1, F1, F1. <laughs> you can do uh, F1, but uh, it's going to be over 100 bucks now, unfortunately, for the two-pack lots of chrome or the pack of sapphire that I have. Um, which reminds me, Nam, I'm going to do yours right after this. I keep forgetting. Um, I have to do your stuff from Saturday. So we'll do Nam's next. Um, but if you're looking at 2021 stuff, you can get uh, Prism Draft Football. Uh, guarantees you an auto per pack. Um, I think those are right around 50, 50 bucks or so. Somewhere between 50 and 60 I think. Same thing for Contenders Draft, which will be a little bit cheaper than Prism. But um, the quality of card, I think, is less. And the auto checklist is not as good. <coughs> Excuse me. Um, you can go with what else do I have floating around? Yeah, basketball. There's not much that I'm too keen on right now as far as price and content. Um, Anything else football that I like? I mean, there's a lot of stuff that I like, but those the ones I just said are probably your best values. Um, you can always go with what's it called a oh, prism. Uh, prism no huddle football is the other one if you're looking for one that's a little bit more expensive. Uh, Woody, there's two spots left in Gold Standard Football to the very bottom of the store, and I did not get uh, NT, Anthony. Um, I usually don't sell stuff that that's that high end, and I was only able to get it by um, the case, so I did not want to make that expenditure without um, being sure that I could sell it, so I didn't grab any. All right. Nash, Acetate Rookie, Tyler Zeller, Followed by a Swirlorama rookie of Daquan Jones. Legends of Tuan, Barajal, nice curry, LMA, and Bargnani. If I was able to just get an individual box, I would have done it, but I only had the option to get a full case, so I, uh, I passed on it for now. I'll check again tomorrow and see if I can get a box. Uh, I'd like to have one, but... Joe Johnson, Carl Malone, Batum, Ewing, 
Shumpert, Isaiah Thomas, Jason Terry, Eddie Jones, Mike Conley, Archie Goodwin, rookie, Cy Lawson, Ramon Sessions, McCallum, Ricky Lito, Evan Turner, and Big Bang, Artist Proof, Joe Kim Noah. Any good cards come out of the ones you saw yesterday? Our one per box relic is Andre Roberson, Upstarts, Jersey Rookie. You got a CJ Miles uh, Museum Collection. Nice Julius Irving, Artist Proof Silver. And Team Pinnacle, Pau Gasol, followed by Marc Gasol on the back. Big Bang Regular of Andre Drummond. Positional Powers, Dennis Rodman. And Team 2020 of Vooch. Ricky Rubio, Biombo, PJ Tucker, Curry Base, Kyle Lowry Base, Steve Nash Base. I think they're making like a little theme there. It's like the last pack had uh, LeBron, Durant, and Le um, who is it? LeBron, Durant, Kobe. And now they have they go the point guard route here. Nash, Lowry, Curry, just goat point guards. Definitely Kyle Lowry, just for the record. Jason Richardson and uh, Dwayne Wade. For those of you that don't know, Lowry is my. Uh, Lowry's my guy. Day one on the Kyle Lowry train. He's taking care of me, for that's for sure. You want to see something hilarious? Look at this. According to Netflix, there's a new film called out called Beckett. It's coming Friday. <laughs> if I know anything about Beckett, that shit is not coming out on Friday. <laughs> That'll be maybe like uh, 72 Fridays from now. <laughs> <laughs> Harrison Barnes, Siakam, and Ariza. Michael Porter Jr., nice marquee one there. Alonzo Trier Elite and a Ben Simmons, Chronicles Bronze. Kevin Knox is your Chronicles Premium. Uh, JJJ, Luminance, another Trey Young, so a lot of trays. This is the Panini one. Yeah, Heat are going to be defensively um, a nightmare for a lot of teams. Another Jaron Jackson from Playoff. Elliot Kobo. <laughs> Kevin Herter from Regular Panini. Aiton from Playoff. And another Trey Young, the score exclusive, followed by another Alonzo Trier. So, so many Trey Youngs. Four of them in two packs for you. I like that. Uh, I saw the card. Yeah, it got posted in, um, what's it called, uh, our Discord, but... Who knows? Probably a Nick Nedge or something like that. All right, Nan, but let me do your uh, your stuff here from the other day that we forgot to do, and then I'll keep moving through the queue. All right. So we had two packs of F1 Sapphire. So you can go ahead and give me two numbers here, 1 through 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 1 through 14 on Sapphire. And then I got to grab more of the Panini packs. Three, seven, okay. Okay, and then 1 through 10 on a thin pack. Or actually, yeah, go 1 through 10. 7. 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 on our thin. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. And then, all right, you had a Buffs banger as well. So top row or bottom row on the banger. And then one through five. Number three, okay. All right. And uh, yeah, there's one or two spots left in Gold Standard. I don't know. I heard the thing go off, but I don't know if someone uh, grabbed it. But they're in the, it's in the bottom of the football section. So the only way to just guarantee your spot, just go ahead and buy it. Uh, bottom of the football section, guys.
Okay. All right. We'll do National Convention Thin, the two Sapphires, and then the Banger in that order for Nam. And then we've got, after that, we've got um, Austin's got a Leaf Valiant box. Esport's got a Chrome Black. Uh, Austin's got a Father's Day pack. Esport's got a Hobby pack of Chronicles. And then we'll do the um, the Gold Standard Draft. Woody's in spot two, so... I know Guilty said he's going after the last spot, so you can go ahead and grab it, bud. Uh, it should be at the bottom. should be there. Let me make sure that someone didn't uh, try and buy it and it's locked up. <coughs> oh, excuse me. As a... Uh, Yeah, it's showing in there for me. Um, it might not be at the bottom for you. It should be at the bottom of the football section. Um, but depending on what version of the app that you're using, it might be just mixed in there. But it's uh, it's $115, so if you're having trouble, you can scroll through and just uh, look at the price from the football section. Because I don't have a ton of football, so it shouldn't be that uh, that impossible. But All right, here we go. This is for Nam. These were purchases from uh, Saturday <laughs> that uh, we uh, we got disconnected on. So we're waiting for our next stream, which is now. So good luck, buddy. Starting off with a Panini Silver Pack from the National Convention. Cody Bellinger, I think that's going to be the five. It is. One of five on the Bellinger. And... Nice. Quickly Rookie. 33 of 50. So Quickly Rookie to 50 and Cody Bellinger to five. Sapphire Pack number one. Oh, I like that right on top. It's my squad. Red Bull logo. Jack Aitken. Guy who's second in F2 right now. Guan Yu Zhao. It is full guilty. And there's your boy. You said you love him. Especially, you said, because of this race. The one in Japan, I think. And there he is, winning the Japan race. <laughs> um, I didn't put the select one in the store yet. I usually wait for people to ask about the group breaks, because um, I don't want them to not fill. So the select football is not in the store as of yet. But if any, or uh, select basketball, excuse me. But if anyone's interested in select basketball, uh, it'll be three random teams for a hobby box, 10 slots at 115. Uh, just go ahead and post. And if we get a couple people that say thumbs up, um, I will go ahead and add that into the, the store for you guys. Nice Seb, followed by a Schwartzman, another good one. One of the couple of F2 drivers I've got my eye on. Lewis, Grand Prix Spain, and we got a Vertical Aqua. All right, let's do it. The driver. All right, it's not a future star. All right, one time, buddy. Good luck. Big name. I like him. It's our boy, Maximilian. 30 of 99, driver of the day, Mexico. I love you, Max. You're my boy, Max. <laughs> There's MQ. <laughs> my sweet prince, he says. I'll, I'll, oh, I love Max. He's so good. Did you see someone listed a freaking Topps Chrome variation? For a thousand or best offer yesterday, it sold <laughs> before I even got the update that it was listed. I would have drilled that by it now in a second. All right, now let's take a look at our Buffs banger here. Your pack is 21 or 2020 slash 21 Prism EPL Breakaway. Another nice soccer hit here from Chronicles is. Luis Suarez, select La Liga Blue Prism, 35 of 49 on the biter. And your third card, I like this one. ITG used Purple Spectrum, passing the baton, dual relic to 12. Mario Lemieux and Sidney Crosby. And 
And let's see what we can do here in the breakaway pack. Gineppo, Lacazette, Alzate, Emiliano Martinez, and Pulsar, Phil Bardsley from Burnley. Fun stuff. Look at that Max one more time. Oh, it's been so long since we pulled nice Sapphire stuff. Just so expensive these days. What's up, Santos? Been a minute, brother. Uh, no, our next race is August 29th. We're in uh, summer break right now. So the 29th, I believe, is Belgium. I do not have any of the retail basketball, unfortunately. Um, retail usually doesn't show up uh, to me uh, on the correct time, unfortunately. So, um, but if I get uh, if I get my if I get a chance to get any blasters or hangers or anything like that, <coughs> I will have them as soon as they uh, arrive at our warehouse. Nice, Meryl. No problem, Nam. Yeah, if I can get any, I'll grab them for tomorrow. Okay. Uh, that brings us to Os Crawford. He's got two here. He's got a Valiant box. So give me a number one through three on Valiant. And then let's get a number uh, one through 19 on Father's Day. Oh, wow. Nice, dude. Three Lamellas out of one blaster. That's awesome. Two and 18. Okay. And you know what? I'm going to put Max up on the... Uh, We'll get Max on the stand here. Nice. Turn this just a little bit. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. And number two on Valiant. Where are you, Valiant? Sorry guys, one second. I just want to make sure my inventory isn't off. I thought I had more Valiants here, but I cannot find them. Um, okay. Yeah. So I'm, not, I'm actually just going to go ahead. You guys got to give me a second. I got to pull my other uh, 2020 Elite Valiants out of the store because I, uh, I can't find them. I think maybe I, uh, I might have sold more than I thought yesterday or on Saturday. So give me half a second. I got to pull these out. Uh, one more, sorry guys. Don't want to oversell these by accident. I'm sure I'm going to find them somewhere stupid, like right in front of my damn face, but... I know I, uh, I think I forgot to account for a group break that we did. Now that I'm thinking about it, as far as inventory goes, so... Doot, doot, doot. I'll get back to the chat in one second. I have so much baseball stuff. So much. It's absurd.
keep finding the uh, the other Valiants, the Valiant Holiday Packs. There it is, okay. All right, all fixed. Okay, sorry about that, guys. All right, you ready, Aust? Make you a card for today, a little slip. And then after this break, I gotta run upstairs and grab our portable charger, and then we'll come back down and we'll do S boards, crews, uh, two boxes or one box and one pack, and then we'll do our gold standard hit draft. All right, start off with Father's Day. Good luck. Messi, very nice. Finally won himself an international tournament this year, and Patrick Williams rookie. So, pretty decent Father's Day pack there. And let's see what we can do here out of Valiant Baseball. All right. Yeah, we definitely did at least two boxes. I definitely miscounted my inventory for these because the one box had an Acuna auto and the other box had a Dominguez BGS 9.5 auto. <laughs> both numbered, <coughs> excuse me, both numbered to 50. So, this stuff has been a. Uh, very good so far. All right. Starting off with Jared Kelly, blue to 50, 44 of 50. White Sox prospect to 99. Casey Martin from the Phils, 46 of 99. To 25, Jordan Westberg, Orioles, first rounder, or sorry, to 75, 50 of 75 on the orange. I think pinks are to 25. And I like that one in 99, Baby Acuna. Three of ninety-nine, and your BGS nine-five. Another nice name in the international class. Rising stock, Yolkoi Cespedes. Eighty-one of ninety-nine BGS nine-five ten. Very nice. What a good box. Two of your best international signings. First round pick. And should have been a first round pick, but I think he went in the third round because of his slot bonus financial stuff. So, good box there. Thank you, Aust. Appreciate it. Sorry about the uh, little wait there. That's going to bring us to S Board Crew. All right, buddy. Give me a top or bottom on Tops Chrome Black, and then one through six on Chronicles. Top and two. Uh, the Upper Deck Summer Promo, it's a four-card pack where you can get five cards if um, if you get an auto or an insert. Um, it's their, It was their, their national promo this year. Even though it says Upper Deck Summer 2020, it's this year. Um, it was this year's national promo. So, number two on Chronicles. And top on top, Scrum Black. Uh, it's multi-sport, though. It's multi-sport, Justin. Um, but yeah, it's, uh, it's, I think the entire checklist is like, it's like most of the upper deck, uh, exclusive athletes. So it's like Tiger, LeBron, MJ, uh, Ben Simmons, and then the, um, that'll be in the prominent cut set, which is two of the four cards. And then the other, uh, two cards are guaranteed to be hockey. They're top shelf rookies. Um, so there's probably not a lot of baseball. Dominguez is in there. I know that for sure, but probably not a lot of baseball other than that. Okay. 
You're welcome. All right, let's start with Chronicles. So, Chronicles Draft, eight cards per pack, uh, three autos, <laughs> one relic, and then two numbered cards per box. So every pack is going to have one of those things at least. All right, starting off with Don Russ, Justin Fields, Prestige of Tylen Wallace, Seth Williams, Chronicles Base, and we got a relic, full coverage, Jumbo, Demetric Felton from Plates and Patches. Aziz Ojulari, drafted by my Giants. Rondell Moore from Status. Nice. Zach Wilson from Spectra. And, ooh, let's double down on the Zach Wilsons. How about a Zach Wilson Spectra Red Prism 64 of 149. Good pack. Two Zach Wilsons, premiums, including one numbered one and a jersey. So I like that. And let's see what we can do here in Topps Chrome Black. We had two nice ones the other day, including the uh, Alvarez to 99. And an Otani, uh, non auto to 99 as well. Gold Standard is up next, Quidge. I mean, Zach Wilson, not a bad player to be following you around. And yeah, that's why I love Chronicles. Uh, so much content. So you get all the names that you're looking for all the time. So you feel really good when you open that stuff. All right, Dylan Cease, base rookie. Luis Robert, base rookie. Very nice. And orange, Mitch Garver. 12 of 25. So nice Lubob and Cease. Garver to 25, not too shabby either. And let's see what we got here for you. What's up, Papa George? Auto. It's like a gold. Should be to 50. 6 of 50. Woohoo. I like that. Carlton Fisk. On card gold refractor auto to 50. Very nice. That can stay up here. Let's get you on the card. Good stuff. All right. Build a nice little uh Nice little set of cards there. What's up, Papa? And board, let me make you a slip for today. And now it's uh, gold standard time. All right. Last spot was guilty, I believe. Correct. And for anyone interested, we are now caught up on the queue here once we get uh, this gold standard break done. So let me go ahead and get you guys in the randomizer. So if anyone would like anything, feel free to grab it now. You will be up next right after gold standard round number one here. All right, so we got guilty in spot one. Woody in spot two. Nan is in three. Shark Biter's in four. Quidge is in five. And that is all she wrote. Uh, no, NAS no NASCAR. Lots of F1, but no NASCAR. All right. Seven times on the randomizer. I keep forgetting to grab NASCAR. A couple of people have asked me about it, and I literally forget every single time. Seven times. Good luck, everyone. One, two, three, four, five, six, and lucky number seven, seven. 
All right, it goes Guilty at one, Sharkbiter at two, Woody at three, Nan at four, and Quidge at five. All right, Quidge, you got to pick the box since you went in the uh, last spot. So give me a number one, two, or three, buddy. Box two. All right. All right, here we go. Good luck, everyone. Again, spots number one, two, and three. So Guilty, Woody, and... Um, Shark Biter, you guys will each be getting one card, and then Nam and Quidgy, you guys are each going to get two. It'll be a snake draft, so um, Quidgy will wind up picking two, and then Nam, you'll wind up getting whatever's left over at the end. So we're looking at five hits, plus two additional cards. <laughs> no lottery tickets today. <laughs> Heard that. All right, I'm going to take these <coughs> just off screen for one second just to reorganize them. All right, there we go. That was easy. Okay, here we go. Starting off with the base. Jarvis Landry, purple, one of ten. Don't know if it's purple or amethyst or whatever they're uh, calling this color, but it is the 10. Next up, Trey Nixon, rookie, 61 of 75. Patriots draft pick. All right, to our hits, starting off with Terrace Marshall Jr., dual jersey auto, 108 of 149. Good as gold. I like that. Patrick Willis, 22 of 99. Jersey auto. Love this guy. I love defensive players. So good. This guy was so good. Flat rookie auto. Odefe Oe. 15 of 25. Yeah, he's like the anti Frank Gore. <laughs> and we should have two relics coming up here. Jerry Judy, Gold Rush, 95 of 299. Or Julio Franco. <laughs> I remember when Julio Franco hit a home run for the Mets, or a grand slam for the Mets, he was like 47. And our final one, Kadarius Tony, newly minted for the Giants, 85 of 299. So let me get these out here for you guys to look at. All right, Guilty, where are you going at number one? I can show you any of the cards uh, again if you want. But you have the Jarvis Landry base to 10, the Terrace Marshall RPA to 149, the Patrick Willis to 99, Jersey Auto, the OA flat auto to 25, and I don't think you're taking anything in the bottom row. But it's Kadarius Tony and Jerry Judy Relics and a Trey Nixon rookie to 75. So let me know where we're going at pick numero uno. And then again, if anyone's interested in personals, please go ahead and grab them out of the store. I think we had one or two come through while we were doing that break there. We got one for MJ. Um, but after that, we will be caught up. I can also put together some more mixers for you guys if anyone is interested. So, but Guilty, you are up, my friend. You go ahead and just uh, at least post in the chat. Okay, there you go. Want to make sure you were still here. Um, yeah, that's gold standard. It's That's why you do it as a hit draft <laughs> as a, instead of a regular box break. Um, because if you get a box, it's just a, 
it's just a swing and a miss if you get a box that's a miss. Um, so, but uh, if you missed it, guilty. These are the four best cards, not in any particular order here that you're choosing from here with the first pick. Yeah, no problem, buddy. Uh, Odafe OA, rookie auto to 25. Patrick Willis, good as gold, jersey auto to 99, 22 of 99. The Terrace Marshall, dual jersey auto, 108 of 149. And then a Jarvis Landry to 10, purple base or anti space. So those are the four that you're probably going to be picking between. The bottom three cards are a Kadarius Tony jersey, a Jerry Judy jersey, and a Trey Nixon rookie to 75. Uh, Rye, for this uh, for this break, it's 115 a spot, um, but I do mixers all the time um, in all different sports. The Terrace Marshall is a dual jersey uh, um, auto rookie. It's the RPA uh, number to 149. But uh, yeah, my mixers, I can usually do them as cheap as like... I usually do them about as cheap as like 115 to as high as 200. Uh, we're going to go with the Terrace Marshall first, the guilty. So Marshall off the board. Uh, so at two, it is Sharkbiter. Take the OA. All right. To 25. Still better than getting fourth, I guess, though, right? Uh, no, Ry, that I just pulled that for uh, S board. All the stuff up here, that one's mine. I always put one of my cards up here. But um, all this stuff is stuff that I pulled for other people today. All right, at three, it's Woody. You've got the Willis, the <coughs> excuse me, the Landry to ten, the Tony, the Judy, and then the Nixon. Thought so. Thought that was kind of a no-brainer there. Thought those first three were pretty much no-brainer picks. So thank you, Woody. Uh, we'll make you a slip as well. And then Nam, where are you going at four? The Landry to ten, the Tony, the Judy, or the Nixon? Landry to ten. Okay. And then Quidge, pick two. Nixon, Judy, Tony. One second, let me just uh, put the Landry over in Nam's stack here. So you've got the Trey Nixon rookie to 75. Jerry Judy, Gold Rush jersey to 299. And then the Kadarius Tony newly minted jersey to 299. 85 of 299. Two rookies. Okay. And then Judy goes to Nam. All right. And that will do it. Okay. Not our best box, I'll be honest. Not going to lie. One second, guys. My nose is running a little bit here. <laughs> Definitely Panini. 100%. Okay. Uh, MJ's got a 19 Bowman draft pack. All right, buddy, give me a number. Actually, I got to grab some more. Nope, I have enough out here. Okay, I lied. One, two, or three. Where are we going on 19 draft? Number two. Uh, Ricker, I don't think so. I don't know if I double check. I want to see, make sure I have a purchase here for you. Now, you're up next, buddy. Give me one second. Uh, I just got to run upstairs and I got to get my phone charger before we get into a little battery mode here. Give me one second, guys.
Folks, I am back. Charger in hand. Oh no. Sorry guys, that's exactly what I was trying to warn. <laughs> warn you guys about. It black screen because it went to low power mode. But that will be gone in two seconds here. Alright, we should be good now. Uh, Aqua Max was for Namtip as the driver of the day, Mexico. Okay. All right. Ready, MJ? Ready. Cool. Make you a slip for today. So much stuff on my desk. Ah, it's a disaster. There we go. All right, a slip. And Bowman draft time. All right, good luck, bud. Got either an auto or a numbered card coming. All right, India, Heinz, Strumpf, Gorman, Manoa first, Little, Nice Jung first, Cairo, Johnson, Nova, Cantorino, Armenteros, Ortiz, Robertson, Gorski, Baker, Mears, Adams, Thompson, Downs, Goss, Waters, and Shoemake. Jeter Downs Chrome, JJ Goss Chrome, and I like that. Nice Wander Refractor. Followed by Ryan Zephyrjan Refractor. Futures of Rushman and Gunnar Henderson. I think we got an auto. We do. Ryan Garcia. Fiftieth overall pick. Brewer Hicklin, Hunter Bishop Chrome, and Kyle McCann Chrome. The pride of Sierra Madre. Is that true? It's got to be, right? Why would you say that? He enjoys playing video games. It's almost like he's a teenage boy. What? <laughs> no problem, MJ. Thank you. Oh, that's awesome. All right, Ricker, you've got Father's Day times two, so give me two numbers, one through 18 here. I played against uh, Todd Frazier growing up. They whooped our ass. The year after they won the um, Little League World Series. But one through 18, give me two, Ricker, on Father's Day, Day of the Faja. There he is, he's back. There's Ricker, that's who we're looking for. Uh, one through 18, buddy. And Rush, my man, I gotta talk to you, buddy. Uh, give me one through 18, pick two on Father's Day, Ricker. <coughs> and Rush, <I'm coughs> oh man, coughing up a storm here. Uh, five, okay, give me one more. And two. Rush, everything I sent you came back. I had three packages and then the one I was holding, so I've got like an entire uh, month's worth of your stuff in my office right now. So I'm going to send you an email, um, and we got to figure out what the heck's going on with the, um, whatever UPS is doing with your address. 
Yeah, I will. I just uh, I just got into the office today, and they gave me the other two that came back, and I was like, all right, now I don't know what's going on. So um, I'll look into sending it to USPS. We'll try it that way as opposed to UPS, and we'll see how it goes. But I'll send you an email on it uh, as soon as I get off stream today. So, All right, Ricker, here we go, buddy. George Springer. The guy's having a hell of a run right now. He is hot. And Westbrook. No problem, buddy. No problem. Just want to make sure it gets to you, so. Pack two is Haley Deegan and LeBron James. A couple good names in there. We are on a cold streak, though, for uh, numbered cards. I feel like we're going to hit, like, five in a row out of the Father's Day packs. Well, thank you for that, buddy. I appreciate the purchase. And Papa G is up with Leaf Sig Series. All right. Where are we going, buddy? One through... I think I've got eight over there. Number two. And for those of you guys that have not done so already, i got a couple new features here on the Loop app, which allow you to follow my channel. So if you enjoy the stream, um, all you got to do is at the top of the screen, tap on my name um, in the channel, and then hit the little bell icon, and you'll get notified every time I go live. And you can also give me a follow at Buffs Breaks on Instagram, YouTube, and Twitter. Uh, you get different content from all three. Um, and hopefully, hopefully, fingers crossed, if I can get a, a couple things moving in the right direction here, I'm going to start putting out some YouTube content for you guys. But we'll see. i gotta, I got to find a videographer that's in my price range that can help. And mm -hmm, empanadas. That's all I want in life. I had these empanadas once in Puerto Rico. Um, and no joke, I was there for five days. I ate them three times a day. That's all I had with the empanadas. They were so friggin' good from this little food truck. Oh, my God. I've been, uh, I've been chasing like that that flavor parade ever since and I've been unable to replicate so but so good oh my god they went out of business in the, during the pandemic so it made me very sad um, this little food truck oh god they were so good all right one on one auto for Mr. Papa Giorgio who's it gonna be Hmm. I don't recognize that autograph. It's a little bit shaky, though. I'm going to say this is an old person. Ooh, it's Juan Marichal. Oh, dollar mollies. Wow. Nice Marichal, 101. For Papa. Stockton's making a play here. <laughs> trying to get in on the Marischal love. I don't blame him. Guy was nice. You are very welcome, Mr. Papa Giorgio. Ziggy's got some mega boxes. All right, Zig, give me a second. Let me grab those. Okay. Uh, give me two numbers, one through six, bud. My choice. Give me one second. There we go. Move this around. There we go. Okay. We'll go two and three. What's up, Four Eyes? Uh, I didn't put the select basketball break in the store yet. Um... You know what, I'll add it in because if we fill it, um, it's random team anyway. So I'm just going to put that in the store at the bottom. You're the, you're, there's been a couple people that have asked. So. Let me add that into the store.
one second here. All right, so that is at the bottom of the basketball section. For those of you that are interested, it is a 10 spot break. It's uh, random teams, so you do not have to be present for it. Um, as soon as it fills, we will go ahead and do it, but it is at the very bottom of the basketball section. You'll get three random teams and a hobby box of, uh, excuse me, a hobby box of select basketball. So that is at the bottom. I will actually, let me just get a card set up for that. That way I can do it as we go. Okay, card is set up for basketball. All right, Ziggy, good luck. Starting off with Ben DiNucci in a club level red. Very nice. How about Jalen Hurts? Club level red die cut rookie. Followed by Select Certified, Cam Akers, and Makai Becton. I like that pack. The Hurts Parallel and uh, the Becton doesn't have a lot of stuff. And I like Cam Akers, too. What's up, Jakey? Antonio Gibson. And another red. It is TJ Watt. Hot Stars, JJ Watt. So many Watts power an entire battery and a Christian McCaffrey premier level so thank you Ziggy very nice hurts there very nice I like rookie parallels of quarterbacks that are shiny um Sarah I have total I think I got like eight total boxes of select team all football here I only put five in the store but I think I have like eight total DJ Watt, unless he is. <laughs> Alright, that brings us to... Oh, Four Ice has got a banger. Okay, nice. Alright, Four Ice. Uh, top row or bottom row on the bangers? And then a number one through four. Alright, top four. Okay. Okay. <laughs> Uh, J Money Raw, I think that card's probably maybe, I don't know, 60 bucks shooting from the hip. I know what they're worth in PSA 10s, <laughs> but because I have a bunch. <laughs> but Raw, I'd say they're probably 60, 75 bucks. Somewhere in that range would be my guess. All right, Four Eyes, here's your banger. You're starting off with ITG Used Hockey, Ringleaders, Dual Jersey. One of the goats, Mark Messier, seven of thirty. Next up is Onyx Nimbus, Drew Waters, on card black border rookie auto that is short printed to twenty five. So nice Drew Waters rookie auto on card to twenty five, and. You didn't get a pack. You got a whole box. Top Super 70s Baseball. So let's see what this box has for us here. Full box. One of, uh, I think I had two full boxes that I included in here. This was one of them. And again, stay tuned tomorrow. I will have uh, Baby Bangers cheaper option available will be baseball only for tomorrow's bangers but yeah
Come on, Don Sutton. This is, look at this. This does not, not want to come out of his home. Don! Okay, there we go. Top Super 70s. Don Sutton, Aaron Judge, Dale Murphy, Mike Schmidt, Alonzo, Tim Raines, Garrett Cole, Bob Gibson, Mookie, McCovey, Jim Palmer, Babe Ruth, Willie Mays, Steve Garvey, Scherzer, Harper, Reggie, Alan Trammell, and... Harold Baines, I'm assuming this is like the 1975 parallel, or I'd have to look. Oh no, I lied, this is an insert called Happening Hairdos. And that is a nice little fro, a little under hat fro you got going on there. Followed by Spectacular Spectacles, Jeff Burroughs. Look at those rec specs, hot. That is Spectacular Spectacles, <laughs> number one. And I am not surprised <laughs> that that is the first card in the set. Hairdo's number five on the Banes. So, interesting little uh, box there. So, thank you, Four Eyes. Banger's always fun. Never cease to amaze. And hot damn on those Rex Specs. <laughs> Uh, some, if you have the Tiffany Barry Bonds, yeah, but not, not, not much, Jay Money. It's a very, uh, very small amount of, uh, things from 1987, outside of Fleer Basketball. But you might have a couple football cards, and, um, like I said, I know the top's Tiffany Baseball, especially the Bonds traded. We'll bring you a couple bucks, but that's probably about it. All right, we've got... Where are we? Oh, S-Board's got another uh, Chronicles Draft. Nice. Okay. One through five, S-Board. Where are we going on these? What's up, J-Will? D-Hurley? Number four this time. Okay. Where'd I put those packs? Oh, give me a second. I gotta find where I put them. I have to reorganize the table tomorrow. Too many new products that I opened that are not... Not, uh... Not in there, a little alphabetical, numerical uh, spot. And I just have no idea where I put stuff. Hmm. Enter. There they go. Okay. What number was it? Number four. Okay. Number four. There we go. Much better. Uh, board, let me take a look and I will let you know. Let me take a look. I got I to gotta look at the numbers there and I'll let you know. Ooh, Trevor Lawrence. Score, very nice. Jamie Newman. Don Russ and Najee Harris from Prestige. Chuba Hubbard, 83 of 149. Score red parallel. <laughs> it's funny. Bonds from Traded. Um, good year for Fleer Baseball. I, I wouldn't say there really is a good year for Fleer Baseball. <laughs> um, it just kind of whatever. Zach Wilson status. Travis Etienne XR, Nico Collins from Spectra, and I like that. Trevor Lawrence, Optic. Rated rookie, very nice. So two Lawrences in that pack, including the Optic, but fortunately it's got some damage here to the back right corner. Just peeling a little bit, so not as bad as it just looked, but it's not great. So. <coughs> Excuse me. But still very nice pack there. 
Um, and into the pile it goes. Before you board. Let me uh, just double check on that question for you about NT. You said NT baseball you were looking at? I'll do it back for you in one second, buddy. I just want to check on NT baseball for you. Um, what do I have? What's NT Baseball in the store at right now? 1075? Um, I can do the NT Baseball in a pack of the White Sparkles at... I can do that at 11. 1100. So 25 bucks. If you, if you get the NT, 25 bucks and I'll give you the White Sparkle. Um, so if you want to do that, just let me know, and I'll go in and I'll I'll adjust the items for you. <coughs> okay, give me half a second, and I will do that. Let me show you what that pack was that you missed. So you hit very nice optic Trevor Lawrence, rated rookie. Uh, did have a little imperfection here on the corner though, in the top right corner. Nico Collins Spectra, Etienne XR, Zach Wilson Status, uh, Chuba Hubbard, score red to 149, Najee Harris Prestige, Jay, uh, Jamie Newman, and then a, another Trevor Lawrence from regular score. <coughs> oh, man. Dry cloth is getting me right now. Woo. Okay. Give me one second, guys. I just got to adjust that price for S board, and then we'll get back to the queue with uh, Skizos up with Super Jumbo next. Just give me one second here, guys. Prism and National Treasures. I get so excited whenever I see Prism, and then <laughs> every single time it's the wrong year of Prism. Soul crushing. There it is again. Wrong one. Meh, meh. Okay. So I just changed the National Treasures baseball box for you, so it's going to say at the bottom... It's going to say National Treasures uh, Baseball Box plus uh, Prism White Sparkle. So that is at the bottom of the baseball section now. So you can just go ahead and grab that. And I just got to find the other Prism just to delete it. That way we don't oversell by accident here. And then that'll be all good to go. And then we'll go, uh, get back to the queue here. There it is. Okay, so we're all good to go on that. And Schizo's up now. Super Jumbo, buddy. What's up, Moody? Uh, Schizo, give me number one, two, or three. On uh, Super Jumbo here. Catch, Jay, Hammy, Craig, Kiss, all these guys. Thank you guys for popping in. My pick. All right, we'll go. Uh, we'll go in the middle here. Make you a slip for today. Go in the middle for super jumps. All right. Good luck. Do the top half first here. 
All right, paper prospects. Lodolo, Cruz, Lofton, Akram, Lodzinski, Ragsdale, Bitsko, Cabar, Witt, Hover, Hankins, Hines, Gilbert, Howard, Larnich, Hassel, Ramos, Nicholas, uh, Hoffman, Sacconi, Duran, nice Garrett Mitchell first, Zamora, Drohan, Cassie, Blomgren, Carter, Hernandez, Barnhart, Cantillo, Hose, Jung, Swaggerty, Knack, Gill, Romo, and Bedell. A Levi Prater, Sky Blue Paper, 409 of 499. And Refractors. Takoya Roby first, Jared Jones first, Bailey Horn first, and uh, Justin Lang first. Glimpses of Greatness insert, Nick Gonzalez. And 20 and 20, Heston Kerstad. Chromes, McCambly, Ashby, Norris, Dominguez, Ryan, Rutherford, Franklin, Swaggerty. <coughs> Excuse me. Lee, Vientos, Williams, Acker, Mladzinski, Ragsdale, Bitsko, and Cower. So uneventful first, uh, first half there, the top side. Bottom side, papers of Tolentino, Swinney, Volpe, Polkovic, Jarvis, Balzovich, nice Nick Gonzalez first, Wells, Blakely, Green, Green, Criswell, Raya, Burns, Goss, Seymour, Jackson, Burleson, Blade, Carroll, Boz, Tucker, Chamberlain, Britton, Van Eyck, Strider, Schuster, McClanahan, Infante, Isbell, Phillips, Parker, Haskin first, Miller, Davovich, Crochet first, Torkelson first, and Jeter Downs. Refractors of Joe Boyle first, Logan Allen first, Will Klein first, and Owen Cassie first. Franchise Futures, Veen and Romo. Chromes of Knack, Gill, Bedell, Romo, Miller, Davovich, Crochet first, Edwards, Jarvis, Balzovich, Nick Gonzalez first, O'Neill Cruz, Nick Lofton, Tolentino, Swinney, and Volpe, and we got a Refractor Auto. All right, Refractor Auto to 499. Good luck. Carson Ragsdale from the Phils, the Fightins. It is 160 of 499. The third, fourth round. I thought it was third rounder. Fourth round from South Florida. High strikeout guy. Low walk guy as well. So stands six foot eight. Big guy on the mound. The Carson Ragsdale. So, thank you, Skiz. I love opening Super Jumbo because I love the uh, the potential for the huge hits there out of the, the Chrome Auto per pack. But my throat does not like it. Very strenuous on my voice box. <laughs> not much, Jay Money. Uh, you're not going to have much worth anything in that, uh, that era. So... Maybe a nickel, if you're lucky. All right, Rickard's got two more. Or sorry, one more Father's Day pack. Give me another uh, number, buddy. One through, I think, 16 now. Number five. All right. Uh, probably not from the years that you're talking about, Jay. Not much of anything. You really only need basketball from the uh, the late 80s. All right, Ricker. Let's see if we can find one of these damn numbered cards that have been eluding us. We cannot. Anthony Davis, but we did get another rookie. And that's a good one. Anthony Edwards. Very nice. I will add that to your pile, bud. Hey, Craig, you still in here, buddy? Craig Sandlin? Calling Craig Sandlin. You still in here, my friend? All right, Diggett's going Trinity. One through four, buddy. Number two. All right. I'm going to... uh. Pop in, see if we can get a nice little audience here for um, our NT break.
Okay. Number two. Oh, yeah, Moody, I was just, um, we're doing an NT personal box here for baseball, pretty expensive box in a couple minutes, so I just wanted to throw out if, uh, if Craig wanted to do a push. I don't know when the last push was or anything like that, but if it's been a while and you need, uh, need a reason, that might be a good one to throw out there, so I just posted it in the Discord. All right. <laughs> oh, welcome back, Bethany. Um, Bethany from the Dolphin List, coming back. I got your four packs of Ginter here, so we'll do those next after uh, after this for Dig It. I don't know if we can do better than we did last time on these, to be honest. I'm sure you guys saw most of you guys follow me, um, but I put the picture of the jumbo patches all together on uh, on Instagram. I actually had to leave some out. I had to leave out the Filthy Zach Veen and the Corey Abbott logo. I could only uh, fit about six in there. So, that box was nuts. Alright. Looks like we got three jumbos, including our bottom card. I like that. Love the bottom card being a jumbo. Alright, I gotta pull this off for one second to get the stickers off. Yeah, I uh, I situated the picture so I had the giant uh, guardian head, not, not an Indian head, a guardian head facing the giant cardinal. It was pretty good stuff. I, uh, I thought it looked, uh, looked real nice, so. Alright. There we go. Okie dokie. Let's make, a, let's make Dig it a slip for today. Okay, here we go. Starting off with the clear. Purple, 7 of 30. Nice one, Micah Bell. From the Phils, 15th overall pick. Jumbo patch, numero uno. That is AJ Vukovic. Diamondbacks, very nice patch there. The base version, unnumbered, but believed to have a print run of 99. They should have just serial numbered them. Another one, base, right? Ooh, I like this. Casey Martin, look at that Phil's patch. Hello. <laughs> I was this close, Scythe, so close to doing it, and I, <laughs> they had to talk me out of it. <laughs> so, a very nice Casey Martin there. Ooh, I think this is going to be the lowest numbered card I've ever pulled from a Trinity box this year. This has got to be the five or a one of one. It's like a hollow silver. Leody Tavares, the question is one of one or one of five? It's the five. So nice. Leody Tavares, the five. I like that. Depends on what set it's from, money. Depends on what set, but I mean, you're probably looking at at least a thousand bucks for a Brady Auto for most of them. Uh, but you can check eBay, buddy. Go to eBay completed listings, or you can use 130point.com and you can get an idea of. Uh, of values. That's going to be your easiest way to look at stuff. Next up, CJ Van Eyck. 39 of 50 on the Platinum. You're welcome, buddy. And alright, it's going to be the 50. Usually the best name in the box is the last card in the box here in Trinity. And if uh, those of you are coming in looking for the NT box, 
be a couple more minutes. Just stay tuned, and we'll be right there. But in the meantime, let's take a look at 75 of 75. Ooh, I like that a lot. Peter Crow Armstrong, look at that patch. Looks like a Futures game type patch, would be my guess. So you can, I can clearly see it says 2017, and it's got the Arizona Fall League logo over here. So yeah, it's either got to be a Futures game or a spring training patch. You think spring training, Moody? You don't think it's like an Arizona Fall League or a Futures game? Interesting either way. First time we've seen one of these in uh, in Trinité. So, nice box. Undies patch, obviously. <laughs> All right. That takes us to, so we got... D. Stroud's got a uh, stadium club, Chrome, and then a Valiant. Then Rush is a national convention. Views has got an archive signature, and then we got the National Treasures box coming up right after that. So, Stroud, um, you can take your pick, buddy. I have two packs left over from the last box, or I can open a new box and mix these in. What would you like me to do? You want you want these ones, Shroud? Or do you want me to open the new box? Okay. So that's for Stadium Club. And then for our other one for you, it was the Valiant Holiday. So give me a number one through five on Valiant Holiday. Number four, okay. I actually have to grab a couple more of those. Pack number four. There you go. All right. We will start with Stadium Club Chrome. Good luck. And NT coming up in about three more minutes here, folks. Stay tuned. Eduardo Rodriguez, Brandon Nimmo, nice Hank Aaron. Ted Williams, and, oh, I like that. Check out that Kershaw. That is so cool. That is actually awesome. And the Upton, that might be it. Yeah, so 1 in 113 for the Wave Refractors. Very rare. Um, print run probably of 10. Unnumbered, but it's, uh, it's half as rare as the red. So, that is an awesome card. And it's probably short printed to 10, would be my guess. Pack 2, Luis Arise, Kyle Lewis rookie, very nice. Kevin Ginkle, Bean Team, Scherzer. <coughs> Musel, and Gary Sanchez. <coughs> oh, wow. I need to get a water. We'll do it after National Treasures. Holiday pack. So two Leaf Valiant autos per on this one. Starting off with Will Wilson, orange. We'll check the serial number in just a second. And Nolan Gorman, very nice. Ten of thirty five on the Gorman and twenty nine of thirty five on the Wilson. Uh, I have a full box. I just um, I didn't list any just because they're a pain in the butt for me to ship by the full box. <laughs> so, it was kind of selfish on my part. Um, but I can I can th plug it in there and let you know what I'd have to do um, for a full box price. You're welcome, Stroud. They are not the easiest things to ship with the box toppers and the minis. They're kind of a pain in the butt. Well, they're not kind of a pain in the butt. They are. They're a giant pain in the butt. <laughs> I'll, I'll do it, buddy. If you want it, I can do it. It's not. It's not the end of the world. Um, I think it would probably be like right around like one fifty-five or so a box. But all right, let me do 
Views is up here, or sorry, Rush is up with a National Convention Thin Pack. <coughs> so one through 10 on that, Rush. And then Views, give me a number one through three on Archive SIG, and then it's National Treasure Sign. News says two, perfect. And Rush says two, all right. Two on the thin for Rush. Archive SIG for views. Number two as well. All right. Boom. Okay. Thank you guys some slips and then it's national treasure time after this folks what's up courtside we're hanging buddy Susie oh Ryan Lowe's in the house you're the worst Ryan heck yeah buddy all right and views okay slips are made Let's do it, Rush. Good luck. So, haven't hit an auto yet out of any of the thin packs. I'd love to see it. I'm mean, gonna pull a lot of nice stuff, but no autos as of yet. All right, starting off with a Classics Legends. That works. David Beckham, three of 25. Oh, I like that. And that works as well. Justin Herbert, 35 of 50. National Convention packs just never let us down. Would have loved to see some ink bell on one of them. You're getting sleepy. Very, very sleepy. All right, views. Archive SIGs, let me make sure it's 2021, correct? Okay, correct. 2021. And then after this, we got the National Treasures and Prism White Sparkle Combo for S Board. All right. Looks like. like a Topps Big League card, I think. It is Topps Big League. Okay. Good luck, buddy. Brandon Lowe, rookie. I think 6 of 43. I lied. That's 2020 Big League. I thought it was 2019. <clears throat> 6 of 43 on the Brandon Lowe. Not your cousin, Ryan. <laughs> and yes, we do have a personal uh, NT box coming up. So thank you, views. Appreciate that. Love archive sigs. First time we've seen a big league card be used as a buyback, though. Okay, it's time. NT baseball box. You ready, board? That's the last white sparkle pack. Let me grab a, a case of this stuff here. All right, it is time. Empty baseball case. You guys can't see, but there it is. All right, where are we going, S Ford? Give me a number one through four. Where are we going? Number three. Okay, so obviously we're going to start off with the White Sparkle Pack. Obviously. Have to.
All right. Starting off with Keston Hira. Ooh, shinies. This is my last white sparkle pack. I think it's my last white sparkle pack from any sport today. I'm going to have to restock on these guys. My boy, Frankie. And I don't think we got an insert here. We do. Instant Impact with Merrifield. Very nice. Merrifield, so underrated. And Lindor, just the best. So happy. Okay, let's do it. I made you guys wait long enough. All right. Just one time, let's just get like a Ruth Auto or a Garrig Auto. Let's just blow the chat up. Just blow up this chat. All right. Well, we're starting off with a nice one. They do. They do exist. They have them. They have cut autos of both of those guys, I believe, in this product. Six-way Game Gear rookie, Gavin Lux, two of 99. Triple jersey, triple bat. Your base jersey, Whit Merrifield, 14 of 99. <laughs> I mean, that's a pretty good uh, analysis of the, the Royals. I'm not going to disagree with it. Another base jersey, Bogarts, 10 of 99. And it should be our last relic. I like that. It's Yogi. 33 of 99. Shout out to my big eared homie. Me and Yogi, ears bigger than our heads. All right, on to the autos. Rookie auto, social signatures, Rico Garcia at Rico Suave. And that is reek, like as in stink. O, and then Suave. Trey Berea, fight finished, signature names, on-card rookie auto, 95 of 99. Got an RPA. Kwang Kung Kim, 57 of 99, Cardinals, on-card. I'm assuming fight finished has to do with the national ch or, uh, the national championship. They um, what's it called? They won the uh, World Series that year, the 2019 World Series. That was the hashtag I think they used after winning. Definitely a Hall of Fame auto here. That's Tom Glavin. 48 of 49. And then our booklet. 
It all comes down to the booklet. It's St. Louis. Ooh, that's pretty nice. Dylan Carlson. Jumbo Patch Auto, rookie booklet, 4 of 10. That's a nice card. <clears throat> Lots of Dylan Carlsons. Yeah, last stream was the uh, entire Cardinals logo head patch. This time, it's the NT Jumbo Debut Booklet. Very nice. Unfortunately, I can't really fit this one on uh, I wanted the stand, so... Awesome Carlson. <clears throat> oh, thank you, board. That was fun. It's been a while since we've done one of those. That was actually a lot of fun. I love NT. All right. Now that I went nice and slow and backed up the queue, <laughs> um, Bethany, I've got your first four packs here of Ginter, and then you have four more. So go ahead and give me four more numbers, one through uh, 12. Okay, so we got eight packs of Ginter here. We're going to learn a lot of stuff together, all of us. Time to learn. Learn about trees and uh, sharks, <coughs> food, all kinds of great stuff. Turner, Billy Williams, Keichel, Nomar, Bianca Smith, Todd Helton, short print. There's another Uncle Larry mini. That is the Allen and Ginter back. And Joe Carter, historical hits. This one we don't need to look up. That's the walk-off World Series game-winning home run. That one we all know about. Don't need to look that one up. Lazardo, one of the Hanson brothers, Jonathan India, Goldschmidt, Jimenez, Edgar Martinez, and John Cruck. That is a short print mini. And Murad George Brett. Ooh, got to frame something. Think we got an auto coming, Bethany. Mize, Sutton, Scoobal, Otani. Be a framed auto, not a framed relic. Framed auto. Come on. Show me a little bit of ink. Nope, framed relic. Okay. It is Anthony Rendon. Bat. Dagger. I think it's so funny. So, square cutout for you to, if you want to touch the bat. <laughs> it's a square cutout on the thing, but it's a round, uh, it's a round bat piece. So, bizarre. Andres. He's the chef. Ooh, and nice. Arboreal appreciation, the Arbutus. Broad-leafed evergreen that can grow up to 100 feet tall, usually with a leaning or crooked trunk that protrudes with twisting upright branches to an asymmetrically rounded crown. That is a lot of, that is a very descriptive first sentence. Like, wow. I thought this, that sentence was going to end like eight different times. Groups of white flowers bloom at the ends of its twigs in April and May, and birds are drawn to these trees for their bright reddish-orange berries. I like berries. Love berries. Big berry guy. All right. Rizzo, Lester, Schmidt, Kim Eng, that is the Marlins general manager, Kirilov, Nick Castellanos, and Mo Vaughn. That is another short print mini. And what did A-Rod do on May 7, 2015? Is that 500th home run, maybe? Oh, no. Longer than that. Wow, it's, he's been out of the... Wow, it's so long. That was his 661st home run, fourth place all time. Wow. 
was May 7th, 2015. I feel like it's been so long since A-Rod played. I didn't think it was seven years almost. That's crazy. Uh, Garrett Crochet rookie, Cabrian Hayes rookie, Correa, Gonzalez, Bissinger, Luis Campusano, Derek Jeter. Nice. Allen and Ginter back on the Jeter. And Deep Sea Shivers, the Sand Shark this time. Though it's jagged teeth, give it a menacing look. The Sand Shark, also called the Sand Tiger, another uh, identity crisis. Are you a tiger or a shark? Is a gentle creature found in shallow waters. They can grow 10 feet or longer and up to 400 pounds with a sandy color that helps camouflage them near the shore. These are the only sharks known to take in air and hold it in their stomachs for buoyancy. Tight. The good old buoyant sand tiger shark. Larry Walker, Willie Mays, Moncada, Ivan Rodriguez, Marcus Stroman, Carlos Carrasco, Eddie Matthews, Mini, and Murad, Blake Snell. Yeah, and they like people. I can, I can get down with that. Tony Gonsolin, Buxton, Joe Morgan, Braylon Marquez rookie, Vlad Sr., Marcus Simeon, Gavin Lux, short print mini, and everyone's favorite, the orange-bellied parrot. Now, just let's let's like take a look here for a second. Does it, anyone see where orange is on this bird? Because it looks like it's on its head, and its belly looks like rather like brownish gray. But apparently this is the orange-bellied parrot. Okay, let's see. Critically endangered bird species. Yeah, it's because it's so rare. It's got a brown belly. The or the brown-bellied orange-bellied parrot. I, I assume that's pretty uh, pretty endangered. Name for the orange splash on their. Okay, I can't. I just can't do this anymore. Orange-bellied parrot. Named for the orange splash on their yellow-green bellies. So they have yellow and green stomachs, which, again, in this picture, no yellow or green on their stomach whatsoever. Or orange. Who writes this stuff? I swear whoever found this bird was colorblind. Has to be. Only explanation. But, uh, name for the orange splash on their yellow-green bellies. Sure, so they say and found exclusively in southern Australia and Tasmania. Only about two dozen of these tiny beauties existed in the wild in 2017. Captive breeding programs have begun to boost the population. Number one bird of the colorblind. Mark Kana, Dylan Carlson. The other Hanson brother, Carlson. Steve Carlson, I think. Nope, I lied. Looks like one of the Hanson brothers. I don't know what's going on. His name would be Hanson, right? I have no idea. But his name's Carlson. He's an actor. But he's dressed just like the, uh, the one of the Hanson brothers that we pulled earlier. So Spencer Howard, Randall Cunningham, Josh Gibson. That is the short print and nice black-bordered short print mini. Roberto Clemente. And historical hits, Roger Maris, October 1st, 1961. Anyone want to guess what he did then? I think I know. That'll be home run number 61. Uh, what product are you guys talking about, Tex? So, fun Ginter stuff. Learning a lot about colors and parrots. <laughs> oh, Sage Premier. Sage isn't my favorite. Not my favorite. I don't uh, like the card quality that, that much, but... Oh, Rawson! Nice. Rawson's back with some national conventions. Four thickies. Later, Bethany. Uh, I gotta grab some more of those, Rawson. Hold on one second, bud. Alright, buddy. Where are we going? One through ten. Two, four, six, eight. Okay. Let's do it.
Uh, Lake Show, not yet. You are right after these. You are up next, buddy. Starting off with, that's pretty good, LaMelo Rookie to 50, 29 of 50. No birds, no birds. <laughs> and Mac Jones, Rookie Patch, Cracked Ice, 21 of 25. Very good pack there. Uh, no spots taken, Ranker. No spots. I put it in because a couple people asked, but then no one bought any spots. So we are at 0 of 10 on selects. Yeah. Yeah, I'd agree. Sad. But the thing is uh, with that one is uh, it's random, so um, you don't have to be present. So if you want in, just go ahead and buy it. And if uh, when we get there, we'll do it. And if not, um, I'll have them send refunds. So. Lou Bob, that is one of 25. He is back now. Him and Eloy back. And nice. Dominguez to 10. 5 of 10 on the JD. On the Escher Squares parallel. Pack 3 to 50. Nice Mason Mount, Euro champion from Chelsea, featuring in his national team uniform here uh, with England. And nice, another one. Second two of for you. This time we got a little jersey number action, one of five. Uh, Logan, these are the 2021 Panini National Convention packs. These are the thick packs that guarantee you a hit. I think we hit the uh, two uh, to ten for you last time, Austin. It's ten or twenty-five. And fourth and final thicky. Our last fatty for Rawson. Ooh, people like her, Haley Deegan, twenty-two of fifty. Still no autos. We have an auto list. I think out of like maybe thirty total packs between thick and thin here. And. Anthony Edwards, boom. Escher Squares, rookie patch, 4 of 10. Awesome. All right, which one do I put on the stand? I think I'm going to go with the Edwards. Yeah, I think I'm going to go with the Edwards. Edwards will be the last card on the stand. For now, until we pull something better. Would have been the Carlson, but that can't fit. All right. Good stuff, Rawson. Thank you, buddy. Make you a slip. And again, if you guys haven't done so, make sure you give me a follow here uh, for the store. Um, all you got to do is click on my name at the top of the stream, click the little bell icon, and you will get a notification every time I go live which is usually three to four times a week. Um, got a lot of cool promotions getting set up here in the next couple weeks. Um, so I will be announcing those as soon as I have them. As well as um, continuing to put out content for you guys on Instagram, Twitter, and YouTube at Buffs Breaks on all of them. So give me a follow. I'll get you a follow back. But uh, board, I don't have any white sparkles left. I don't have any white sparkles left. That was the last pack, but um, I'll tell you what. I'll do the. I'll, I can do this one at ten twenty-five for you, instead of ten seventy-five. Uh, I can get you a price on this on mixing with Sapphire F one. It'll it's gonna be a little bit more expensive than eleven though. I could probably do that combo for like eleven twenty-five. If you want to do a uh, Sapphire S, uh, F1 pack in there. 1025 for the box. You got it, bud. Let me just find it real quick. Actually, I'm just going to add this one in because I, I have more. 
So I'm gonna just add this into the bottom for you. It is at the very bottom of the baseball section. Okay, we are up to, uh, I think it was Lake Show, I believe, here. Let's see who we're on. Lake Show's got a Father's Day pack. Sorry about the wait, buddy. You hear? Lake Show? All right, give me a number one through. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen. 15, 1 through 15, number 9. All right. Make you a slip for today. Appreciate the purchase. Uh, purchase. I think this is your first time here in my stream, so happy to have you checking it out. All right. Let's see if we can finally get a damn numbered card. We've been over like our last 15 on Father's Day packs. All right, we got one. Finally, curse broken. All right, do our back card first. It is nice. Spencer Torkelson, Team USA, and numbered sixty-three of ninety-nine. Going to be the Sunburst parallel that they use in Revolution Basketball. It's Aaron Judge. Very nice. So, nice little pack there for you, Lake Show. You're very welcome. Happy to get off the uh, the schneid there on the numbered cards. It was so long. It was no joke. Like I think it was like 12 or 13 packs in a row. But back on track now. All right. Bethany is on the Dolphin list. She said she had to run. So, she'll be back. Shockwave. Father's Day. Times 2, 1 through 14. Hit me with some numbers. Dealer's choice. All right. We'll go 3-7. We'll do it for Kyle Lowry. There we go. Uh, Vikes, that is from the Panini National Convention Thick Pack. It's a Escher Squares rookie patch, 4 of 10. All that stuff up there is stuff we've pulled today, with the exception of the... I put the back card in the center is always one of mine. Um, but those other ones, all stuff we've pulled today. Let's see if we can bump one of them off with a, a nice auto or 101 here. I told you guys we were going to go crazy on the numbered cards. Got another one. I said we were going to go on a run. I knew it was going to happen. There's no way we went that many in a row without getting one. Put the odds in our favor. 3 of 50 for this uh, one coming up with cracked ice, but... Back card is a rookie, Cole Anthony, and who's it going to be? Oh, that's pretty good. Steph Curry, cracked ice, reverse jersey number, 03 of 50, eBay 1 of 1, obviously. Very nice card. Pack two. I don't know if we're going to be able to beat that one. Anthony Davis. And did we get Lawrence? Is it Lawrence or Etienne? It's one of the two. There you go. What a great set of packs. Kyle Lowry just doing work. My man, Trevor Lawrence. Very nice. Great set of packs. Thank you, Shockwave. 
When in doubt, Kyle Lowry it out, man. 3-7 all the way. All right, Rush has got a fin pack. Hunting for the auto. All right, Rush, one through nine, buddy. Number two. Got to get one. All right. Starting off with 10 of 50. That guy's pretty good. We all hate autocorrect, Susie. I don't think there's a person on earth that, as for useful as autocorrect is, and as much as it saves me from making typos, when it makes me make a typo or say a word that I'm not trying to say, I get so frustrated at it. But Luca Impact, 10 of 50. And, ooh, to five. Maybe an auto? Maybe, who knows? To the five. No auto. DK Metcalf, though. That is a scary, scary man. Four of five. That is huge. And so fast. My God. Like, look at him. He is ripped. Look at his arms. His veins have veins. My God. No joke, I bet you one of his legs weighs as much as my entire body. Good stuff. Thank you, Rush. I think Susie's up now. Susie is up. Oh, she's got a thinny, too. All right, Susie. Yay! <laughs> All right. <laughs> one through eight. What's the lucky number? What's up, Bosco? How you doing, Phil? Number six. And for those of you that don't know, Susie's one of the breakers on here, so make sure uh, after you follow my store, you go and follow hers. I see Susie stream. She's a fan of some of the same products as me, the uh, ITG used uh, and ITG sports group breaks, so always a fun one, so make sure you give her a follow as well. Hey, we all got to help each other out, right? Let's get it. Now I'm going to help you out here and hopefully get you something big. Uh-oh. I think we did it. I think we finally did it. I think we done did it. I told you I was going to help you, Suze. <laughs> I think we got our first auto. Kevin Harvick to 25. And we've never had a backwards card. Cracked ice backwards card in the thin pack. Please and thank you one time. It is green colored. Ah, ah. Just talking about them from the last pack. But now we got some ink. DK Metcalf. There he is again. Four of ten on the Cracked Ice Auto. Awesome. There you go, Susie. And I think that that's going to have to bump uh, Fernando Tatis Jr. here off the podium. Going to have to do it. The Taters is nice, but this is nicer. Uh, it is numbered to 10. 4 of 10, Susie. And now, it's on display. Swanky indeed. Awesome. So due for one of those. Sometimes you just know when it's coming. Feeling it. <laughs> Good stuff. All right. Oh, man, and now we get to do F1 Sapphire. This is, like, the best day of my life. All right, Chance, F1 Sapphire. Uh, it should be at the very bottom board. Last item in the baseball section. 
Chance, give me a number 1 through 12 here. Uh, I think it's 1 through 12. Let me double check, actually. I think it's 12. 1 through 12, I believe. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. Yeah, 1 through 12 on F1 Sapphire, number 4. Did you find it, S board? All right, uh, when I finish this one, I'll go and double check and make sure it went and posted. All right. Starting off with BWT HWA Race Lab, the F2 team. Vertical, Jack Aitken. I think we got another future star is coming. And it's a good one. Very nice. Schumacher. And no color in this one. But finishing off with the award winners, Hamilton and Botas from Merck. So not too shabby there with the Hamilton Botas duel. And the very nice Schumacher rookie. Thank you, Chauncey. Awesome. I love F1. So much. Yeah, his dad was okay at driving things. Like, he was solid, I guess. Mediocre. <laughs> Couple nice uh, sapphire packs today with the Schumacher and then the uh, Verstappen Aqua up there. Albeit not the true rookie, still a very nice card. Um, and let me just double check. I want to make sure that that baseball item is in there for Chauncey. Should be at the very bottom of the baseball section. Should be the the last one in there, the last item. Yeah, it's showing in there for me, bud. The very bottom of the baseball section. Um, here, I'm gonna change it for you. I'm gonna, I'm gonna mark it as Pokemon. I marked it as Pokemon, so I'll just scroll all the way to the bottom of the list, and you'll be able to find it. That way, you don't have to scroll through all the baseball stuff in case it got jumbled up for you. So just go to the Pokemon section, all the way at the bottom. You should be able to find it in two seconds. All right, so that was a nice little run of stuff there. And Rawson's going to get a couple more thicks here. Got one, two, three. All right, four more thicks for Rawson. All right, I got six here, buddy. Give me the numbers. Where are... He's going. What's up, Papa? Marlins, everyone. Welcome back. Got some more thick packs coming your way. I don't know if Rawson's here. Rawson, you here, buddy? Paging the Buckhead Retriever Group. Paging Buckhead Retrievers. <coughs> All right, I'm going to have to mark, uh, mark Rawson down here on the, the Dolphin list. We're looking for Sawny Dog when he pops back in the chat. So we've got Bethany on the list for an archive SIG. And then... Uh, Rawson for four thicks. Alright, so we'll skip Rawson for now, and that's going to take us to. Ooh, Schizo's got a thick. Alright, Schizo. You can go ahead and pick a number one through six. Number two. Okay.
Here we go. I'd like to see ink on one of these. That would be very nice. Nice. So strong. All right. Good luck. Starting off with Joey Logano, 19 of 25. And, huh, this is actually hilarious. We cannot get enough DK Metcalf, can we? Cracked ice patch this time, 7 of 14. So we did Metcalf to 5, the flat, then the Metcalf auto to 10, cracked ice, and now the Metcalf cracked ice patch to 14 and back to back to back packs. It's a very DK kind of day. Thank you, Schizo. I'll add that to your pile. Just gotta find it. Man, it's a little early for me to be getting uh, lost on piles here already. There it is. Still got, I still got a solid seven and seven hours of streaming left to do. Oh boy. It's gonna be a long day, folks. I like this. <laughs> All right, Ben's got uh, two Ginters. All right, Ben, give me uh, two numbers, left, right, one through ten. Where are we going? Let me make you a card today, buddy. I pick. Obviously, we gotta gotta keep rolling with Kyle Lowry. Did us uh, a big solid last time, so we'll go left three. And then right seven. Boom. And then board, were you able to find the, um, the box? There it is. He found it. Got him. Right on cue. That's that sixth sense that uh, we have here in the room. Between me and my people. We just know. All right. That's strange. Very strange, but all right. Glad you found it. I will uh, report that issue, though, to them. Because there have been a, a few very minor and weird like uh, issues with that since the uh, the latest update. So I will, uh, I'll throw that out there and let them know that um, when I added it, I added an item in the stream, it wasn't showing up on or available only all. So if uh, someone else is having that issue, at least we'll uh, be able to resolve it if other people are reporting so thanks for the heads up and if anyone sees anything like that like anything that's going on weird in the app always let me know uh that way i can get the information to them so they can work on uh getting it resolved because i uh i'll have no way of knowing unless y'all tell me all right ben here we go luis patino very nice i like him a lot uh rod carew soffer who are you ben soffer boy with no job huh I don't know. Influencer something. Jokester. Cal Ripken, Walker Bueller, Carlos Delgado, a mini Marcus Simeon. Uh, what's going on on your end, Anthony? Just let me know. And a Murad of Joey Votto. If anyone's having any issues, just go ahead and post. That way I can always report it to them. Brian Hayes rookie, very nice. Carlos Correa, Juan Gon, Luis Campusano rookie, Galarraga, Trent Grisham. Ooh, world's largest. The Antonov AN-225 Raya plane. We're going to have to look at that in a second. And a nice Casey Mize Murad rookie. All right, what's, what's so big about this plane? More than three decades after its maiden flight in 1988. Oh, my God, the year I was born. The Antonov uh, Raya remains the longest and heaviest plane ever built. It stretches 275 feet with a 288-foot wingspan. Again, 288, the month and year I was born. Me and this plane are tight. Um, and weighs about 700 tons. Seven, Kyle Lowry's jersey number. Boom. It was designed to carry Soviet space shuttles. That's Why would a plane need to carry a spaceship? Do I just sign this? Like This car was basically like my life.
crazy. A plane built to carry spaceships. You think you would just like kind of make the spaceship in the area where you would be launching it from, but I don't know. Oh, same thing as S4 and Anthony? Okay, I will be sure to let them know. So just a heads up for everyone then, if you're looking for product, make sure you're in the all section, not the available section. It seems that it may not be a... Uh... I'll sign it right now if you want me to. I don't care. I'll do it. Do you want a quick graph? Oh, yeah. All right, we're graphing. Okay, it's on. Mm. All right, let's see. You even got an, inscri an inscription. To Ben, you're a legend. Boom. <laughs> there it is. The Antonov Ryoplane. Oh, and obviously a quick little uh, one of one. Duh. Need that. Bam! <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, that's funny. I'll be so happy, man. If he got 10 grand plus for that, whoo! Do you know why? Because that means every time I just give a little scribble, I'm getting paid. <laughs> uh, Logan, I pulled the Lewis Hamilton... F1 Sapphire Red Variation that sold for 46000 That's the best card I ever pulled for myself. And it wasn't even close. That was mine. I don't think I ever pulled a card for myself over $1,000 until that one. So, and I've been doing this since I was like 8 years old. Alright, Rush. Thin Pack. Yeah, I love F1. It's my favorite. Number 2. Yeah, F1 is crazy. If you uh, haven't, <laughs> if you don't know, look it up. Uh, you're missing uh, a lot of fun stuff. And it's so much fun to watch. The sport itself is great, too. So. Oh, I think we did it again. I told you guys we were freaking due. I said we were due. I'll show you in one second, Ben. This auto is going to be a little bit more important, I think, than mine. <laughs> All right. So right now, 47 of 50, Dominguez. And a cracked ice auto. I think this is upside down. Yeah, okay. Cracked ice auto. It's Lewis. Lou Bob, 7 of 10. Awesome. Pretty good pack. Great stuff. And two never fails. You said it. And you meant it. And then you backed it up. And here's your, uh, here's your Ginter Auto. You're welcome, buddy. I'm just happy uh, Robert's back. Back and playing. That White Sox lineup is absolutely stacked. Welcome back, Sharkbiter. Ollie, what's up, man? Uh, da -da -da -da. All right, Skiz, you got the last thick pack I had in the store. So, one through five, Skiz, where are we going on the last thick one? I'll check and see. Number two again. Hmm. Okay, I will, uh, I will let you guys know, or let everyone uh, know about the issue with the available items. Check the All tab, guys, because um, I do have 786 items for sale, so definitely more than 370. <laughs> 
All right, Skiz. Forty-five of fifty. It's Kyrie Irving. And ooh, that's neat. I was not expecting this. Five of twenty-three, Don Mattingly. Legends cracked ice and game worn to boot. We hit the Nolan Ryan the other day. I do like the legend stuff, and Mattingly, super popular, sells very well. Another awesome pack. You're welcome, Skiz. And I'm going to check real fast, guys. I think I have like two or three more thick packs left total. Um, so let me just check, and I'll add those into the store. I don't have a lot, but I think I have a couple over here still. Two. I've got two more left thick packs. So I'm just going <coughs> to add those into the store real fast. Okay, so the last two of those are in the store. And that takes us to views. Oh, I like these. One of my favorite products, the 18 Bowman Chrome National Packs. Hitting every other pack here. Let me actually grab a couple more for you to choose from, bud. Hold on one second. All right, hit it with a number, one through six, views. Where are we going? Number five, all right. Good luck. Every other pack here, the numbered Carter and Auto. Starting off with Quentin Holmes, Ahmed Rosario, rookie card logo, Matt Olson, and very nice Cody Bellinger. So miss the numbered auto pack, but a very nice second year Bellinger to go with the Ahmed Rosario and Matt Olson. I think the only autos, ironically, the only autos we ever pulled out of that were two Manny Machados. We get the one of one and then like another one to ten, I think. All right, S-Board's got the National Treasures Pokemon box coming now. <laughs> All right. Here we go. We're doing it again. NT Uno Mas. Hit me with the number, buddy. Number one. Okay. Let's get some uh let's get some good vibes flowing. Let's get the everyone bust out your emoji game. Let's get some uh clovers, some money bags, uh prayer hands, rocket ships, um the little smiley face with the dollar sign for a tongue, fire emojis, let's get them let's get them out there. Fingers crossed, let's get them going. Going and flowing. Board needs it. Goats, there we go. I like that, Frank.
There we go, there we go. I like that. All right. Starting off with a very, another nice Game Gear. Uh, Hobby, I'll tell you about the bangers right after this. Starting off with another nice Game Gear. You hit Lux last time, and one of the only ones better in the set for the rookies is this guy. It's Bo Bichette. Guilty, this is 2020 National Treasures Baseball. 57 of 99 on the Bichette. Triple jersey, triple bat. Next relic is a Jack Flaherty Game Gear Duel, 40 of 99. Should have two more relics, I believe, incoming. Maybe three. Base jersey or bat, Anthony Rizzo, 81 of 99. And 80 of 99, George Brett. Base materials. I think one more relic here. Nope, auto. That's a neat one. Colossal. 38 of 99, J.D. Davis. The two-color, uh, <coughs> excuse me, two-color Astro swatch. Acetate, rookie auto, rookie patch auto, I believe. Three of 25. Is that Nick Senzel? Oh, no, it's Shogo. Shogo. Three of 25 on the camo acetate. Surprisingly enough, I still sell his uh, his cards. Every single time I list a Shogo, I always sell it. So, nice card there. Another RPA. Good Pokemon, right? Michael King. That is the gold 7 of 49. I think this one's going to make you happy, though. Another RPA. Hmm. Whose last name has an E in it? Hmm. A blue E. I don't know. I think it's maybe that guy from the Blue Jays Boba Shed. 30 of 49. Half of a nameplate. Letter E. Bobachette. RPA. There you go. Only a career 300 hitter at age 23. Who cares? Piece of cake. That ain't hard. Alright, we're going to have to bump someone for this card. I don't know who we're going to bump yet, but I'm going to figure it out. And our booklet. Ooh. It's Brooklyn. So we got an old school Dodgers booklet coming at you. Brooklyn Dodgers. Duke Schneider. Legendary Jumbo. I would have loved to see a Jackie. Legendary Jumbo Materials, 18 of 25 on the Schneider. Ooh, who do I bump? I think, I think I'm going to take the Fisk off. Fisk is going down.
What is the toilet paper reference here? I don't get it. I don't. I don't know this about Duke Schneider. Oh, are you just talking about the, uh, the the swatch being plain white? All right, we're bumping one of S Board Cruise cards for another one. So thank you, buddy. I appreciate it. Hope you're happy with that bow. That is a very nice one. Real nice card. All right, on to Hobby Boss. 18 Optic Football Fat Pack. Top or bottom, buddy? Where are we going? Hobby says top. Top, please. <laughs> so polite. Love it. Scholar and a gentleman. I had so many of these, down to two left out of like 70. I don't know if I'll be able to restock on these. Oh, so the, the Buffs Banger is basically what it is. It's um, it's multi-sport. It's going to be two singles. Love you, two butters. Uh, it's two singles and then a sealed product, um, pack or a box. Uh, but they're all market value. So everything, the, I think the worst one that I put together at the time of me putting it together was about $80 worth of stuff. Um, and the most expensive were about 150 so um, I was pretty conservative on my pricing too. So I would say almost all of them uh, probably get you very close to a hundred bucks at worst. Um, but you know we had uh, they have slabs. So I'll tell you right now, real quick. Out of we had fifty to start, we had seven left. Huh. Well, oddly enough, I have no grade. There are no graded cards left in the last seven. Half of them, over a half of them, actually had graded cards. Um, as one of the two cards, but out of the, se the seven packs left, no graded cards. And uh, I would love some Red Robin Butters. Um, get me. Are you listening? I want a Burnin' Love burger, but sub it for chicken. And you know the rest of the order. Thanks, babe. I'll eat it at 10 o'clock when I get off. But yeah, the, uh, the bangers are very nice. Uh, people like them. Um, at least that's what they've been, that's what they've said. So, uh, at the last, the NT box is uh, over a thousand bucks, a little over a thousand bucks. Uh, yeah, board, give me one second, I'll show it to you. All right, Hobby, here you go. Nice second year Kareem Hunt, Muhammad Sanu, James White, Jabril Peppers, Jay Ajayi, Andy Dalton, Marshawn Lynch, Golden Tate, Devontae Parker, Greg Olson, Robbie Anderson. It looks like we got a rookie pack. Just anything except the insert pack is good. All right, so rated rookie. Can we do it one time? Josh Allen, please. James Washington. Uh, Abe, I will definitely hit you at Hamilton, 100%. So, James Washington, this is a guy, the ultimate touchdown vulture, I feel like, in fantasy. I think someone actually bought it, Hobby. I think someone grabbed it. I thought I saw it come through. Hold on one second. Um, yeah, someone else grabbed it. I'm sorry, buddy. Uh, I think he's going to be nice this year. He's on my list. He's on my list of uh, guys to keep an eye on and see uh, see what his role winds up being this year um, on that team. So, Okay, Chauncey going for 0-2 upper deck golf. Uh, go ahead and give me six, or you can just pick top or bottom, or if you want to pick six different packs, one through 12, go for it. Um... At the National Convention Silver Packs, I do have them. Uh, the thin ones, I definitely still have some in the store. I don't know. Someone might have bought the last thicks. I only had two more. Yeah, the, they're in there. 
the fix should be in there as well, but just make sure you're using the um, all section, not the available section. People have been reporting uh, some issues with the available section, not showing all the items I have. So make sure uh, when you're in the sale items, go to all, not available. But the, um, the last two thick packs I have will be at the very bottom of the three card section. So, oh, let me do the, uh, sorry, board, I forgot you asked for the NT again. Um, so here's your, this was the NT box where you board the second one. So Duke Schneider, Legendary Jumbo Booklet to 25. A Mike King RPA Gold to 49. The Shogo Akiyama Acetate RPA to 25. J.D. Davis, Colossal, two-color to 99. It's a jersey, not a patch. It's um, just the part of the shoulder that changes colors. Uh, Relics, George Brett, jersey to 99. Rizzo Bat to 99. Flaherty Game Gear, Duel to 99, and then the two best cards outside of the uh, the Snyder, I think, and maybe the Shogo, at least best names. Same player, Bo Bichette, Game Gear, six-way, 57 of 99, and then this Bo Bichette gold uh, RPA with half the letter E, 30 of 49, was definitely the, uh, the box hit there. Yeah. That last one is real nice. Real nice. You're welcome, buddy. Sorry if you missed it live. Apologies. <coughs> I had everyone uh, throw out all the emojis, so <laughs> probably got lost in the shuffle there. Um, but Chauncey in here, bud? We're looking for Chauncey. Chauncey, Chauncey. Chauncey foe. All right, there's Chauncey. All right, there he is. Okay, give me... um. Sorry, I'm, I don't know if I missed you. Uh, top or bottom on these? Yeah, there's six packs here. So you can either pick one through 12, or you can just say top six, bottom six, whatever you want. But there's 12 packs on the thing. Top six, okay. Six, and then give me a number on SP Authentic Golf, one through five. Number four. All right, we'll do the uh, O2 stuff first, and then if we hit a tiger out of this, oh my god. All right, so O2. Upper deck golf, looking for some fills and second year tigers. David Bergano, leaderboard. Pin seekers, Rory Sabatini, Colin Montgomery, legends of Chichi Rodriguez. And Jack Nicholas. So you're going to get one card per pack that has silver foil. It's either going to be an insert or a silver uh, parallel. So Pin Seekers is an insert, but the only time you won't get a silver is if you get lucky and we hit a gold to 100, which I would love to see. Leaderboard. Ty Tryon. Stat Leaders insert. Putting. Bernard Longer. Jesper Parnovic, Checklist, Chad Campbell, and Legends, Tom Weiskopf. Nick Faldo, Leaderboard, Chip Shots Parallel, Silver of Nick Price, nice Adam Scott, funny he uh, he lives with a friend of mine's family he that's who they um i can't remember what the what the word is um but he's from australia they were like his oh his host family when he came to america lived with him in upstate new york which is kind of funny um colin montgomery chip shots and mark omira i had no idea they were like oh yeah we live with i live with a golfer i was like oh yeah who is and they're like adam scott and he had like just won like the whatever it was i think it was the australian open or something that he won um, but you been breaking down here? I have, <laughs> I have been breaking. I know. Not, There's not, not that much of a mess. Yeah. Butters says you guys aren't buying enough stuff. There's not a big enough mess down here for me being on for uh, four hours. <laughs> All right. Duffy Waldorf would have been a better golfer if his name was Buffy Waldorf, but you know. Pin Seekers, Steve Stricker, Chip Shots, Dave Gossett, Matt Kutcher, 
And Shigeki Mariyama, New World Order. Where are you, Phil and Tiger? Oh, there's Tiger. <laughs> All right. Brad Faxon, leaderboard. Silver. Frank Licklider, the second. Retief Goosen, New World Order. Jeff Maggart and Raymond Floyd Legends. One more pack to go here. Another Steve Stricker. Leaderboard. Silver. David Toms. Jess Daly. Rocco Mediate. And a New World Order of Sergio Garcia. Right, let's see if we can do a little bit better here with 01 SP Authentic Golf. It's been a long time since I opened one of these. All right, good luck. This is the ultimate <laughs> swing for the fences here. Like the ultimate swing for the fences. Nick Price. Raymond Floyd. Honor roll, Payne Stewart. This might be upside down. And major players, Ian Woosnam. So I do like Payne Stewart. I'm actually kind of curious to see how rare the inserts are. Six authentic stars. Uh, honor roll's not that rare. One in four on the honor rolls. Well, thank you, Chauncey. I appreciate it. The hunt for Tiger continues. Let me find your stack. There it is. Okay. And Boston's up with Father's Day times two. You in here, Boston? Sorry about the wait, guys. I know we're uh, a little backed up right now. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One through twelve. Pick two for me, bud. On the day of the Faja. Ten four. Roger that. All right. Make you a slip. <laughs> My dog's outside eating grass. Such a dummy. All right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. All right. Is it going to rain? I think so. It looks like it's going to rain. Yeah. How is that grass, buddy? Huh? Yeah. Do you have a good snack? A little grass snack? Did you want two patties on Yeah. And then broccoli. All right. The broccoli. Sometimes you want your two. Sometimes Double chicken. All right. Here we go. Good luck, Boston. Did it again. I told you we were going to go on a run of numbered cards. We literally did like 15 packs in a row without a numbered card, and now we're three, uh, three out of the last four packs. So we got a rookie in the back here. No problem, Abe. Isaac Okoro. And, ooh, I like this. It's a Laker. Kobe, maybe? It's going to be the 199. Davis. Ah, Still nice, though. 56 of 199 on the Anthony Davis. on the hollow. And pack number two. 
Juan Soto, and very nice Luca. So two good packs there with the Luca and the number Davis. Thank you, Boston. Appreciate it. Uh, my wallet is what do you guys think should I pay for lunch dinner for dinner butter says she's broke what are our options here should I tell her to go outside and sell some of our possessions on the street corner or do I pay for dinner mmm all right they want to know, they're saying that you could also go ahead and eat the grass outside if you're hungry. And that'll solve all our problems. Who said that? She just dug right into my wallet. I just didn't even care. Didn't even care what my choice was. All right. Yes, that's the one. Oh, they're saying push you to work. You have to break cards. Oh, uh, well, I already you... broke my leg, so. <laughs> <laughs> no, that's funny. All right. All right, BRB. Sounds good. Thanks, babe. Okay, that brings us to... Thank you. You're welcome. Dig it, Scott. Allen and Ginter Chrome. Nice, 2020. Got to open a new box of those. At least an NFT. <laughs> that still drives me nuts. Like I, uh, So, I follow Michaela Marodi on Instagram. I followed her for a while, but... Um, like, I just, like, like... I don't understand, like... I'm just using her as an example. Like, what is the Michaela Marodi NFT? I, I just don't get it. Like, what are you buying that for? You know? I don't understand. I don't get it at all. Like, I'd rather buy a t-shirt, you know? Uh, yeah, I can do that, buddy. As long as no one got one in between. Yep, I can do that. Let me just open up this new box of uh, Ginter Chrome here for you. Sorry about the wait. You guys know I like to talk here. <laughs> Staff, why do we buy it? That's fair. Good call. I'm not going to argue on that one. I'm just here for the factoids, baby. <laughs> All right, so brand new box of 2020 Ginter Chrome. Uh, one through 18, go ahead and drill three. I cannot make that argument. If someone's willing to buy it, there's value. I just feel like I am I am a I am a tangible asset person. That is like I would love to support Michaela Maroney in her life endeavors, but let me get a T-shirt. You know, <laughs> I just want to I want a hat. What hat? And then give me a number on uh, Father's Day: one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One through ten. <laughs> it's all fake internet money. Internet words are not real words. All right. Here we go, bud. Bellinger. And very nice. Anthony Edwards, rookie. Successful Father's Day pack. I like the idea of blockchain being able to trace like where cards go as far as changing hands. But I just still, they still need to be physical, is where I'm at. Hey, Heinze. It's going to rain. My, my little dog, the scared one, is down here. All right. Ozzy Albies. Trey Turner. Yes, we got a weird one. Bugging out. Sweet. Oh, we haven't gotten this one yet. Bugging out. The Tree Hopper. And Austin Riley. All right, sweet. Learned a lot about the spiny orb weaver the other day. Let's see what the tree hopper has to tell us. 
Members of the same family as thorn bugs, tree hoppers are among nature's most bizarre looking spectacles. Those with jutting heads, ant like growths on their backs, and resemblance to a fungus are among the countless varieties of these plant gobblers. Look at that thing. Uh, Jakey, this is 2020, but I do have the, the 2021s up in this B. This is 2020 Chrome, though. We're all about the entomology up in here. Expert on the spiny orb weaver and the large females with spikes. And then uh, fungus-filled tree-hopping plant gobblers. <laughs> all right, Tony Gwynn. An actual refractor of Jose Altuve. Here come the trash can emojis. And back to back, it's Byrne. Steve Byrne, actor and comedian. Taking out Red Bull. <laughs> if anyone ever did that to me, I would just take their phone and I would just, just bitch slap it right out of their hands. Bam, get out of here. The Boatman. So ironic, the Boatman unable to, to navigate in water. Hate that guy. <laughs> uh, I will hopefully have Topps Luminaries, yes. I should have that. No problem. Yuli Guriel, Tramancini Refractor, and Sunny Gray Mini, followed by Max Kepler. So only one fun fact in that batch uh, for our tree hoppers. But thank you, dig it. Appreciate you. And into your pile it goes. <laughs> so, um, that takes us to Jay's Got Select Mega Box. My last contender's box and some elite photos. Okay. <laughs> All right, <laughs> Jay. Give me two numbers. Um, one through four on select red. Is it, you got the packs, right? Oh, no, you got the full box. Okay. So give me number one through three on select red mega box. I will grab contenders because it's the only one I have left. <laughs> no, no, no. Hey, Dixon, what are you guys doing down here, huh? Well, you're not going back out there and eating any more grass, buddy. That's just not going to happen. Number three here. We got number one here. Yeah, you're a good boy. I know you're so handsome. I know. All right, and then elite first off the line. Let me find that. <laughs> Nam. Um, all right. Oh, so I've got six packs of Elite First off the line here. Go ahead and give me uh, four on those. One through six. Where are we going? Give me four. One through four. Okay. Oh, and I think that was everything from your little uh, buffet here. Mega Box Red, Contenders Draft. Oh, actually, sorry. So you you bought one 2020 and one 2021 photo elite. So we're going to do that over. Um, I just want to make sure. Did you mean to buy one of 2020 and one of 2021? Yes. Okay. So we'll do two four on this one. Gotcha. And then 2020 is over here. Uh, one through 10 on those. Yeah, Danny Rick is. <laughs> he's a little, I think he's a little obsessed with himself. It's kind of funny, though. It's all in good fun. All right, we'll start with the photos. 2020 first off the line. Actually, let's, get, let's start by making you a slip. Uh, 
All right. Okay. 2020 first off the line first. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> That's a good slip. All right. DeAndre Hopkins, Lynn Bowden Jr. rookie to $7.99. And I think we hit the gold to 10. I think we did. We did. It's a rookie. All right. Christian Fulton is your first off the line gold exclusive. 8 of 10 on the Fulton rookie. And then Sawney Dog is here. So, Ross, and hang out for a minute, buddy. We'll do your, um, your four packs from before right after this break. It's going to take a minute to get through this one, though. Love these cards. DJ Chark. And Devontae Parker. So that is one of the uh, first off the line exclusive items here from 2020. Uh, all good, buddy. I was uh, I was paging the uh, the Buckhead Retriever Club before, and no one was answering. I was very sad. Stephon Gilmore, Dalvin Cook, Fournette, Metcalf, and full throttle Devontae Adams. Top speed of 20.68 miles per hour. I like these cards a lot too. Should be to 399 or 349. 321 of 349 on the Devante. 2021 Elite Photo. Baker Mayfield. I think we got an auto coming up. Rookie on deck. Devante Smith, Josh Jacobs, Marquise Brown, and. Ooh, this is Jets colored. Pen Pals, can it be? Did we do it, Zach Wilson? No, it's Michael Carter. But that is another one of the first off the line exclusives. Michael Carter. Pen Pals, gold ink, short printed auto to 25. Very nice card. I mean, that was Zach Wilson, would have made the podium. Mike Jacecki, Aaron Jones, nice Elijah Moore rookie, 61 of 399. Jerry Rice and Jonathan Taylor. So good start for you, Jay. Uh, each set of first off the lines got you one of the first off the line exclusives. Let's get into Contenders Draft. Uh, two questions here for you on Contenders Draft Pick. One is, uh, do you care if I only read off the inserts because the base cards are just kind of whatever? And two is, do you want me to send you the base cards? I know a lot of people uh, do not want them. If you want me to send them? I will. If you don't, just let me know. Gotcha. Gotcha, gotcha. I will do that for you. All right. So I'll send you uh, like Mahomes and all the other top quarterbacks. Campus Legends, Metcalf, Kellen Mond, Rashad Bateman, Nico Collins, Kadarius Toney, Russell Wilson, and a nice auto to start, Asante Samuel Jr. Followed by a campus ticket of Jonathan Taylor. Campus Legends of Manning, Numbers Game of Trask, School Colors of Mac Jones, and Number Game Tylen Wallace, School Colors Najee Harris, Campus Legends of Rogers, Campus Ticket Parallel, Roquan Smith, and Brevin Jordan is your auto. Tied in from the U. Numbers game, Greg Rousseau, School Colors of Sermon, Campus Legends of Moss. Numbers game of Devonta Smith, Justin Field School Colors. Numbers game of Rondell Moore, Campus Ticket of Travis Kelsey, and Josh Kennedo is our auto. Defensive end from Florida State. Hey, 
Every time I see that guy's cards, I think of uh, the South Park episode <laughs> with um, the the gaming where Terrence and Philip make uh, Canada, <laughs> and then Stan gets hooked to it. So funny, such a good episode. Zach Wilson numbers game, Jalen Waddle school colors, uh, numbers game of Etienne Elijah Moore school colors, Tom Brady campus legend, Chubba Hubbard numbers game. Derek Carr, Campus Ticket. Was it really? Such a funny episode. Javon Holland. Auto? Friar Muth School Colors. Numbers game, Trevor Lawrence, Mooring Woodward, School Colors, Campus Legends of Lamar Jackson, Numbers game, Javian Hawkins, School Colors, Javante Williams, and auto is Tommy Tagai from Ohio State, Campus Ticket, Ronald Jones, and final pack, Sean Wade, School Colors, Campus Legends of Rice, Numbers game of Justin Fields, school colors of Basham. Numbers game, Trey Lance, school colors, Jamar Chase. Bowl ticket, 32 of 49, Baker Mayfield. And our final auto. Oh, I like that. On card, Kadarius Tony. Uh, Versace, I think it's 10. I think it's eight base and two inserts. And then you're looking for the, uh, the short prints. So nice on card. Kadarius Tony. Okay, give me two seconds here. Let me just filter through your base real fast. And we'll move on to select. So, base I sent you, uh, Herbert, Josh Allen, Lamar Jackson, Rodgers, Burrow, Mahomes, and Breeze. What are you doing, Hines? Why are you facing the wall, buddy? Here. Trying to lay down? Go ahead. Lay down. It's okay. My dog is literally sitting on the couch staring at the wall. I kind of want to show you guys. He's being real stupid right now. I'm going to show you guys. Look at what my dog is doing. Just, what is he doing? Heinz, hey, hey buddy. You don't have to face the wall. You're not in time out. Okay. Do you, buddy. He knows he's in trouble. He's a good boy. He's very handsome. He's a good-looking dog. Um, select packs are 2020 correct. Uh, we did one already, Wags, but um, we can do another one. I can put another one in the store if anyone's interested in doing another uh, gold standard. Uh, it was not a good box, so it was it was bad. Actually, that box it was real bad. I'll throw it in the store. Wag says we got to run it back. I can't say I disagree. All right, 2021 gold standard football hit draft round number two at the bottom of the football section. So. Make sure you're checking the all section, not the available section, guys, because I we've been reported to have some issues in the available section. All the items aren't showing up, so make sure you go to the all section. But at the bottom of the football, you will find round number two of that hit draft. And Wag says, let's go. <laughs> all right, and one more for Jay here. Select 2020 Red Mega Box. So 
we will stack and fly through these guys as fast as possible. Yeah, no problem, WM. I can do them together for you. Don't want to miss that Tiger Auto. <laughs> Man, it does not feel like it's only 4 o'clock. I feel like I've been on for like 8 hours already. <laughs> Alright, there we go. So we're looking at 10 red prisms, 2 coppers to 355, and then... Uh, one of the red prisms will also be a field level die cut, and then hopefully we'll get lucky and hit a silver uh, insert, in addition to, I think, usually two silver base, and maybe an auto or a tie-dye or a zebra if we're lucky. Jerry Judy rookie, Dak, Red, Lawrence Taylor Unbreakable, Igbanaje rookie, Mahomes, Cesar Ruiz premier level red die cut rookie, Jonathan Taylor certified, Dobbins club level rookie, T. Higgins uh, concourse rookie, and there is our field level die cut, Tony Gonzalez, Turbocharged, T. Higgins, Josh Kelly, Premier Level, James Morgan, Base, uh, or Concourse Base Rookie, Sam Darnold, Concourse Red, and a nice Silver Rookie, Clyde Edwards Alaire. Very nice. Cole Pepper, Field Level, Derek Henry, Josh Kelly, Club Level Red Rookie, Hot Stars of Lamar, Cam, Jake Luton, Aaron Donald, Premier Level Red, and behind that, a Premier Level Copper to 355, Jason Huntley Rookie. 3 hundo of 355, Brian Edwards club level, Thielen, Jason Moore, red, Jordan Love certified rookie, Joe Montana, Van Jefferson rookie, Derek Brown, premier level red, and another good silver rookie. Two for two on silvers, this time it's Brandon Ayuk, premier level. Alejandro Villanueva, Palomalu, Nice Emmett Smith club level red, turbocharged Randy Moss, Rodrigo Blankenship rookie, Tyler Johnson rookie, Austin Jackson red rookie, and our second and final copper is a Josh Jacobs 158 of 355, followed by Derek Carr. So reds, not the greatest, but the two silvers were very good. So thank you, Jay. I appreciate that. That was a fun little uh, buffet break there. And that brings us to uh, WM's got the last optic, and he grabs an SP Authentic Golf as well. So one through four on SPA Golf. Let's see if we can just hit like a twenty thousand dollar Tiger real fast. Number two. Uh, there are there should be two more select megas in the store. Just make sure you're searching through the uh, All tab, not the Available tab. The Available tab is not showing up all the items. It's been reported. Um, so make sure you're on the tab that says All. But there should be two more in there for you. All right, WM. And then, Rawson, are you still in here, buddy? Still got your Rawson? I want to do your uh, four thick packs next that we missed earlier. All right. Joe Mixon, Carson Wentz, Rogers, O.J. Howard, Jared Goff, Fournette, Julio Jones, Dalvin Cook, Andy Dalton, Marshawn Lynch, Golden Tate, and our rookie. All right. Another rated rookie pack. Come on. One time. Just give it to us one time. Marquez Valdez-Scantling. It is the receiver back-to-back. -back. First James Washington, and now MVS. Can definitely do worse. All right. Tiger, though. Good luck. One time. One time. 
Fairway great, scary player. Fairway greats, Gene Sarazen. Major players, at least that's a nice one, Jack Nicholas. And Sign of the Times. All right, we got an auto. Uh, I don't think so, Ben. Oh, I did. I missed it. I'm sorry, Ben. My bad, buddy. I will get you next on that one. Totally missed it. Sorry about that. We got an auto, guys. Oh, shit. Auto time. Hmm. All right. In three, two, one. Matt Kuchar. Not bad. Not a bad one. I mean, he's fine. Whew. Sweating it real hard. I've never, ever pulled anything like a Tiger rookie auto in my life. So, uh, three. There's three per box, I believe, autos. So, I don't know. We only had uh, five packs left in inventory, so I just grabbed all of them. So, nice card. I mean, 2001 <laughs> SP Authentic Golf. You don't see these too often, so. Awesome, though. I'll take it. Thanks, WM. Let me find your stack here. There it is. And. Uh, ben, you, let's do your Chronicles pack here. Sorry, I, I missed that in the middle of Jay's stuff there. Uh, give me a number one through, I think I got like 15 over here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. I only have 11, but I'm going to grab a couple more because I know I put more than that in the store. So hold on one second. Oh, yeah, go 1 through 15. I know I put 15 in the store. It says 9, okay. Four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. There you go. All right, good luck, Ben. Calvin Ridley. Well, Michael P. Ryan, Panini rookie. T. Higgins, Panini rookie. Legacy rookie. T. Higgins again. And your teal is Dak Prescott. So, nice Higgins chrome there. And the Prescott Mega Box exclusive teal. And sorry, you got to skip you, bud. Totally missed that. Oh, you're up now, Rawson. I was just, uh... <laughs> There's only four left here. Um, well, these were the four that were left from last time, so I put the last two that I have in the store. So, but... All right, so these were Rawson's four Panini Thick Packs. Good luck, buddy. Let's see if we can pull something that's not DK Metcalf. Starting off with another Dominguez for you. One of 50. Very nice. And, oh, I like that. Legends. Six of 10. Escher Square is Kevin Garnett. So, Dominguez and Garnett to start. Pack two. Another Escher Squares legend here. It's Dale Jr., 4 of 10. And nice, real nice. I think we're going to have to uh, make some room on the stand here because this is a little mellow. Escher Squares, 
jersey number, two of ten. Boom. There it is. And as much as I hate to do it, I'm going to have to bump Max. I love you, Max. But you're getting bumped. Awesome. These are way down, Jake. Uh, Sony had to sign off about, it was made an hour and a half ago. But these are the um, 2021 Panini National Treasure, or Panini National, Panini National Convention Silver Pack Thick. I only have two of them left. Um, they're at the very top of the uh, three pack, or at the very bottom of the three pack section, the little like three card logo section. I don't even know what to call them. But there's only two left in there. And again, make sure you're searching under the all section, not the available tab, as people are having issues uh, seeing everything in the store if they're looking solely under the available tab. So, But yeah, um, both of those cards have come from them, and then this DK Metcalf auto has come from the thin version. One of one. Uh-oh. Sounds good, Baron. I will take care of that. Sorry about the wait, buddy. One of one coming at you. It's Kevin Harvick. Hyper plaid. Boom. Actually, Baron, if you want to wait one second, if it's just on uh, those two packs, I can do them for you here in just a sec. If you got like two minutes, I'll do them right after this pack. And. Oh, how about Messi? Eight of ten. Are you kidding me? What a pack. Harvick one of one, messy to ten. My goodness. Man, I feel like I need to put the messy up there. Bichette's got to stay. Lamelo's got to stay. Who do I bump? Metcalf or Anthony Edwards? I think I bumped the Metcalf. I think Metcalf's got to go back to Susie. <laughs> Bumping the auto. I mean, it's it's messy. You got to put him up there, right? Whew. Man, that is a stellar-looking uh, grouping right there. That's your first message? Damn good one to be your first one. <laughs> Tell you that much. And... Very nice to 50. Travis Etienne, 3 of 50. Um... Almost all of them there, Austin. <laughs> you got 75% of the stand right now. And another nice one. Wow. To eight. Two of eight. Cracked ice. Lamar Jackson triple. Uh, did I say triple? I don't know why I said triple. <laughs> Not a triple. It's three colors. That's what I was uh, trying to articulate there. Poorly, but... Lamar Jackson to eight. What a set of packs. Holy moly. That was unbelievable. Okay, sounds good, Ross, and I will get to them here shortly. Uh, Abe is up with F1 Sapphire. He told me to just go ahead and pick for him. And then I think Baron already left. So uh, those are more expensive. Those were 180. Guilty. Those are the thick ones. Thicks are 180. Thins are like 140 or something like that. Give or take five bucks. I can't remember. Somewhere in that range. 
All right, Abe's set to pick, so I'm gonna let you guys pick. Someone give me a number for Abe's F1 Sapphire here. One through, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One through 11. Wow, you guys both picked three. That's gotta be the one, right? <laughs> I like that. All right. Let's get Abe a slip. And then after that, it's Baron, NYR. Uh, McBean's got a couple, Cheeks, Jake, we got a bunch to go. All right. Here we go. Let's see if pack three is the one. Everyone picked it. All right, no numbered card. Starting off with Maximilian. Driver of the Day, Monaco. Another horizontal. Lando, Driver of the Day, Belgium rookie. Another horizontal. Kyle Malote. I believe F2 runner-up last year. And now the test driver for... I forgot. Ferrari, maybe? Ferrari test driver, I think. And a vertical. Nope, I lied. A horizontal facing the other way. Nicholas Latifi with his highest ever points finish. Seventh in the Hungarian Grand Prix at the Hungaro Ring two weeks ago. So not bad with an Ilote, a Max, and a Lando for Abe. Uh, that pack on a 1 to 10 scale, I'd say would probably be like a 4. Just, it's hard because you didn't get a numbered parallel or a, or a vertical card. Four or five. But you got three good names, so. Three names that I would be looking for, at least. All right, Baron's up with Topps Chrome Ben Baller. So you guys get to pick more packs. Let's get two numbers here, guys. One through... One through eight. For Baron. Throw out some numbers. Oh, no one wants to pick? Wow. Usually, I mean, as soon as I ask, I got 37 numbers in the chat. All right, I'll pick then. Three and seven. Oh, Jakey said four and six. All right, there you go. Jake, wow. Look at you. you two were like on point together. Okay. And then after this, we've got uh, NYRs up with a banger. Nice. Okay. For Baron. Nick Senzel. Charlie Blackman. Ooh, we got a gold coming up. Nicky Lopez and a gold refractor. Hanser Alberto is our gold. One of 50 on the Hanser Alberto. Nice hit gold. And pack two. Glaber. Very nice. Bo Bichette rookie. Good job, guys. A gold and a bow. Rogelio Armenteros rookie. And Alex Bregman. Well done. I think Baron will be happy when he gets a gold and a Bichette in the mail. A lot of bows today. All right, NYR, are you here, buddy? Are you here for the banger? All right, so you got to pick top row or bottom row to start. Top row. Top row, we have three left, so one, two, or three. Number two. Ha! <laughs> ah, this is too funny. <laughs> this is funny. I like this a lot. I think you're going to like this, too. I love when, the, when shit like this happens. This makes me so happy. All right. So I rearranged the, uh, the items here in your, uh, in your banger. Just uh, You'll see why in a second. So you're starting off with 
2021 Bowman Sapphire pack. So, very nice pack right out the gate. Almost a $60 pack, I believe, right now. Looks like 50 something bucks. How about a one of one National Treasures Giovanni Bernard printing plate auto? Now of the Tom Brady led Buccaneers. And this is what made me laugh, because I knew this card was still sitting over there. I think you're going to like this one. As a Ranger fan myself, one of my favorites, sad to see him go. How about 10-11 the Cup? True RPA, Derek Stepan, 59 of 249. I love when it works out that way. So, let's get your Bowman Sapphire pack here. You're very, <laughs> you're very welcome. Nick York, Seth Beer. Bryce Jarvis and very nice CJ Abrams. So thank you for trying out the bangers NYR. I hope you uh, enjoyed it. Said so I think uh, every single one I strive to deliver value just like that one there. Can't guarantee you'll get a card of the team in your username, but you know <laughs> it's fun when it does work out that way. And your slip is now made. So thank you, buddy. I appreciate you. Moving on. We already did that for Dig It. We did that for Easter Lime. McBean's up. Ooh, McBean's got a couple here. Two Prism Fast Breaks and a Chronicles Fatty. All right, McBean. <laughs> My name's a Giannis. <laughs> it's funny. Um, <laughs> McBean, you here, buddy? Yes, they are. All right, numbers. Let's find... You can go ahead and pick one through five on the Chronicles. And I got to find Prism Fast Break real fast. It's a retail box. Hmm, <laughs> hmm, <laughs> There's Prism Hobby, number three. Okay, one second. I'm just trying to find the fast break packs here. I definitely have to reorganize these. So much stuff has gotten moved out of a uh, out of order. Select. Maybe it's because I don't have any on the table. That might be the reason. All right, let me check over here. Hold on one second. Yeah, that would be the reason, because there were none on the table. All right, so pick two, one through four on uh, Prism Fast Break. One through four on uh, Prism Fast Bs. One and three, okay. And I think I actually just need to make a quick edit in the store. I think I put one too many of those packs in there. I think I overlisted them by one. So give me half a second, guys. I just got to fix that. I did. I just got to, uh, I got to delete one of them. Okay. There it is. And deleted. Done. Okay. Here we go. We'll start with the prison fast breaks, and then we'll move on to Chronic Lays. Good luck, brother. Starting off with Devontae Graham, 
Tyler Hero, nice Cassius Winston rookie, LMA, and Fast Break Prism of Eric Paschal. I think he just signed with the Jazz. I also love Ben Baller. I feel like it's very underrated. Pack two. We got a purple coming. Nice. Royce O'Neal. Very nice Peyton Pritchard rookie. Kevin Knox. Daniel Tice. And Perps. McGurps. Ooh, rookie. Ooh, -hoo. rookie purple. Okay. Someone shooting with a funky looking shot. Devin Vassell. Very nice card. There you go. That'll play. 32 of 75. That is a good card. Fortunately, it's got a print line. You can see it kind of going right through the middle there. But very nice. Well done. And Chronicles. First two packs of Chronicles today yielded four Trey Youngs total. And we got an Obsidian coming. Okay. Gobert, Butler, and Alonzo Trier. Marvin Bagley, studio rookie. And a marquee bronze rookie of Colin Sexton. Very nice. Landry Shamit. We'll save the... Uh, that is a uh, playoff bronze on the Shamit. We'll save the... Obsidian for the last year. Herder. Alonzo Trier Luminance. Diallo Panini. Amari Spellman Luminance. There you go. On the board, Lucas Styles. Playoff. Troy Brown Luminance, Mo Bamba score, and Jaron Jackson score, and one time. Come on, Luca. Make an appearance, baby. Oh, it's Trey! Look at that. Hello. What a pack. Trey Obsidian Preview. Very nice. So three packs today, I've now hit five trays and a Luca, including this one, the Obsidian tray, and a Studio. Hot on Chronicles. Good stuff, McBean. Bobble Buff approves. Boing. <laughs> I gotta make you a slip. I'm running out of space here. I already run out of space on the table and it's not even five o'clock. Okay. What, Heinze? You're a good boy, buddy. Don't be scared. It's just rain, it's just water. Okay. Uh, no, he is not facing the wall now. He is. Uh, he has since turned around. He's facing forward, but he gets so scared from the rain. All right, cheeks. You hear cheeksy? Cheeks. Looking for cheeks. Cheeks is here. All right. Give me two numbers, one through four, bud. Select Mega Box Red. Trefo. All right. Let's get you a slip for today. And then tomorrow, make sure you guys keep an eye out for my baby bangers. It'll be, uh, it'll be baseball only for tomorrow. And if those go well, I can make other sports too. All right, Cheeks. You ready? Is you ready? Are you ready? Whole squad ready? <laughs> Here we go. All right. Nice silver coming. Tannehill. And a nice Gabe Davis. 
Concourse red die cut. I like that. I think he's going to have a good year this year with John Brown out of the way and Cole Beasley likely to hit the COVID list at some point. I can almost guarantee that's going to happen. Silver. It's Beckham. Followed by, I like that, field level of Montana. So good pack, a field level, a silver, and a good red die cut. Drew Brees, our red is Jalen Rager, rookie, another guy who I think can have a good year this year. Going to be interested to see how, <laughs> how Philly's offense is. Turbocharged Zeke. And, nice, Jacob Eason, rookie. Solid indeed. And, Jake, you said bottom, right? You're welcome, Jeeks. You said bottom for your 2020 optic. Always bottoms, all right. See what we can do for you here. All right, Green Velo rookie incoming. Get you a slip. Slip! All right, here we go. DJ Moore, Deshaun Watson, Kerrigan, Jared Goff, Tredavious White, Joe Mixon, Kelsey, A.A. Ron, Derrick Henry, Max Crosby. Our base rookie is Ross Blacklock of the Texans. And Green Velo rookie. Let's do it. Oh, Ben DiNucci. It's a quarterback. <laughs> so there's that. JMU alum from right down the road, Ben DiNucci. If only this was a year ago. That was like a $50 card. It's funny, love. I feel like I go slow, buddy, because I talk so much. Because I have so much like, stuff. Every time I see a card, I want to tell you guys something. So I feel like I go too slow sometimes. But uh, DiNucci's still on their roster, I think, Jakey. Do I really go faster than other people? I had no idea. <laughs> I assumed that I'd be going slow. Um, so like I said, I tell a lot of stories. I show you guys my dog. <laughs> so. Hey, it's just one more injury away from being the starter again, I think. All right, Bill, give me a number on Sapphire here. I think one through eight. One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, one through eight on Sapphire, Bill. Number five. And i uh, got to open a brand new case of Nimbus. Brand new case of Nimbus. Love Nimbus. That's why I put it on the draft board for today. All right, buddy. Go ahead and pick one through six on Nimbus there. Number three, okay. There we go. It's okay, Heinz. I scared my dog. I threw the box away and scared the shit out of Heinz. All right, Sapphire. Nice, Andrew Vaughn. Doing great right now. Nick York. Xavier Edwards. And Bryce Jarvis. So a nice Vaughn there. Let's see if we can just drill it. Calling Luciano and Torkelson.
All right, our base. Oh, nice. We got a redemption. Bobby Witt and Mason Martin are the base. Oh, we got a redemption and a gold. Okay. Redemption. Just wander. Wander, please. Richard Gallardo. That is a first. I don't think we've ever hit that one yet. This? Oh, no one's ever... You have to mail them in, don't you? And a gold. Miguel Geraldo. I thought you have to mail these in. I didn't think you can do them online. Is that not true? But Miguel Geraldo is the gold. 250. Serious question. Does anyone know the answer to that? I won't flip the card back around, but... Um, I thought you had to actually mail these in. I didn't know they had an online system here. Yeah, I think uh, I don't think that you can actually redeem them online, but I would love. I actually should have asked them that when I was at the national, because I've wondered that forever. But yeah. Well, thank you, Bill. Appreciate it. And hopefully, uh, maybe I'll send them an email. I'll send Onyx an email and just ask them that way. I know for the future, because we pulled so many and no one's ever. No one's ever said anything. So, if anyone wants to go to uh, onyxauthenticated.com and just try and see if there's a, somewhere online to redeem redemptions, that'd be that'd be helpful. Nothing on that, Wags. Nothing. Then, uh, so the gold standard and the basketball ones are both sitting in the uh, the queue right now. I get so many individual purchases that the group breaks sometimes they just get forgotten about. All right, Jay Mitty's up with 19 sterling. Ooh, I like this. I'm all for it, Wags. I want to pull something nice. I mean, we hit the uh, we had Devonte Smith opulence um, out of the first box we did a couple days ago, but. I would like to uh, one-up that card. I think we can do it. It's pretty easy. How was the move, by the way? You situated? Just chilling? I like that. All right, Mitty. Give me a number one, two, or three on uh, 2019 Sterling. Number two. Okay. that number two okay 19 sterling let's do it one time taters please oh bethany are you still in here we have to do your archive sig from before oh Destiny's back, baby! <laughs> All right, we'll do your archive sig right after this. Might be the first time he's ever been on the Dolphin list. All right, nice. You got a double thick pack, so we're going to have a numbered card and an auto. Thumbs down to that shit. Brutal work. Bummer. Brendan Rodgers, rookie. Kyle Wright, rookie. Williams Astudio, rookie. Hit a home run off his knee yesterday. Chance Adams, rookie. Refractor. It's Kyle Wright again, 198 of 199. And your auto on card. Vince Fernandez of the Rockies. On card prospect auto. Thank you, Mitty. 
I appreciate you. And let's catch up here on Bethany's. Bethany was, uh, was it 21 retired? It was 21 retired, right? Yeah, okay. Um, one through four. I saw um, highlights from yesterday's game, the Cunningham and um, Green game. I saw highlights from that one. Basketball this year is going to be dope. So many good rookies. Sengen from Turkey? Yeah. So funny, man. He fell so far. They were saying he's the most NBA-ready player probably in the draft. He just can literally cannot play a lick of defense. He's defensively just inept, to say the least. <laughs> Uh, I was asking for the loop holders for a while. I needed them. <laughs> Absurdly good. Wow. Is this the uh, is this our hot take for the day, <laughs> Wags? Cause that's all they were saying is um, in the draft was. The guy just, he might not, he, he might be eating his canter. Like, he can just buckets, but he might get played off the floor because he did not play defense to save his life. I'm going to have to do a little research now. All right, Wags. You've convinced. I'll look it up. All right, looks like we got 2001, or no, maybe 1999 tops. 1999 tops, I think. 99 tops coming at you. Yeah, I only watched the. Uh, I just watched the highlights of Cunningham versus uh, what's it called versus Green. I someone like just clipped all their highlights, so I didn't even see Sanguine's highlights. I'll look it up. Oh, that's a nice one. It is a young Derek Lee. Forty-two of fifty-six. I love the Summer League All-Stars. It's so much fun. Every year, it's... I mean, I feel like for the past five years, it was been, it's been Harry Giles, Harry Giles, Harry Giles, and Harry Giles. Um, <laughs> but every year, there's always that that guy from the Summer League, and it's like, oh, my God. Like, it was Fork, like Fork and Kirkmaz dropped, like, a 40 spot in the Summer League a couple years ago. There's always the one guy. Yeah, like, Bull Bull, like, showing off his handle in the Summer League. <laughs> every year. It never fails to amaze me. <clears throat> All right, so dolphin list is now fixed. We are dolphin free. We're like the tuna. <laughs> Get it? Dolphin free tuna. Duh. All right, Sony's got the last two thick packs. Last two ones that I got done. Here we go, Rawson. Ooh, something is bulging out of the, the patch window over here. Stuck my finger in it by accident. Devonta Smith rookie, 26 of 50. And, oh, ooh, okay. Five of six, LeBron. Hello. See you later, Anthony Edwards. Wowza. Whew. Bulging. <laughs> Ooh, 
Ronaldo, 23 of 50. And Zach Wilson finishes off the thick packs. 11 of 25, cracked ice, rookie patch. I feel like the Ant-Man was the only one I could take off. Can't take off the Lamello jersey number 2 of 10. There's no chance. Uh, Messi's just too huge of a name to 10. It had to be him. Bichette's not going anywhere. Tough choice, but I feel like uh, the Edwards was the only one. I mean, the LeBron to 6 is definitely better. That's a Bo Bichette National Treasures Gold RPA to 49. <laughs> he said I'm as a player. <laughs> uh, that's a Bo Bichette National Treasures Gold on-card RPA uh, 30 of 49 with a half of the letter E from a nameplate patch. So that is a real good one. All right, Z-Bomb's got 2021 Elite Photos. All right, Z, give me two numbers here, one through four. Two and three, you got it. All right, good luck. Michael Thomas, Frank Gifford, and Elite Company. That's a nice one. It's Trevor Lawrence, and his company is Deshaun Watson, DeAndre Hopkins, and Mike Williams. So, a very cool card there. Tom Brady and Von Miller. And pack two. Jimmy G, T. Higgins, Elite Deck, Nick Bosa, Dak, and Dan Marino. Very nice Lawrence hit. The Clemson alums. That's going to take us up to Views has got a Valiant Holiday and my last set of 18 Heritage High Numbers. So there's the Heritage. And then Valiant, give me number one through four views. Number three, okay. Boom. Okay. And give me half a second here, guys. I just want to check something in the store. guys one second okay so I want to just uh, check and see if we had any more of the Panini Father's Day packs in there Thought we might have sold out. We did sell out of the individuals, so I added a uh, added some more of those in. Okay, let's do Heritage High number first. Come on, Shani for Rane, Rane Otane. That'd be a nice duo. All right, Dwight Smith Jr., Braxton Lee, P.J. Conlon. Yonder Alonzo, a decal insert of Matt Chapman. I think the Yonder might be a short print. It is. Alonzo is a short print. Drew Robinson, Adam Adovino, Hector Varea, and Hector Velasquez. And 
pack two. Tyler Clifford, Preston Tucker, Dylan Cousins rookie, Steven Souza Jr. There it is. Now and then, California Dillon rookie, Shohei Otani. So, nice Otani rookie. Followed by Hector Rondon, Jeremy Hellickson, Fernando Rodney, and Daniel Mengden. And I think I have another box of those, so I can add some more of those in as well. I'll check uh, as soon as we get caught up here. All right, 19 Valiant. Starting off with nice Logan Davidson. That'll be the 99. We'll check the serial numbering in just a second. And the talent. I like that. Nationals first rounder, Jackson Rutledge, 4 of 25 on the Rutledge. And the Logan Davidson is to 99. I believe he was a first rounder for the A's that year as well. So two good cards there. Thank you, views. I will add it to your pile, my friend, as soon as I can find it. There it is. I like Rutledge. Uh, let me just double check real fast on 18 Heritage. I think I do, and I do have one. Cool. All right. So I'll add some more Heritage High number into the store. 2018. Just double check pricing real quick. And then uh, I think we got two more Sterling packs coming up. So I added some more uh, 18 Heritage High Number Packs in. And that takes us to... Mitty's got my last two 19 Sterlings. All right. What I miss? What's crazy? Stop. No way. That's such, <laughs> such a stupid stat. First of all, how are there two people named Max Muncy? That's bizarre enough. In the whole world, let alone in baseball. All right. That is not a common name. Are they related? Cousins or anything like that? Because, like, Wander Franco's bro both of his brothers are also Wander Franco. And again, guys, this is uh, pretty much going to catch us up. I think someone just placed another order through. But after these two, we're basically caught up. It only took us... only took five hours today to get caught up. So that's not too bad. It's not too bad. <laughs> oh, Ross, and I did yours, buddy. I didn't know because I only had the two packs left. Uh, but this is what you got. This was your best one. Five of six, LeBron. And then the other ones were Ronaldo to 50, Zach Wilson patched to 25, and Devonta Smith to 50. Those were the final two packs. And it, it is on the stand. Bumped your own card. <laughs> All right, so single thick in this one. Here we go, midday. Brandon Lowe, rookie. Kyle Tucker, rookie. David Fletcher, rookie. Bunch of solid major leaguers there. A very nice Nick Madrigal prospect. Christian Pache prospect. That is a good set of names. And Refractor Auto. Looks like a pitcher. 
It's Colby Allard, 25 or 27 of 150. Now the Texas Rangers. And pack two. Another double, all right. Bartender making a double? Man, my dog is mad. Dixon is trying to eat someone through the door. Jesus Sanchez. Nice Joe Adele prospect. Nope, now they're howling. Royce Lewis. <laughs> Rowdy Tellez. Refractor. Sixto Sanchez, very nice. 45 of 199. And our auto. Victor, Victor Mesa. Not to be confused with Victor Mesa Jr. Victor, Victor Mesa. Just dogs going nuts. You're welcome, Mitty. Thank you, buddy. A lot of good names there in the, uh, the non-auto prospect stuff. A lot of them. My dogs were cheering you on. They, uh, they're very, very big fans of Bowman Sterling, if you guys can't tell. <laughs> can't get enough of the Sterling. <laughs> That's funny. Everyone else's dog just started chiming in. <laughs> All right. Uh, Genesis is up. All right. Genesis got Father's Day times two. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. One through nine. Go ahead and pick two of these guys. I pick three, seven. Three, four, five, six, seven. Always. All right, let's make you a slip for today. All right. Calling a baker. I don't know if Baker's in this product. <laughs> That'd be pretty remarkable if he hit a Baker Mayfield. Don't think he's in here. Joey Logano. And Russell Wilson. And Nice, Fernando Tatis, followed by, there you go, Trevor Lawrence. Good stuff. Noish, that was noish. All right, and let me add in a couple more. That was my last set of Father's Day two-pack lots, so I'll add in a couple more of those. Those are now in. And Z Bomb's got Prism Multi Pack. Top to bottom, Z. Imagine with Baker. I would have uh, I would have ate my hat. Would have had to, right? <laughs> Top or bottom, Z-Bomb? Where are we going on? Prism Multis. Top. All right. It's Prism Football, right? Prism Football. Okay. Sweet. <laughs> All right. Here we go. Starting with our base card pack. Oh, we got you a silver. Nope, it's a green. I thought it was a silver. It's a green. It's just a green insert. Green insert. Didi, Sam Hubbard, Brandon Cooks, Akeem Hicks, Gallup, Malcolm Butler, Matty Ice, Marshawn Lattimore, Darnell Savage, and our green insert. I think it's the hype set. It is Josh Jacobs. 
unstoppable Tremaine Edmonds and our base rookie, Jason Huntley. Picture with the Lions here of the Eagles in select. Red, white, and blue pack. Tyreek Hill. Followed by Mick Bosa and your rookie. I like that. Very nice, Jonathan Taylor. He's going to get a lot of yards this year. Like, a lot of yards. All the yards. I hope I get, like, the seventh pick in fantasy so I can just take him. I want him on my team so bad. He was just a monster last year at the end of the, the, end of the year. So good. All right. If he falls to the second round, I mean, sign me up. I feel like he should be a mid-first-round talent, but I don't know. They're saying Wentz is going to be back for week one. They just updated the report this year, so. Yeah, I mean, there's a lot of names ahead of him, but I mean, I'll tell you this much. I wouldn't take Saquon Barkley over him. So. I feel like there's going to be some guys like that that go in the first round that I don't feel like they should, but it's still so early. Too early to tell. All right, Bethany, four more Ginters. Get the last hit out of this box. Come on. Do it. One through eight. Give me the four lucky ones. One, three, four, seven. Hey, Heinze. Welcome back, buddy. <laughs> That's a tough call. I don't know if I could take Chubb. I don't know. If I, I think both of them are probably second, third. They're both so... I mean, I had Hunt last year. I took Hunt in like the sixth or seventh round last year. Um, but I don't know if I could take either of them in the first round. Randy Johnson, Dalton Varsha rookie, Cody Hewer rookie, Johnny Bench, Brady Singer, Mark Burley, uh, Stanton, Ginterback, ooh, and look at that Caribbean Reef Shark, haven't had this one yet. As its name suggests, the Caribbean Reef Shark is commonly found on or near coral reefs in the Caribbean. Finally, thank you, finally, we finally got an animal that actually makes sense with its name. Uh, coral reefs in the Caribbean off the Atlantic coast from Florida to South America. These bottom dwellers, which can be 6 to 10 feet long, have been known to occasionally attack divers. Inexplicably, Caribbean reef sharks have been found sleeping in caves and on ocean floors. Sometimes it's got a nap. <laughs> New shark, who dis? <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> Freddie Freeman, Miguel Sano, Bichette, Tiana. Now, who are you, Tiana? Sarah Tiana is a comedian from Georgia. Campanella. Victor Gonzalez, rookie. The captain. It's a regular mini. Oh, we already got the Arabian Orcs. I know all about the Arabian Orcs. There's like two dozen of them left, but now they're back. Come on. I know all about that. Spain. Not only a country, it's a person. Sarah Spain. Sports reporter and host from Espen. Zach Wheeler, Robin Yount, Mariano, Pavin Smith rookie, Jordan, short print. Ooh. First one of these. Mascots in real life. The Sea Dog. 
with a fuzzy face similar to a walrus and a bulbous blue belly resembling a mutant manatee, the Rays mascot is one of a kind. Team Scouts gave the Sea Dog an instant contract uh, offer after first spotting him during a 1998 fishing trip in the Gulf of Mexico. Dope. Love it. And historical hits, Johnny Bench, October 6th, 1973. That's another pretty easy one. Bottom of the eighth, game one of the 1973 NLCS. Biggest blast in the ninth off Tom Seaver over the wall and left. I know that one. Seen that highlight many times. It's so easy when they're in October. I mean, I love McCaffrey. That guy is an animal. I like Dalvin Cook, too. But, I mean, McCaffrey, man, so many catches. So many catches. A-Rod, Herman Marquez, Tyler Glass now, Pache, Alejandro Kirk, Patrick Corbin, Sanchez, which is Jesse Sanchez, the MLB reporter, that's an Allen and Ginter back, and Murad of Max Scherzer. I'm not taking Cook over McCaffrey. Unless you're in a no PPR league. And I still might take McCaffrey. <laughs> so, thank you, Bethany. Fun stuff. All right, still's got 21 elite photo. I have two left on the table, but I think I have a couple more. So, hold on one second, buddy. Let me make sure. I do. Do you want the ones on the table? Still, or do you want me to uh, put some more out there for you to pick from? You want those? You want to go with these still? Sorry. I'd... Okay, cool. And then, here we go. Still pimping up an ant white sheet. All right. J.J. Watt, Stefan Diggs, and good choice sticking with these because we got a gold to 10. Holy shit. There it is. Who's getting bumped? Four of 10. Trevor Lawrence. Wow. Wowza. I think it's Messi. I think Messi's getting the uh, the boot. I can't bump the Lamelo because it's jersey numbered and rookie. Oh my god. Wow. Messi was the one I was leaning towards. I think Lamella will be the next, eh, the Bichettes, ah, oh, man, it's tough. It doesn't really matter that much. It's just to show people what we're pulling, but, oh, my gosh. Well, let's get Still Pimpin's name on this. Damn. DeAndre Hopkins and Matthew Stafford. Who cares? That is awesome. That is the Elite 2001 Rookies Gold, Trevor Lawrence. My goodness. That is a good freaking card. Strahan, Devontae Adams. Equally as good as the Trevor Lawrence, Brevin Jordan to 999. Josh Allen and Alvin Kamara. Wow. Hot today, folks. Have yourself a Wednesday. And 
they're going to be losing a lot of football games too. So garbage points for the win. No one cares how you score them. All right, Brenker, my man, love it. Prism No Huddle Football. And then Agent Zero's got Update Hobby Suite. Okay. No Huddle. Let me, uh... So I had two left on the table. Do you want those? Do you want me to grab some more to pick from? Worked last time, didn't it? <laughs> Just worked for Still Pimpin'. You want to shit up? What is... I mean... <laughs> that's funny nice typo buddy <laughs> all right all right got a light blue rookie is van jefferson singletary emmett smith matt ryan and light blue to 79 nice dak i like that 38 of 79. Jay, that is 2020 National Treasures. That is the gold RPA. With half the letter E. From his nameplate. So that was a nice one. Expensive box. It's like an 11, almost an $1,100 box. but Very nice card, though. Got a lot of really nice cards up there today. And we got a purple coming. Nice. Anthony Jennings is the rookie. Andre Johnson, Zach Ertz, Jimmy Garoppolo, and our purple. Darnell Savage, Packers, first round safety. 7 of 35. You are very welcome. Two nice packs there with the Savage and the Dak. Uh, you had a purchase earlier, right, Brinker? I think you did. You were in the group break, right? Were you in the group break? No. First one today? Okay. Too many stacks. Way too many. I think we've already got... This might be a record. It's only 5.30. We are... Five hours halfway through the stream, and we've got 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 40, 42, 44, 46, 47 unique buyers already. You guys are killing it. 47 unique buyers in five hours. That is a lot. That is awesome. Uh, I believe I... I gotta look for No Huddle. I don't know if I have a new box or if it's still more packs from that same box, but I'm pretty sure I have more. Let me just double check. Real fast. I have six packs left from that box. It's the same box. But I have six packs left. So. No idea. Couldn't tell you. No clue. I don't remember the auto being hit, but, I mean, this is only my second day on after a three-week break off from the national convention and some weddings, so I, I couldn't tell you with 100% confidence. Agent Zero, one through five. Actually, I got more than that out here. I got 10 out here, I think. One through 10, go ahead and pick. Still one number three? Okay. For Top's update. Later, Jakey. We'll be here when you get done. I can almost assure you that. <laughs> This is the, uh, we're moving into the slow time around five, like 5.30 to 7 o'clock Eastern is uh, when people start leaving for dinner, driving home from work. So as long as we can get through 7 o'clock, I'll keep rolling um, all night. Just got to get through the slow time. 
Good luck, buddy. Garrett Cole, Jesse Biddle, rookie, Yanni Sharano's rookie, Matt Harvey, Devin Mezzarocco, nice Ryan Yarborough rookie. Kind of underrated player. A Rod, this is the uh, salute, Legends, All Star Legendary Salute. There you go. Another pack? It's another Otani. Upton, Otani, and Trout. Next stop, stardom. Love this card. Awesome card. Followed by Juan Lagares and Heimer Condelario. So we are two for two on Otanis. 18 Heritage High number hit one, and now 18 Tops update. Thank you, Agent Zero. Lucky number 48 as far as unique buyers go today. <laughs> All right, Chili's up with back-to-back -back ones here. We've got 19 Valiant Holiday and an 18 National Convention pack. Nice. All right. Uh, Valiant Holiday, one, two, or three. Three. And... Uh, I already forgot what the other one was. The uh, 18 National Convention pack, one through five on those. Also three, okay. All right, we'll do, let's do Valiant first. Uh, Chili, I know you had uh, purchased the other day. Is this your first one today? I think it is, right? Okay, just check it. Make you a slip before I forget. All right. Good luck, my dude. Starting off with an orange. Nathan Patterson. Should be to 75. And behind that, a green. Zach Watson. Patterson. Oh, the 35. Okay. 35 on the orange. And Zach Watson, 60 of 99, 19 of 35 is the Patterson. And National Convention Pack, as my dogs cry now. They're going through like all the emotions upstairs. Scared, howling, excited, crying. You name it, they are doing it. All right. Can we go three for three on Otani's? Please say yes. Gary Sanchez. Benny, Dom Smith, it's a rookie on the Smith, and we did not, Jose Canseco. But nice Dom Smith, let's go Mets, LGM. Thank you, Chili, I will start you a pile for today. Appreciate you as always. Uh, I've got Ginter Ape. I've got it in there in two pack lots and in four pack lots. They are in the baseball section. The two pack lots are like 20 bucks. The four pack lots are like 37. Um, the four pack lot, here's a fun fact. I'm pretty sure there's a hit left. There's one four pack lot left and I think there should be a hit left. We've only hit two relics out of this box. So... Fun fact, someone I'm sure is going to go buy it right now. So the race is on. Um, and then the box with that we've been going through for is the two packs. Um, we've only pulled a single relic out of that box as well. All right, P Mania's got some national convention thinnies. Okay, all right. No, this is all that's left from the four-pack box. This is it. We've gone through the entire box with the exception of these four packs. And there's going to be a hit left. We only hit two relics out of this box. So, um, <coughs> the two pack box is almost a fresh box, though. 
Um, and once I sell these four packs, I'll add another four. I'll add another box in for the four pack lots once we sell those. But all right, P Mania. One through six. Give me two thinnies. Two and six. All right. What are my dogs crying at? My goodness. All right. After these two packs, I'm going to run upstairs. I got to get my portable charger, and I want to make sure, like, at least it didn't fall down the stairs or something, because... All right. There they go. All right. Hold on a second. I'll be right back, guys. I got to... I want to make sure that something's not wrong. <laughs> hey! What are you guys doing? Hey! What's going on so dumb they can see my wife's car pulled up into her parking spot and she's sitting in the car she's probably on the phone so just yep crying like psychos waiting for her to get out of the car and it's funny because the uh, the little one he couldn't even see he was sitting on the couch in the living room he just started howling because the other one was howling <laughs> all right yeah it's as soon as she pulls in they just they just start going at it but let me, I just kind of forgot. I got to run back upstairs and now replug in this charger. So one more second, guys. We're back. Back for reals now. I had to grab a water, too. Okay. Sorry about that, guys. Woo! All right. P-Mania National Convention. Here we go. Let's get you a slip for today. Here we go. Good luck. Finally, uh, gotten some autos from this stuff. Got two of them today, DK Metcalf and Louise Robert. I think we can do better, though. I think we can do better than that. And we did it again. I told you guys we were so overdue for autos in this stuff, and now it's three straight packs with autos. Three straight auto packs here in the thins. Starting off with an Escher Squares to 10. Very nice. Jared Kalenic rookie. And it's a cracked ice auto. I 
saw the team. It's a good one. Do you want to know the team? It's a real good one. The team would be the um, the Warriors of the state of Golden. So I think that you're looking at either Curry or Wiseman here. Good luck. It's Wiseman. Six of ten, cracked ice rookie auto. Boom. Hello. What a pack. Wiseman auto to ten and Kaletic rookie to ten. They look good. Uh, bottom left here on the front's got a little bit of a flare out, but I mean very minor. But you got a little bit of whiting on the back top left, so um, don't think it's a PSA 10. Probably a 9, but sharp card. And we still have one more pack to go. Let's see if we can do it again. Can we go 4 for 4 on autos? That would be crazy. I mean, I knew we were overdue, but I feel like that... I feel like <laughs> we've uh, we've kind of done what we can now. Probably back to normal. And back to normal it is. All right. To 50, it's Haley Deegan again. 16 of 50. Right, I did not get any NT, buddy. Um, not basketball. I could only get a case, and I did not want to get a whole case because I didn't think I was going to be able to sell through a whole case. I figured I might sell through a box. But I can only buy it by the case today. So I said, I will pass. And an Escher squares to 10. <laughs> How about Messi? One of 10. Did you look at that? Correct. One of 10 on the Messi. Awesome. Silver pack still delivering every time. Good stuff, dude. Nice picks. All right. Views is up with 2020 Elite Photo. All right. Where are you at? 2020 folks. There we go. One through eight, buddy. Pick what, eight, right? Yeah, one through eight, pick two. And then I'm gonna add in another box of the Ginter four packers. Brand new box of Ginter um, four pack lots in there as well for you guys. So, views, go ahead, buddy. Four seven, there it is. Okay. All right. Let's do it. Let's do it. Mark Ingram, McCaffrey, Derwin James, and Jimmy G. And, ooh, nice, I like this. Spellbound Purple, Derrick Henry. Cool card. That is 14 of 75 on the Henry Spellbound Purple. Pack two, Tom Brady, Rainer. I didn't grab any NT. I didn't think I was going to be able to sell it because I could only grab it by the full case. Um, so I did not grab any. Hopefully tomorrow I'll be able to get some. Uh, they'll let me take like a box or two out of a fresh case, but today they could only give me a full case because they already had everything else sold. So AJ Brown, 
Elite Deck, Dalvin Cook, Evan Ingram, and Jared Siddham. So, very nice Derrick Henry there for your views. And into your stack it goes. You are welcome. Smitty's got the last set of the original uh, box of Allen and Ginter. So let's see if we can find an auto in here. We should have a, should be a hit left. Seaver, Moniac rookie, Hank Aaron, Chipper, Luis Castillo, Jake Cronenworth, a Roger Clemens mini black, and Birds of a Feather, the Orange Belly Parrot, which has a noticeable orange spot on its green and yellow underbelly, as we all know. And here, I think this is our hit. We do have another hit. All right, so this is going to be our hit. Sonny Gray, Bryce Harper, McGuire, Uncle Larry, and... who? Three of ten. I'm going to make you sweat it. Going to make you sweat it, and yes, there are rip cards. Eddie Murray, a little kid named Kelly holding juice. Leo Kelly, social media star, apparently. Ah, uh, the Shirley Temple King. Okay. Blake Snell, Corey Seager, Alan Trammell, D.V. Garcia rookie, Stanton, the Mako Shark, Deep Sea Shiver. I don't know, some kid. <laughs> I don't know. Um... The short fin Mako is the fastest of the sharks, able to reach speeds of 45 miles an hour. My God. They can also leap high out of the water while pursuing prey. These giants sit near the top of the oceanic food chain with no known predators once they reach adulthood. Makos can maintain temperatures warmer than their habitats, contributing to a wide geographic range. That sounds terrifying. Nothing can eat them. They're the fastest. <laughs> they can jump the highest. And they can live in basically any temperature. Hot damn. That sounds terrifying if I was another fish. This is like the LeBron of sharks. Nick Nieder, Quintana, Puckett, J.D. Martinez, DJ LeMahieu, Brandon Woodruff, short print, far, far away, Caldwell 42. We already did that one. It's known for its uh, blue something or others. Oh, no, I lied. That was Caldwell 47. I'm stupid. Caldwell 42 is a globular cluster that provides a hint of what the Milky Way was like billions of years ago. Discovered in 1784, densely packed with hundreds of thousands of stars which are held in a roughly spherical shape by their mutual gravity. How can I confuse Caldwell 42 with Caldwell 47? That's just embarrassing. And Derek Jeter. Murad. All right. This might be a, a silk framed. No, it's an auto, I think. So, Bauer Mini, Aboreal Appreciation, the Tulip Tree, making me sweat it so hard. So hard. It's number to 10. We're going to have to go through these cards anyway. Native to the eastern United States, Tulip Trees boast a storied American history. Those planted by George Washington at Mount Vernon now stand 140 uh, feet tall, while Daniel Boone used its wood to carve a 60-foot canoe. These beauties bloom in May and June, producing tulip-shaped flowers with yellow-green petals and a splash of orange. All right, you ready? 2021 Ginter. I have no idea if this is going to be a celebrity or someone. Someone named Brickley. Red Ink Auto. 3 of 10. No clue. Chris Brickley, basketball trainer. Framed Red Ink Auto to 10. No idea. Who? Who indeed? Chris Brickley, look him up. <laughs> uh, I don't have any box or um, anything by the full box J stick, but I could uh, I could put one in there for you. Um, I would think it's going to be like one fifty five, just because the shipping's a little bit um, higher than normal for an individual purchase because it'll automatically be a priority mail shipment. Um, I could put it in. I can, I can look it up. I just to run the numbers. I think it'll be like 155 for a full box. 
Was that your first purchase today, Smitty? I think it was, right? I think it was. Yeah. Is it really cheaper than Tops Direct? That's funny. Yeah, so uh, I'll always give you the option to pick the packs. I'll let you pick, you know, whatever number one through whatever. Or as long as I have more than one available, then yeah, you can always pick. Is he like the guy with the, the gloves? Like the... It is a fresh box, eh? Brand new. No one has bought any from that one yet, so you can go ahead and uh, and grab it. Okay, nice, yeah. 150 plus shipping, not bad. Alright, T Moss is up with Ginter Chrome. Where'd I put Ginter Chromes? 2020 Ginter Chrome, alright, buddy. 1 through 15, pick 6. I pride myself on having good pricing, you know? Sometimes you just gotta undercut tops. <laughs> Alright, I pick. Uh, still, I ship as often as I possibly can, uh, but I'll never be longer than three business days. So, um, the latest that this would ship is Monday. Um, but, you know, like I said, it really just depends on how much I have to do. Like, uh, we did, we streamed Saturday, and I had everything from Saturday out on, on Monday. So, it really depends. But this will not be later than Monday. But three business days is the max. But I will aim, I'm aiming to get this stuff out on Friday. I do my best to go uh, two business days or less. Let's go with three, 14, two, six. All right. All right, here we go. Uh, it's going to be at the very bottom of the baseball section. You got to, um, ape, don't go in the available section. There's a glitch going on right now where you can't see the items that I re add in. Go to the section um, labeled all in the sale items, and then go to the very bottom of the baseball section. You should see them. The baseball Brit, Jordan Alvarez. Very nice one there. The Alvarez rookie. Edgar Martinez, Mini, and Mike Trout. So a good first pack with a Trout and an Alvarez rookie. Aaron Judge, a Roldis Chapman, sweet Safari Sights, the Lion Cub, and Mike Schmidt. This is going to be a nice one. Lion Cub. Lion Cub are typically born in litters of up to five. With predators roaming the African savannas and grasslands, lionesses typically leave their pride to care for cubs under the cover of secluded areas. The baby cats are fully weaned by around seven months. Little babies. Ah, oh, little, little babies. Little lions. What was the, the lion's name that remembered his, like, owner, Leo? Was that it, Leo the Lion? That video where, like, the lion's, like, jumping up, hugging that guy? It's, like, old, but... I want one of those. Nolan Ryan. <coughs> excuse, <coughs> excuse me. Juan Marichal. Booming Cities. Dhaka, the capital of Bangladesh. And Ozzy Smith. It was possible to stroll down empty roads in Dhaka, formerly spelled Dhaka, D-A-C-C-A, -C -C -A, as recently as the 1960s. Now with more than 20 million calling the capital of Bangladesh home, this river-bounded megacity booms to the Southeast Asian financial and cultural center. Sometimes you just gotta go to the capital of Bangladesh. I'd go. Sign me up. Gotta sell a few more Ginter packs and I'll buy my ticket. Corey Seeger, Robin Young. Oh, more safari sites. It's the Cheetah. Cheetah. Good snack, better cat. Few sights in nature as breathtaking as a cheetah in full sprint across a dry African forest, scrubland, or savanna. These carnivorous cats are famed as the world's fastest land animals, uh, able to reach speeds of 70 miles per hour over short distances. Let's be serious. Better cat or better snack? Thoughts, please? 
Cat or snack? What is a better cheetah? I know it's Cheeto, but I'm for argument's sake. I think cat. I think I think also better cat than snack. Although it is a solid snack. Don Mattingly, someone named Cook. I think it's Rachel Lee Cook, maybe. Nope, Kelsey Cook, comedian and professional foosball player. Yes, my favorite one. Bugging out. The Australian walking stick. Oh, this is going to be so good. Frank Thomas. Can't wait for this one. The Australian walking stick. It resembles the carnivorous praying mantis, but the walking stick is perfectly content to gorge on eucalyptus leaves in its native Australia. Males fly, but females do not. Both genders, though, can curl up and resemble dried leaves to hide from predators. That's kind of badass. So this is like the opposite of the spiny orb weaver, where the females are huge and terrifying and the males are just a bunch of little sissies. Males got you guys beat here in the uh, Australian walking stick because we can fly where the chicks cannot. They are grounded. Dope. Oh, and we're finishing off with an orange. All right. Jim Abbott mini, Colton Wong, Ison Diaz rookie, and an orange. Let's see if it's a baseball player. Is that a name we know? Oh, my baby. Oh, boy. This is why you sit through all my nonsense and crap reading, by the way, when I do uh, Ginter Chrome, because how about that? Color match, Jordan, orange rookie, 24 of 25. That is a big card. Hello. Uh, he's doing great. He's hitting 300 with like 20 homers. He is having himself a year. Very good year. Wow. Awesome. You are very welcome. You know what? I'm kind of curious on that one. Pretty solid. I think you gotta be looking at 150 bucks or so. They do get overlooked. He wasn't even on the team. We talk about it all the time. Literally not even on the team, and people are just like, boo, oh, Astros, you suck. So awesome there, Moss. That is nice. Alright. Apes up next with a brand new box here from Ginter. Little four pack action. Let me go ahead and cut one open for you. Left, right, 1 through 12. Go ahead and pick 4. Where are we going? Am I? Am I the only one that's on right now? 2, 4 on each. Alright. Well, I don't know, Big. Um, this is like the, uh, <laughs> honestly, this is like the worst time right now. Um, 
I always notice this, uh, usually between, I would say maybe between like 4.30, 5 o'clock and like 7 o'clock Eastern time. Um, it gets real slow solely because people on the East Coast are eating, people in the Central and West Coast are driving home from work. So that's, uh, without a doubt, I feel like the slowest time in the app. So it might be a little bit, uh, a little bit lackluster across the board right now. So we usually do a lot of talking, a lot of talking between 5.30 and 7. So uh, I'll show you, Abe. I'll show you in a second. Let me do uh, Abe's um, Ginters here. Yeah, we've been doing okay here on my stream today, uh, but I don't get too slow too often, but if I do get slow, it's always during that time. So, uh, but this will catch us up on the queue. We will now officially be caught up six hours it'll take. I thought we were gonna get caught up about uh, an hour, hour and a half ago, but we did not. So this will catch us up. So someone has to make some more purchases because I don't, <laughs> I wanna go a whole stream without ever being caught up. That'd be nice. That'd be fun. Be a fun thing to say. So starting off with the Tatis with a little bit of damage on the corner here, but Rendon, Flaherty, Kyle Lewis, Willie Stargell, Nick Castellanos. Ooh, first one of these we've seen. Hats off. It's the beret. Associated with everything from French chic to political revolution, the beret boasts thousands of years of history. Versions of the flat hat have ever been, have even been seen in Bronze Age archaeological finds with most across the millennia made of inexpensive felt. Hmm, interessant. Très intéressant en French chic. In a murad of Manny Machado. Yes, I can explain that to you in one second, uh, Bird. Very simple to explain. David Ortiz, uh, that Sanchez guy, Jesse Sanchez, the reporter. Brock, Brad Keller, Tony Gwynn, Max Scherzer, far, far away, Caldwell 35. That's got like no stars. Caldwell 35, also known as yeah, clearly also known as NGC 4889. It is so far away that the light that reaches Earth today is 300 million years old. How do they find shit like this? The most distant object in the Caldwell catalog is a giant elliptical galaxy roughly two and a half times larger than the Milky Way. Like, how do they see this? And rallying back, the bald eagle. He's back, baby. An American civil for more than two centuries, the bald eagle is now one of the nation's greatest comeback stories. Pesticides began erasing the population of these majestic, fierce-eyed birds in the mid-20th century. However, laws protecting them have been hugely successful as sightings have become plentiful again, particularly in the upper Midwest. And the reason why the Devers card has both is... So the Rookie Cup has nothing to do with a Rookie Card logo. Um, a lot of times they'll intentionally hold players back from one series into the next series. Uh, for one year into the next. Um, even if they de debuted in like 2017, right? They might intentionally hold him back, even though they couldn't make cards for him and update. They want to hold them back for Series 1 to make sure they have a bigger rookie. Um, so if he, for whatever reason, is not included in the 2017 set, um, even if he becomes a 2018 rookie card logo, he can still wind up with the 2018 rookie card, uh, the rookie cup on there, because those are completely separate entities. The rookie cup and the rookie card logo have nothing to do with each other. It just so happens that sometimes players will debut mid-season not get any rookie cards of the following year and still wind up becoming part of the Topps All-Rookie Cup team. So it happens. Um, Randy Rosarena is another one, perfect example. Um, it almost always happens with people that are called up mid-season, though, that they decide to hold back for the following year's rookie class instead of putting them in update. So that's, uh, that's why. You'll see it quite often. But Pack 3. Christian Javier rookie, David Wright, Victor Robles, Justice Sheffield, Michael Conforto, Jordan Alvarez, a Zach Wheeler mini, just a regular mini, and Joe Adele, Murad rookie. Correct, it's still a true rookie. Um, still a true rookie, 100%. The Having the rookie uh, cup logo on there has nothing to, uh, nothing to do with making it um, not a rookie card. So... Matt Chapman, Oscar Mercado, Ryan Jeffers rookie, Ian Anderson rookie, Pedro Martinez, Bob Feller, Trent Grisham is our mini, that is a short printed mini, and Mike Trout. No problem, Bird. Happy to help. Happy to explain it. So thank you there, Ape. I know a, I know a couple things about a couple things, Jay. 
Not that much about birds, but I'm learning. Learning a lot about parrots and bald eagles and trees today. <laughs> and that does it, guys. We are caught up. Caught up. And here you go, Abe. This was your uh, sapphire pack. That uh, was a Latifi. A nice Calamalote. So one of our top F2 drivers that you're looking for in the set. A nice Lando driver of the day rookie. And a Max driver of the day Monaco. So didn't hit any uh, any verticals or any numbered cards, but Max, Alote, and Norris. So at least three solid names. I gave it a 4 out of 10 on the uh, the hit scale. And we're caught up. Wow. Whew. That was a fun five hours or six hours. Six hours, yeah. We did it. All right. So now that we're caught up, do we want to do a group break maybe? What are we thinking? Group break? <laughs> no problem, Abe. We should do this Onyx Nimbus draft that I put on the, uh, the board back here. It's cheap and fun. It's literally just four people, $60 a spot. So the Onyx Nimbus draft would just be four people, $60 a spot. I'd open all four boxes and you would just draft your box just like that. Boom, bang, piece of cake. So if anyone's interested in doing that, just post in the chat and I will add it into the store. Fun, good product, two on card artists per box. But right now, we got to do a T206 box for Team Moss. Moss, give me a number one through five. And then Bubby's up with update right after that. Nice. I pick. All right, let's go with four. Number four, number four. All right. We have yet to get an auto or one of the original buybacks out of this. Out of, uh, I think, 12 boxes, maybe? 10 boxes? I don't even know. Enough where I would like to get one. So, I would love to get a buyback. Speaking of that, I will take this opportunity to let you guys know that there is a product out. It's in the store. It's expensive. It's like um, $400 a box, I think. Or, no, $480 a box. Um, it's Historic Autographs. T206 triple folders is what it's called. Every single box of that, it's one item. It's going to be a booklet that folds out, and it'll either have four original T205 or T206 cards in it, or um, it'll be a duel with two T205 or T206 cards in it with accompanying autographs of the players. I wanted to open one so bad. I was talking about it on Saturday a little bit, but I figured while we're here on the um, T206 type item... I would let you guys know that that does exist because that just came out last um, last Friday, I think. Friday, maybe? Or I think it came out at the National, technically. But, yeah. All right, here we go. Chris Bryant, Jose Ramirez, Marcelo Zuna, Al Kaline, Tim Wakefield, nice Nick Madrigal rookie, Max Freed, and our two parallel, oops, sorry, Greg Maddox and our two parallels are going to be Chris Bubik, rookie, and Randy Johnson. The Johnson is a Piedmont back, and so is the Bubik. <laughs> Boob Johnson. <laughs> All right. Thank you, Moss. Still no buybacks. I want one. want one so bad uh yeah i mean anything's worth money if you get the right cards anthony um but it's a fun little product um bubby's up all right bub bub's got 18 update hobby one through nine bub and thank you for checking out the stream and making your first purchase here with me i appreciate you always happy to see a new username Uh, Logan, they are um, a Topps Online exclusive. So they do them in waves. Uh, like that box is wave one, then they'll have wave two, which will have a different set of players. I think last year they did five waves was the total, I think, if memory serves correct. 
and uh, that's the way to complete the set is you know you have to buy multiple boxes of each wave so they're nice i like them they're neat all right bob thank you logan um i think the only t206 that I, they've released so far is wave one i don't know if they've released wave two yet um but there should be at least two more boxes in the store and then i have two more extras here as well i would tell you to search for them but it's not possible <laughs> with the uh with the search feature so one day we'll get that the day that we get that oh man it's gonna be it's gonna be a game changer uh here moss i'll do this for you did you want both of them because I know I have two extra ones, so I can just add them in to the bottom of the store. All right. Give me one second. I'm just going to put it in as your name, T Moss. 2X T206 box. And. Hold on one second here. All right, I'm putting them in the uh, the the little three card section, so that way you don't have to scroll that far. So it just says T Moss Two X T Two O Six box, and it's gonna be at the very bottom of the three card section. It's in now. Just make sure you're under the all section, not the available section. That way you can uh, you can see it. Um, I meet enough, Jay. I meet enough. I mean, it's funny. It's not always just professional athletes. I meet um, people that you guys might know from other areas um because a lot of people collect now so um but i mean my fair share of athletes too so all right bob sorry about that as cabrera a game for everyone altuve and judge boom man we're hot with this guy today another one the otani update series one Hello. Welcome to Buffs Breaks, Bubby Bob. <laughs> it's our third Otani rookie today. And we're not even like specifically Otani hunting or anything. JD Martinez, another nice one here. Salute, Glaber Torres rookie. Miles Michaelis rookie. Zach Cozart. Did we just become best friends? JD and Mookie. Charlie Culberson. Cool photo. And Luis Valbuena. Honestly, couldn't tell you, Abe. I have not checked, but... Oh, my pleasure, man. Thank you. The Trevor Lawrence was elite first off the line. It was a 2001 um, Elite 2K1 gold to 10. 4 of 10. Oh, nice, Abe. Mega box. Top or bottom, buddy? Where are we going? top and this is the uh this is the lawrence the 10 so good pull top on megas all right Let's do it. All right, what do we think? Should I stream again tomorrow? I think I should. I think I'm going to. I think I'm going to stream again tomorrow. Why not? Right? Why not? Um, one thing I do ask, guys, is if you haven't done so already, please, at the top of the screen, click on my name. Click on the little bell icon in my profile. That way you will get a notification every time I go live. We open stuff non-stop here at Buff Breaks, so I do have the best job in the world. You're never going to hear me say anything different. 
<laughs> so, I will tell you this much, the sorting and shipping is not the most fun part of it, but all things considered, I am, uh, I am A-OK. -okay. Uh, nothing new coming out tomorrow. Release days are always um, Wednesday and Friday. But I'll be able to restock on a lot of stuff tomorrow, so. A lot of hard work, Logan. A lot of hard work. A lot of uh, studying a lot of products. I spent probably half of my waking life for, uh, from, like, age 10 forward doing cards, so. <laughs> but... It definitely does. I would say it definitely does there, Jay, but I can tell you this much. Uh, technicians, I appreciate them so much because you guys do stuff that I could never. I have no idea how to even, like, turn my freaking toaster on, let alone, like, install the internet. Like, the internet breaks, like, God bless my soul, like, it's over. So, mad respect for, uh, for you guys. All right, Abe, let's get it. Cam Akers, Kishan Vaughn Red, TD Unbreakable, Baker, Goff, Frivers, and there's a nice one, Joe Burrow, certified. Well, Michael P. Ryan, Chase Claypool, rookie. Michael Pittman, premier level red die cut rookie. And a Jake from State from Concourse Silver. Antonio Gibson, club level rookie. Drew Locke, Palomalu, club level red. Turbocharged Lamar, Ed Reed. Wow, we got another zebra. Zebra incoming, oh boy. DeAndre Swift, rookie, hold on. This could be huge, baby. Had never pulled a zebra out of hundreds and hundreds of packs of the retail version here. And now we've gotten two in two days. Man, we're just crushing it today. Oh yeah, gotta save it for last. You know I'm gonna make you sweat it. Always, that's my MO. <laughs> Ginter came out today, correct, yeah. So that's new for today. It's Ginter and National Treasures, but I didn't get any National Treasures. Blacklock and Rager. I thought you were talking about for, uh, for tomorrow, Anthony. J.K. Dobbins, Premier Level Red Rookie. Nice one there. Judy Certified. CD Lamb, Nick Chubb, and another nice one. Your one per box, field level red die cuts, CD Lamb. The first one was Darrington Evans. It was trash. It was terrible. One of the worst names you can get. At least it was a rookie, but Drew Brees, Turbocharged, Roethlisberger, Gandy Golden, Josh Kelly, rookie. Nice Russell Wilson, club level silver. Michael Vick, field level, Juju, Van Jefferson, club level red, TJ Watt, hot stars, AJ Dillon, Joe Reed, Tom Brady, very nice red die cut, premier level, and Jalen Rager, premier level, copper prism, 130 of 355, followed by Drew Brees. DeAndre Swift, rookie, Aaron Rodgers, and, which way is it facing? This way. Premier level zebra. Good luck, buddy. One time on the zeb. It's Nick Chubb. We were talking about him earlier. Good player. Would have loved to get a rookie, but still, I'd much rather have this than a copper prism. Uh, he's real good. We were debating whether or not he's a first-round fantasy talent, whether or not you can take him in the first round with Kareem Hunt lurking, or are they second- and third-round guys, both of them. That's what I think. I think he's a second-round guy. I'd just be too nervous to waste my first-round pick. I don't know if they can both replicate their production last year, but nice box. Good stuff. You're very welcome. <laughs> All right. Moss, you want me to pick the, uh, the other two boxes here? Abe, I can go until 10.15. 10.15 is the longest I can go. That's my 10 hours. Um, so I'll probably go. I'll probably run the whole, the whole time. Because, like I said, if we can get through the slow part, which is like 5 to 7-ish, um, you know, shit, I might even just stop the stream at 9 o'clock, reload a bunch of items, and then go live all night again. Who knows? I'm a sick son of a bitch. 
I'm sick. I like to open cards. I got a problem. But yeah, I'll be on until at least 10. All right. See? I told you, these are wave one. Wave one! Say that on all of them? It does. Oh, okay. There you go, Moss. Two more T206 minis for you. Come on, buybacks. We just want to buy back one time. Shkir? All right. Mini numero uno. Brett Phillips, Andres Jimenez, rookie, Colin Moran, Glaber Torres, Tim Wakefield, Rafi Devers, Bob Gibson, Scherzer, and our parallels are going to be Jan Segura and Corey Seager. Nice sovereign back and Piedmont. So nice sovereign short print back there. Twite, Twite Nups. And box two, we have Maximilian Scherzer again. Paul Canerco, very nice Ryan Mountcastle rookie. Colin Moran again, Sixto Sanchez rookie. Josh Hader, Glaber, Beltre, and Parallels. Al Kaline, and ooh, Bo Bichette. And those are Piedmont and Piedmont. So no buybacks again, still 0 for, 0 for 18 or 16, I don't even know how many. I can't imagine that they're easy to hit, but. According to Tops, they do exist. He does exist. They do exist. <laughs> we'll get one eventually. All right, Ben's going into the Ginther two-pack box. Uh, I want to say one through nine on each side. Yeah, one through nine on each side, buddy. Skills trainer and social... One million followers? Oh, my God. That is insane. Man, and here I am. I get all, like, pumped up because I've got almost 600 followers on Instagram now. By the way, follow me on Instagram so I can get to 600. Please and thank you, everyone. <laughs> and this guy's got a million. Million. Jeez. One million. Hot damn. All right, Ben. Good luck, buddy. Buster Posey, Jay Happ, Alex Young, nice Andrew Vaughn rookie, Bregman, Warren Spahn, that is Victor Gonzalez rookie, and rallying back, the Golden Lion Tamarin. I can't even tell where one of these ends and the other one begins. Like, look at this thing. What, what am I looking at? I have no idea. Is it like, okay, I think it's maybe like up here and this other one is just climbing over its back, maybe? Yeah, I think that's what it is. But man, that is just a, an eye. Look at that. That is, that is tough to decipher. It's an optical illusion. The Golden Lion Tamarin. Springing among branches and vines in the Brazilian wetlands, golden lion tamarins are striking creatures whose population is fortunately back on the upswing. Their numbers had dwindled to as few as 200 in the wild in the 1970s due to deforestation, poaching, and other factors. Sweeping conservation efforts have boosted that number to around 3,000. I like that. Good for you, the golden lion tamarin.
<laughs> dad's out there. Yeah, it's the mom. The dad's at Target in line <laughs> waiting for the Excel vendor. <laughs> Uh, it's too funny. Definitely the mom. All right. Mickey Moniak, rookie. Jesus Lazardo, Hank Aaron, Chipper, Jay Cronenworth, Neon Dion, Alex Verdugo. That is a Ginterback mini. And October 1st, 1932, Babe Ruth historical hits in the fifth inning of Game 3 of the 1932 World Series. Ruth strode plateward with one out. That's an odd, odd turn of phrase. Strode plate word. Okay. Players in the Cubs dugout tried taunting the Yankee slugger who bellowed and gestured back prior to the 2-2 pitch. Beard appear, uh, Babe appeared to point two fingers towards center field, the spot where he drilled the next offering for his second home run of the day. His called shot. It's funny that this says that. It says he pointed two fingers towards center field. Everyone always points the bat when they imitate that. When you call your shot, you point the bat. But apparently, it was a two-finger... It's a finger gun! Bang, bang! Into the stack they go for you, Ben. Whew! All right, caught up! We did it. You are very welcome, Ben. All right. So what do we want to do, guys? Do you want to do a group break? Do you want to do a little groupy, groupy B? We're in the lull. We're still in the lull. We probably got another maybe hour or so in the lull here. Where, uh, try and keep the chat. Uh, hopefully, I, hopefully we never dip under like 12 or 13 viewers. Unless people scramble around trying to find someone that's opening something here. Um, but... I can put together a baseball mixer. I don't know if we have enough uh, people left, but yeah, Jay. So if you're looking in the the two pack box, so the box that's uh, listed at packs um, two at a time, we've only pulled one jersey, and then from the four pack box, uh, we haven't pulled anything. Um, the four pack box has twenty packs left, so there's five lots left. The two pack box, I think, has eight left. I'll have luminaries tomorrow. It didn't get to me in time. It didn't get to the warehouse in time. So, um, I did not, I wasn't able to grab it this morning. I'll have that tomorrow, though. You're welcome, Jay Stick. And Ben's, Ben's going for another two-packer. One through eight on each side, buddy. Two right, four left. All right, so a little bit more Ginter coming at you. Aaron Nola, Teddy Ballgame, Ty Cobb, Nolan Arenado, Ricky B and Ricky, Derek Lee, and nice black bordered mini, Carl Yastrzemski, and an Altuve Murad. Piazza, Al Kaline, Billy Williams, Noir, <coughs> excuse me, Bianca Smith, baseball coach, Ken Urbeck, Caldwell 104. Look how populated that galaxy is. It's like the opposite of Caldwell 35, that far distance piece of crap. Caldwell 104. One of about 150 globular clusters. If I say globular cluster one more time today. Yeah. Okay, anyway. About 150 globular clusters in our galaxy. Caldwell 104 stands out for its youth and composite. Okay. All right. Now, I know that you guys have, like, experienced things where people use words that, like, aren't necessarily normally used to describe what they're describing. Like... I still remember reading on Wikipedia that um, a 
oh my god, Boston Schweinsteiger, the soccer player, was cunning and punctual. Now, not words I would normally use to describe a soccer player. Words that I would not use to describe a galaxy are standing out for its youth and composition. So, yeah, I think that's, yeah, I would say, like, is it shiny? Is it, is it densely packed? Like, oh, the, the boyish glob, that preteen glob, preteen glob, young glob sounds definitely better. You actually, you're right, Seth, <laughs> the young glob. Anywho, scientists found it surprisingly high metal content in Caldwell 104, making its stars two, two to three billion years younger than those in the other Milky Way globulars. I feel like they're just like... Yeah, I don't know. I feel like they're just like trying to like use words here to confuse us. Is this how people that, like don't like know about sports cards feel when they come into my stream and I start talking and you just like have no idea? Because that's how I feel reading this about this globular cluster. Like I don't know what any of that shit means. I have no idea what to take away from any of that. The other ones I understood. This one, mm mm. <laughs> and our last historical hits is Stan Musel, August fifth, nineteen sixty-two. August. What is that going to be? Uh, double header against Houston, needing one hit to reach 3,500. Bases loaded in the bottom of the first. Two run single up the middle. He would add a double in the eighth for knock number 3501. Ginter came out today. I also agree with you there, Jay Stick. Yeah, a globular cluster. That's very redundant. The Department of Redundancy Department. And into Ben's pile they go. Wow, White's got 21 museum. Nice, okay. Where's that box that I opened? All right. So, brand new box of these for you, White. Give me a number one through four. Where are we going on museum, buddy? A break from the globular clusters for one second. It says number two. All right. Good luck. Let's see if we can get something to knock off one of the cards on the stand here. I don't know who's... All right. Who do we think is the low-hanging fruit on our foursome up here? The Lamelo Jersey rookie. Jersey number two of ten. LeBron cracked ice patch to six. The Bobachet NT with a half of the letter E gold RPA, 30 of 49, or the Trevor Lawrence to 10 rookie. I don't even know what the low hanging fruit is there. I feel like they're all fairly equal. Uh, there's no two up there. That's that's Trevor Lawrence to ten. <laughs> I feel like that one's not the low hanging fruit. Randy Rosarena is our parallel. Nice Sam Huff rookie. Nice Alex Kirilov rookie. Frankie, and our hit. I like the name. I saw it. I wasn't trying to. Boom. Love it. Archival autographs. Casey Mize, 109 of 200. Possible AO Rookie of the Year? I think so. Got a chance. So, very nice hit there on the Casey Mize. Love that card. And they did such a nice job this year with the archival autographs. I'm so happy they made them with the black uh, background with the silver ink. Gives it such like such a, a more high end feel than what they used to do in museum collection, which was just the um, like the silver gray background with the uh, blue ink. 
So I, for the price point for $100 a pack, I like this a lot better. $100 plus, dollars, so. Awesome, White. Nice pick. Good stuff. Alright, Mitch has got a thin pack. Alright, sweet. How many thins do I have left? Alright, Mitch, one through four. I think I have a couple thins still available if we sell out of these four. Not a ton, but a couple. Alright, buddy. So many good cards from this stuff. Let's see if we can keep it rolling here. Escher squares to 10. Lamar Jackson, 3 of 10. 2019 football. I've got a 2019 Prism football mega box left, I believe. Um, that might be the only one. And Kawhi Leonard, 47 of 50. I think that's the only one, Zoro, is my 19 Prism football mega box. So, very nice. Whole box. I think it's right around, it's a little under 200 bucks, I think. So, thank you, Mitch. I'll make you a card for today, buddy. As soon as I can find my little marker here. Yeah, I want to say it's like 190-ish. Give me half a second. I'll take a quick look here and see if there's anything else that I have for 19 football. Um, I don't think there is. Oh, I have 2019 certified football by the pack. I do have that. I forgot. Yeah, 2019 certified football I have by the pack. Um, I think I have four packs in there. I think they're I think they're around 45 or 50 bucks, somewhere in that range. Thank you, Mitch. Those are the only two 19 footballs I have on hand today. All right, Sam's up with the museum collection. All right, Sam. Let's do it, buddy. One, two, or three. Number two. All right, good luck. Make you a, a slip. Do it. Our parallel is the Copper Robin Yount. I love luminaries. David Ortiz, a nice Vlad Jr. canvas collection. Where are we looking here? Okay, going this way. That's cool. So Glaber's our canvas. I don't think I said it was Glaber. I think I just said canvas collection. Jersey patch. Scott Rowland, 12 of 25. Very nice. Love museum collection. Good stuff, Sam. Two nice picks back to back there. You are very welcome. All right, and then Oss got my, I think it's my last Tops rookie progression box. Well, I actually have another box open of that. I opened two by accident. So um, 
I have another box of that open with three packs left. If anyone wanted one, you can pick out of the, <laughs> the other box, which should have at least one auto left in it. I can't remember what came out of it, but I was uh, when I was opening stuff today for, um, for the table, I had it in the wrong spot and didn't realize, so I had two, uh, two boxes of that open, which happens more often than I'd like to say. Uh, <laughs> uh, but, yeah. I gotta, every once in a while, I gotta reorganize the packs and put them back in order. I keep them uh, alphabetically by year, but every once in a while, stuff gets moved around. Um, and then I wind up doing shit like that, like cutting open two boxes of museum collection on the same day. Duh. Real good, buff. But I guess it worked out for this situation. Uh, let me grab that rookie progression box. There it is. All right, last one of these that I have. All right, last one of our rookie progressions. Done very well on these so far. It's been a while since we opened one, but hitting a Cunha auto to 10 out of one of these. You're up right now, Austin. Or, I'm assuming it's Austin. This is you. So, we are pretty much caught up. So, we're pretty much opening uh, everything in, in real time right now. So, good luck, bud. So here's the uh, majority of the complete set, which is Astadiu, Telez, Arcia, Stewart, Loriano, Jansen, Fletcher, Adams, Bowers, Paddock, Tucker, Lowe, Eloy, Kikuchi, Urias, Duggar, Hudson, McNeil, Alonzo, Tatis, Toussaint, Senzel, Riley, Hira, Canning, Chavis, Rogers, and Biggio are the rookies. He's then got the... Vlad Jr. rookie, and behind that should be our auto, so we'll, we'll skip that. So, numbered card is Kevin Biggio, 23 of 50. Chris Paddock is your alternate photo number four. Very nice sophomore standouts of Otani. I think this is short printed to like 200 copies. It's not a lot. The print run is on Beckett. Uh, I can't remember off the top of my head. It's like 217, I think, is the number that I want to say. 217, I think, on these sophomore standouts. JS, yep, everything is in the mail from Saturday. Uh, you can always go ahead and give me a follow on Twitter at Buffs Breaks. You'll get all your shipping updates there. You also get um, your, what's it called? Um, you get tracking sent to whatever email you have on file as soon as it ships. So whatever your email is that you signed up with, you'll get a tracking email from uh, pirateship.com with your tracking number. And auto time. Hello, it's Petey. Pete Alonzo, rookie auto. Boom. Just another one. It's the polar bear. The Home Run Derby Slayer. USPS does suck, uh, but yeah, definitely definitely shipped 100%. Um, everything shipped on Monday unless you were a, um, what's it called, a uh, priority mail package, which I don't think you were. So they might just be late scanning it in. So very nice box there with the Otani and the Alonzo. It had only says scan, but USPS sucks. That's it's my sentiments exactly. At least they get it there usually more. 99.99% .99 of the time it gets there safe. But I love when I get the uh, the update that I'll get like same day, like your item is shipped and your item is delivered. I'm like, oh, okay, thanks a lot, guys. Real nice. <laughs> Thank you for that, Austin. Uh, ooh, 
WM's got some 15-16 Prism Basketball. Nice. All right, it's a fun one. Let me grab these guys. Let's get two numbers, buddy. One through seven. <laughs> One and three. All right. And again, guys, we are, after this, we'll be caught up on the queue. And hopefully we'll catch our second win here once we get to about 7 o'clock Eastern time. So tons of good items available for you guys um, all throughout the store. So <laughs> he's like, what you looking at, Yonk? All right, Easter, you ready? Or Esther, excuse me. Esther line, not Easter. I do like Easter. I like anything where people cook a lot of food. <laughs> came to the right place bad jokes and facts about trees and parrots got those by the droves all right Otto Porter Brandon Bass Fishing Kevin McHale and 2015 all-star team Mark Gasol so 400 cards set here in 2015-16 Prism. The retail packs give you one card per, um, you'll see here, in each of the 400 card areas. So you'll get one card that's 1 through 100, one that's 1 to 200, 2 to 300, and then uh, one that's 300 and above, which is where the rookies are. Unless you get a parallel, it will replace one of them. And we do have a parallel. We've got a green. I think we got a green insert coming. Okay. Andre Roberson. Matt Barnes. Fireworks insert of Mello. Ooh, okay. We've got an emergent. Green emergent. So green rookie incoming. Be someone good, please and thank you. Good luck, buddy. Oh, it's Eddie Tavares. Boo. <laughs> is not someone good. Walter, also known as Eddie Tavares. The last card in the set. Bah. Bah humbug. Well. Right card, good set, wrong player, cousin Eddie. <laughs> And I actually think it has, it does have a little bit of damage there on the bottom right corner too, unfortunately. So. I do appreciate the purchase though, bud. Next time we'll get you a, a green Jokic rookie instead. Actually, you know what? That entire, uh, that entire pack was damaged here. I don't know if you, you're going to be able to see it that well. But the corners on all of them are damaged, so we're going to do another one. Let me just mark down a note that I need to get refunded for a pack. So give me another number here, one through five on Prism. They're all damaged. No problem, buddy. Uh, not your fault. So, not my fault either, but, um, yeah. I mean, for four cards, for the price that you're paying for that, um, I don't really feel comfortable sending you a damage pack. So, I'll still send you these cards. You'll still get them, but we'll do one more here. Number one. All right. There we go. Cough is killing me today. Hopefully it doesn't last as long as my one last year did, which was like forever. 
is going on back there? Ooh, got a Ruby Waves to 350. Okay. All right, let's do it. The elusive retail Ruby Wave. I mean, they're not retail only, but first one I've pulled out of a retail pack. Number to 350. Let's get it. Fingers crossed. Robin Lopez, Tobias Harris, Victor Oladipo, and I like that. I'll take it. Paul George. Three twenty three of three fifty on the Ruby Wave. So very nice. And now I'll add that to your pile. Uh, you don't have to do that if you don't want to, buddy. It's I appreciate it, uh, but like I said, wasn't your fault, so Damage cards or damage cards. If, uh, <laughs> if there's something I can do to help you guys out when that happens, I'll do it. So that's fair. <laughs> you do. But I appreciate it. But you don't feel like you have to. So. All right. Ooh, Will's got a thin pack. What's up, Will? And he's got an F1. Nice. All right. Fun stuff here. All right, Will. Welcome to the stream, buddy. You're only like uh, seven hours too late, man. Don't you sign up for the notifications? Come on. I went on at 12 and it took you till 6.54 to come in and say hi. I thought we were tight, bro. It hurts. It hurts my heart. <laughs> All right. So actually what you can do, Will, is um, at the top of the stream, hit my name and then click on the bell icon. That way you'll, you'll get notifications just when I go live instead of getting like notifications from Loop all the time. You can just get a simple notification when I go live. Uh, new feature here. So if, any, if you haven't done that already or if anyone has done that already, please go ahead and go for it. Yeah, Craig. No one wants your notifications, Craig. <laughs> Craig... <laughs> it's funny. I feel like somehow Craig is in every stream at the same time. The guy's a ninja. He's a streaming ninja. All right. Uh, Will, give me a number one, two, or three on thins. Number two. And then F1 Sapphire, I think there's ten over here maybe. What do we got? Ten? Ten, I think. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Seven. Uh, I've seen Craig a couple times in here today. I don't know if he's here right now. But when in doubt, I just say yes. Yeah, Ski's got it. That's exactly it. Jeter Lowry. <laughs> One's clearly better than the other, and I know you know who <laughs> who's the man out of that pairing. <laughs> Schrodinger's stream, that's funny. <laughs> there you go, Will. Just so you guys know, it's um, if, if you've just started breaking with me, Will's been uh, going why going why go is Will. He's been breaking with me for a while now, and I literally, I think I've talked it up to the point where I actually just got him to admit that Kyle Lowry is obviously better than Derek Jeter. So that's what you guys are in for over the next uh, year or so. You're going to be absolutely brainwashed into saying nonsense like that. The thing is, I'm truly going to make you guys believe it. It's bad. <laughs> All right, here we go for Kyle Lowry. There he is. This was actually the Jeter pack. Patrick Mahomes, one of 25. Very nice. And, littering and, Bubba Wallace, 22 of 50. So, very nice Mahomes to start. And let's see what Kyle Lowry can do here in F1 Sapphire. All right, starting off with probably my number one underrated driver card-wise, Seb Vettel, driver of the day, Singapore. We got a vertical, James Key of McLaren, technical director. Horizontal is the Haas logo. 
and vertical. Oh, the Boatman. All right, Derek Jeter is definitely better than Kyle Lowry. Botas Grand Prix Japan. The boat ass. <laughs> you did after that pack, and that that matchup that is definitely a W for uh, for Derek Jeter. Jeter took the, took it down, hundred percent. But but good news, guys, we're only uh, eighteen days away from more racing. That was a very nice Mahomes. Those packs have been absolutely fire. I only have a couple left. Um, thick or thin. I think I've got like six thin packs total left. But thank you, Will. I appreciate you. All right, Ben. You got another T206. You want me to grab or you want to pick top or bottom? Oh, my pleasure, buddy. It's good seeing you. You hanging out for a while or uh, ripping and dipping? Yeah, I got to get those. Hopefully, we'll have them tomorrow. <laughs> Select blasters and then luminaries. Huh, nice, dude. What episode are you on? Like, what's the last thing that you saw on the show? Season 1, episode 8. Oh, okay, you got a long way to go. It only gets better. <laughs> so good. I watched the whole thing in a day and a half, so. All right, here we go, buddy. Good luck, Ben. Gibson, Sonny Gray, Adrian Beltre, Jim Palmer, Al Kaline, Josh Hader, Canerco, Will Myers, and our parallels are Ozzy Smith. And nice, a Ryan Mountcastle rookie. I like that. Let's see what we got here. Mountcastle is Piedmont and Piedmont. A lot of Piedmonts today. I think we had uh, only one non-Piedmont. Uh, <laughs> the original Honus, I would say 0%. <laughs> I would go zippy. Zippy on the Honus. You're welcome, Ben. Uh, your stack's over here, buddy. Yeah, I would say 0% to hit a Honus. Um, <laughs> love to see it, though. All right, Josh has got a draft jumbo. Top or bottom, Josh? Where are we going? Chwop. All right. So if you want two, you can just buy the other one. <laughs> All right. Go up, dude. Got either an auto or a numbered card coming. Or a sky blue parallel, possibly. Ooh, we got gold. We got gold coming. Nolan Gorman, Manoa first, Little, Josh Jung first, Cairo, Johnson, Nova, Canarino, Armenteros, Baum, Mauricio, Gorski, Baker, Mears, Adams, Thompson, Downs, Goss, Water, Shoemake first, Rooker, and Wander, followed by Evan Fitter. Chromes of Ryan Weathers, Ethan Hankins, Jake Sanford first, Refractors, Domingo Acevedo, and Justin Slayton. Franchise Futures, Andrew Vaughn and Matthew Thompson. There's a nice one. Andrew Vaughn Chrome first. Very nice. And an Eric Miller first. And our gold. Non-auto, Bryant Packard. Two of 50. Gold first from the Tigers. Fifth round. 351 hitter at UConn in college. So, Brian Packard and two Andrew Vaughn. So, pretty nice pack. And 
end. Esther's got another prism. All right, buddy. One through four. Where are we going? Just in time, dude. One through four. You're up. Number four. See if we can get ourselves a name here. All right, no parallels or inserts in this pack, so. Come on, rookie. Darren Collison. There's a nice one. Kyrie. And again, 15 16 is the last year um, before they started making like crazy, crazy retail amounts of this stuff. So, this is like the last year you see like low. Uh, low print runs on base cards and stuff like that. So for those of you that are out there keeping track, 1670 was the year they really started ramping up um, retail production. So David Robinson and your rookie. It's going to be a rookie, I believe. It is a rookie. Okay. Ooh, I kind of like that color. It's bluish. Maybe a Towns? Oh, fake out. Tyus Jones. Oh, the wrong timber pup. <laughs> but thank you, Esther. So close. So close on that one. Uh, Chronicles Fat Pack, what do they look like? They look like a fat pack filled with Chronicles cards. Give me a second, I'll grab you one. I'll show you. We've been hot with Chronicles Fat Packs today. Real hot. This is a Chronicles Fat Pack. We've opened three today, hit five trays and a Luca, including a uh, Obsidian Preview tray. So we've done very well. Been hot with those today for sure. Oh, nice. Josh has got a 19 Chronicles pack. I like these. All right, buddy. Give me a number, one through six, fresh box here. Uh, you did, you did, Esther. You had two packs, four Trey Youngs, and then someone else got a pack, and they had a Trey and a Luca. All right, Josh, here we go, buddy. I think we got a hit in here. All right. I don't even know who that is. Casey Martin? Corbin Martin. Casey, yeah, why would it be Casey Martin? Corbin Martin. Nice Otani. Carter Keyboom, Rookies and Stars rookie. Our hit. That's a cool one. Hometown Heroes, Gold, Duel, Frank Thomas, Jersey and Bat, 12 of 99. So that's a neat one. Followed by Bryce Harper Crusade. And Prism Titan Silver Prism's rookie, Kevin Biggio. Followed by Rizzo Certified. And a status green parallel of Bryce Harper. So, nice pack there, highlighted by the Biggio Titan and obviously the Thomas Duel. Uh, I'd have to check for you, Esther. I have to look and see. Give me a minute, I will check for you. Uh, Ben's got 2020 Heritage. Where are those guys? Where you at, Heritage? Where you at, girl? <laughs> there they are. All right. Pick two, one through four, bud. And one more number, Ben. Two and four. All right. All right. 
bear with me half a second. I just want to check on that for Esther while he's still in here. Uh, 15, 16. Uh, I can do them at 2.30 for the three. So it's like 10 bucks off the lot. Uh, if you want them, just let me know and I can change the price on one of them. <laughs> or actually, I'll just make you your own listing if you want them. I'll delete the other ones. Uh, do you want them? Just, just say y yes, I want them. Or Okay. Let me do these two packs here and I will, uh, I'll take care of that for you. All right, Ben. Oh, baby. That's awesome, Will. That's huge. Ooh, we got a Sky Blue Refractor. First one of these I've hit out of uh, Bowman Heritage. Glaber, Boz, Lazardo, Duran, Miller. I like that Igor a lot. You know I like that, Rangers. Nick Allen, Seth Brown, rookie. Nice first year, Bobby Witt. Zach Brown and a Sky Blue Refractor. To 99, Oscar Gonzalez. Okay, Shiny. Yeah, I'm happy they locked up Igor, too. Sad we had to let Booch go, but, I mean, Cap Casualty had to do it. Weren't going to be able to pay him, but... Dustin May, rookie. Pena, Taylor Trammell, Nick Bennett, Whit Merrifield, Matt Manning, Helio Ramos, black and white. Chrome, Alice Kirloff, and Chrome, Miguel Vargas. That should be a first year for Vargas. It is the first year. And an Ison Diaz, rookie. Thank you, Ben. A couple nice cards in there. Love me some Bobby Witt. I don't think I can... I can't stomach giving up what they will have to give up for Eichel for a guy with a bulging disc in his neck. Can't do it. Or degenerative neck... Whatever the hell his thing is. Can't do it. Don't want it. Good player, but pass. For the what the Sabres are asking, so... All right, Easter, I'm going to add that into the bottom of the basketball section. It's just going to have your name. And we'll say 3X1516 Prism Retail Pack. That's going to be at the bottom of the basketball section for you, bud. And real quick, I just want to double check and see if I have any more backups of that available. If not, I'm going to have to pull the other ones out of the store. I don't. Oh, I do, okay. Yeah, I do have a couple more of those available, so I'm going to leave the other ones in the store. If anyone wants them, you can go ahead and still, still purchase a couple more in my backup box. So, um, last 19 Bowman Draft Jumbo from this bunch. For you, Josh. Awesome, Jay. You are uh, you are up next with the Chronicles Fat Pack. So just hang tight. The, <laughs> the Jokic and Booker box. The backup box. Jokic and Booker box. <laughs> All right, got another numbered or auto in here. And another Andrew Vaughn. Vaughn Paper this time to go with the Chrome and the answer from last time. Eric Miller, Dos Axis, Liberator, Driscoll, Ornelas, Jimmy Lewis, Vince Fernandez, Wisniewski, Cower, Evan Edwards, Gilliam, <coughs> Murphy, Walner, White, Malone, Diesel Bell, Arias, Espino, Cal Mitchell, Joey Bart, Jake Agnos. Nice JJ Vlade first. And Eric Rivera. We've been hot on Chronicles today, Will. Like, so hot. Chromes, Cameron Meisner, Domingo Acevedo, and Cam Cannon. Refractors, Andres Jimenez and Aaron Schunk. Draft breakdown, number nine, Shea Langoliers, Kyle Isbell and Antoine Kelly are the other chromes, and a purple. Very nice, I like that. Matt Allen, let's go Mets, 133 of 250. With our, by far and away, our best player in this draft. 
Um, signed in the second round. We had to pay him a lot of money, though, to get him in the second round. Projected top 10 talent. Um, so, nice one there on the Allen, 133 of 250. Third round they took him. I thought it was the second round. Third round. But, yeah, they paid him, like, first round money. They didn't think anyone's going to be able to draft him because he wanted too much. But let's go Mets. <laughs> Just leave, man. So, so freaking Mets. The most typical Mets thing in the world. Rave about how lucky they are that Rocker dropped to them at 10, then realize his arm is completely fucked and don't sign him. Go Mets. Like, way to do your due diligence before the draft, you idiots. <laughs> so stupid. Ah, oh, we're a train wreck. That franchise. Just waiting to lose. I mean, have we already, have we given away the division lead yet? If not, it's coming any day now. So, that's always fun. <laughs> oh, we're so bad. Got a couple more packs left of 19 drafts. So I'm going to add those back into the store real fast, and then we'll get to that Chronicles pack for you, buddy. second bud double check pricing on 19 draft got it all right so the other little the other couple packs i had from that box are now in at the bottom half of the baseball section for anyone who's interested i've listened to them a couple times um not enough to know that they're mets fans but yeah it's probably just it's probably tough it's probably hard for that guy uh, trust me, uh, I know firsthand. <laughs> All right, Jay, give me a number one through five. It's probably easy to be a uh, a radio host though in New York. I mean, it's just it's so inept everywhere, like every franchise. It feels like number two. Never run out of things to talk about. Literally never lacking conversational topics. Ever. Never, ever. All right, Jay, let me make you a slip for today, buddy. Let's see if we can keep the uh, Trey and Luca train rolling here. I'd love to see a Luca Obsidian. Already hit the Trey Obsidian today. Luca would be nice. All right, good luck, buddy. Base cards are Wiggins, Kuzma, and nice little bonus. Get a rookie in the base card instead of DeAndre Ayton. Marquis. Miles Bridges. Followed by Studio of Colin Sexton. A couple nice names. And another bonus. Your bronze is another rookie, Mo Bamba. Ooh, that's the right color. It's red. Can we do it? Can we crusade a tray? It is his teammate, Kevin Herter, for your premium hit. So, still very nice. Playoff of Melton, Jaron Jackson, Luminance, and we are still hot. Trey Young, Panini Base. Jaron Jackson, Playoff, another good one. Elia Kobo, Panini Base, Kevin Herter, and your two score exclusives. Bruce Brown, and Omari Spellman. This class is very good. I mean, it's just like Jackson, Sexton, I, all those guys. Porter Jr., you just forget about him. Aiton, <laughs> Bamba, like loaded class. Both the bridges is, 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 is. Jalen Brunson's still in there. I mean, there's so many guys. So thank you, Jay. Happy to hit you a tray. Six trays and a Luka today. Out of four packs. You are very welcome, my friend. All right, and then WM, you got the last three prisons I got here on the table. All right. 
and I've got uh, three hours left of streaming. Three hours before my uh, my stream cuts itself off and reaches the ten hour limit. So let's keep it rolling, guys. But well, here we go, WM. Let's see if we can get you something here. Tony Parker, J.R. Smith, Spree, and a James Harden All-Star is pack one. MKG, DeAndre Jordan, Sean Livingston, and... Mark Gasol, all NBA. Saving the best for last, I hope. I hope. <laughs> wow. All right. Got a rookie, at least, on this one. Jeremy Lin. Michael Carter Williams. Nice second year Zach Levine. That's a nice one. And a rookie. All right. This time it's got to be it's got to be Towns, right? Nope, it's a Piston. Stanley Johnson. Those colors are identical. Stanley Johnson, a lottery pick, got himself some playing time in the Raptors as a straight line drive, uh, 3 and D kind of player, don't know if he's going to continue on in the league though to be honest, don't know, so Stanley Johnson and Zach Levine, the second year Zach Levine, the highlights there, so not our best set of packs, sorry buddy. Oh, Z's got a couple Father's Days. Okay. Do I have to add in more Father's Days? I think I might have to. Oh, no, I got him in there. Okay. All right, Z. I think you got three of these. Right? Correct. Three. Three. Uh, one through seven. Give me three numbers, bud. Where are we going? One, two, three, four. All right. Easy peasy. Okay. Good luck. Starting off with Christian Yelich and a very nice Jamar Chase rookie. What's up, Diggit? You back, buddy? Diggit's back. It's funny, I was actually just thinking, what, what kind of group break can we do? And I was like, oh, maybe we should do a Trinity uh, hit draft. And then you popped right in the room as soon as I was thinking that. Nice, LeBron. And Devin Booker. Dig it's in for a Trinity hit draft. Hard not to be in a, for a Trinity hit draft. They're cheap. I think it's probably like 30 like 38 bucks. Might be cheaper than that. Probably like 36. I don't know. Pack three. Getting all the NBA superstars here. Giannis and it's gonna be Lawrence or Etienne. It's Etienne this time. So a couple nice rookies and a lot of good names. Etienne rookie, Giannis Booker, LeBron, Jamar Chase rookie, and a Yelich. So thank you, Z. 
And we are caught up. Caught up. Would you look at that? Caught up. 7.23 p.m., 134 hour, uh, orders later. Man, you guys kick ass on a Wednesday. Look at that. How many unique buyers? 2, 4, 6, 8, 10, 12, 14, 16, 18, 20, 22, 24, 26, 28, 30, 32, 34, 36, 38, 42, 4, 6, 8, 52, 4, 6, 8, 59. Hot damn. Let me know when you're done, Z, because I, I, I'll grab more packs. I'm going to get a couple more. So go ahead, okay, you're good, Z. Go ahead and pick a, you want me to pick? All right, we'll go one, three, four, five, six, and seven. All of Kyle Lowry's numbers as a professional. All right, let's do it, bud. Starting off with, very nice, Messi, and a rookie, Devonta Smith. So solid first pack. What's up, Alex? Azaketo and Madden, welcome. Welcome to the stream. Pack two. Nice Morant, love those jerseys. And Joel Embiid, I think you've hit literally every basketball player you can possibly hit in this. And? Ooh, ooh, I think Kyle Lowry did good. All right, the Kyle Lowry packs did well. Nice James Wiseman rookie in the back. And in the front, how about Tyrese Halliburton, hollow rookie, 113 of 199. Good job, Kyle Lowry packs, 137, very nice. Pretty much all basketball, too. That was pretty wild. Like six straight packs that were basically almost all basketball. With the exception of the football rookies and that messy. Good stuff, Z. Oh, P's back for another silver. I like this. Running low on these guys. Last two that I got in the store. I can reload. I got a, a couple left over. I don't even know how many. It's not a lot. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. So I'll, I'll put the last eight in, and then I am out of silver packs from Panini. I still have case breaker packs, but that'll be the end of the silver packs. <laughs> he says, no, 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 no. So these are the last two. You want these or you want to pick out of all ten, P? Buff! Tang! <laughs> Take these? Okay. Let me uh, just throw the last eight in the store here for everyone else. I never remember pricing. Too many products. I have 286 different SKUs. Actually, 288, <laughs> I think, today. <laughs> so, that's uh, a lot. Okay. All right, so the last eight Panini packs that I possibly have are in the store now, but Mania is going to crush these two first. 
And just so you know, guys, no pressure, but we are, I think, on pace to set another record today. So I'm going to take two seconds and let you guys know that um, when I left for the National Convention, when I left for my wedding and then to go to the National, uh, I believe I had already held the loop record for most orders in a single stream. Um, it was 181. The first stream I did when we came back um, from all that, from like three weeks worth of travel, essentially for me, was this past Saturday, and we set the record at 185. Right now, we've got about a little under three hours of streaming left, and we're sitting at 138. I will definitely do some stuff like that, Mania. Um, I'm a one-man operation here, so um, while I have all these ideas for great promos and stuff like that, uh, every moment of my time that I have is uh, to work on shipping for you guys. Shipping and product, because I have to do everything. Um, so, yeah. My brother's supposed to be uh, moving down here to help me out. He just he still can't find an apartment. So, um, once I get him here to kind of alleviate some of these back, um, all the time I spend on the back end, it takes me almost three hours to enter my product into the store every day, every time I want to go live. Um, I have to do the inventory by myself afterwards. I have to do all my accounting, obviously all the shipping. So, and that's on top of my actual job. So, um, trust me, I have great ideas for promos and all that stuff, including like a prize wheel, um, all kinds of cool shit. But I got to get my little brother's uh, bony ass down here ASAP Rocky. So that way I can actually start putting some of uh, my time into that. But trust me, you guys will see it. Um, I know you guys have, that have been here from the beginning with me have slowly seen some of these improvements as far as like streaming quality, mats, stuff in the background, all this other stuff. So uh, that'll probably be the next step, though, is something that's more geared toward you guys. Um, I've got some merchandise on the way, so all kinds of stuff. But uh, Ray? Ray still works with the company. Ray's got a lot going on, though. Um, so... Yeah, Ray still works for Blah. Um, he still helps me out with all my tech stuff. But uh, he's doing his own thing with, um, what's it called? Uh, still think he does a couple Facebook breaks. He does a lot with uh, Fortnite stuff, so. Uh-oh. Autos! All right, so we got, we got a Parallel 5 on the front and an Auto on the back. On the front, we just called his name a bunch over in 19 Bowman Draft. Andrew Vaughn, rookie, 5 of 5. And it's auto time. I just want to see a 1 of 1 auto, please. Cracked ice again, so probably not a 1 of 1. Probably not a 1 of 1. Cracked ice auto. Good luck. Oh, that's nice. Emmanuel quickly. Two of ten. Quickly, rookie auto. Boom. Good pack. And thin pack number two. Quickly is a dog, man. I like him. He uh, he works hard. I think he'll fit. He fits in well on that team too. All right, Escher squares to ten. Another nice one. Tyrese Halliburton rookie. We are on a run of nothing but good basketball players in all the Panini packs. I would have to concur with you, Tang. I think he is one of the those perfect type fits for that city. Someone that they need a hard worker, not like a prima donna. Pretty much the exact opposite of what the Knicks have had for the past 20 years. So, another nice Halliburton, though. We get the 199 of this in the Father's Day pack. Now we have 10 of 10 here on the Escher Squares parallel. On this one, Mania, it's the 10. Followed by James Harden, 1 of 50 on the Impact parallel. So, awesome stuff. 
Quickly to 10, auto. Halliburton to 10, rookie. Vaughn, rookie to 5. And, oh, the worst card is just this stupid James Harden to 50. Huh. Uh, stuck in pending, Z-Bomb. Good choice. That's the second time that worked today, Mania. That's how this uh, Trevor Lawrence got pulled. I, I offered to grab a new set of packs. I said, no, I want the last two. So, it's kind of the theme of the day here. I think uh, whatever's on the table, we'll go for it if I try and offer you ones that are uh, <laughs> from somewhere else. Alright guys, hold on one second here. I gotta get Z-Bomb's thing in pending, so bear with me. Let me find it for you, Z. Uh, was it the full box or the packs? I should be able to find Z either way, just by scrolling. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Scroll, scroll, scroll. Man, my shoulder's actually getting tired from the scrolling. There it is, I see it. All right, it's, uh, it should be fixed now. You can try it again, Z. I got it. Yep, you can try it again now. Uh, box of Ginter. I didn't put any boxes of Ginter in the um, in the store, but a couple of people have asked me. I didn't put them in there just because it's a pain in the ass for me to ship a full box, but I'd still do it. Um, let me just. I think I. I think one fifty five is going to be the price, but let me double check. I can do like 158. Yeah, I can do 158 if you wanted a full box um, of the Ginters. And I think it was the first person to ask about the George Russell. There's my George that just came in. That is correct. That is the 25. And I do have more select megas, Trevor. Um, I've got. There should be another full box in the store. Um, and if you're looking for more packs, just let me know. I can add in more packs as well. Uh, I think the full box was one, 140 or 150. Give me a second here. I'll, <laughs> I'll just look at my spreadsheet instead of trying to find it in the, in the, <laughs> the store there. Uh, 2020 select was 140. 140 for the full box, for the mega box. All right. And we can do it, guys. 46 more orders, and we've got two, a little over two and a half hours. 46 orders will set the record. I have faith in you all. All right, Z's got mega box red packs, so these are the last, last two that I have. Do you want me to go get a new box? <laughs> or do you want to stick with them? Got a stick, right? That's what I think. That's what I think, too. All right. Good luck, brother. Oh. CD Lamb. Nice Josh Kelly red. And we got a copper. Field level copper. Nice. Be someone good. Jake from State From. Two fifteen of three fifty five, And a Michael Thomas club level. Uh, Trevor, we go to the all section, not the available section. There's a little glitch um, where, for some reason, um, people aren't being able to see all of the items that I have available if they're on the available tab. So go over to the all tab and try looking for it on there. Montana. And look at that. You got the red die cut, too, from the field level. Xavier McKinney, Giants first rounder out of Bama. Excited for him this year. Be fully healthy. So I like that card. 
Unbreakable, Ed Reed, and uh, best player in football, Aaron Donald. So two nice packs there. Got the uh, two field level die cut parallels. Very nice. Wait, Blake Martinez collects Pokemon? That's interesting. I'm going to have to... Uh, that's interesting for me. Okay, that's good to know. I did not know that he collects Pokemon, and uh, that's actually very interesting. Hey, Moody, or Craig, any of you guys in here? Oh, no problem, P-Mania. Thank you for the purchase. I appreciate you. Uh, Austin Dillon rip Or Austin Dillon, he said, okay, rips on whatnot. I didn't know that. That's kind of cool. I didn't know Blake Martinez ripped either. That's weird. Two Packers, or well, X-Packer, I guess, for Martinez. And then A.J. Dillon here, so. All right. Fish is going into 18 Heritage High number. It's a brand new box. Let me cut that open for you, bud. Uh, yeah, Z, give me a second, I'll grab it for you. <coughs> Yeah, we were talking about Cassius Marsh. <coughs> we know about. We know that he does it. Um, I didn't know they were up together. That's funny. All right. I didn't grab any NC because uh, <coughs> I only had the option. <coughs> excuse me. To get a full case, and I was hoping to just get a box for today. But um, they only, I only have the option to grab a full case. So I did not grab it because I didn't want to have to cut open a case um, if I can just wait till tomorrow and get a box, which is what I'm hoping for. So we'll see. Yeah, I didn't want to, I didn't want to drop down $20,000 on a case when I, I don't know if that's something I could sell on here. Um, so, yeah. But um, a box I can, I'd love to grab. So we'll see, we'll see about tomorrow. But Fish, go ahead and give me two numbers. You got left, center, right, one through eight on each. One left, one right, okay. Jesus, 7K, my God. I feel like it's easier to sell the first off the lines because you're guaranteed the, uh, what's it called? You're, you're guaranteed the RPAs. So I... I... <laughs> All right, Fish, let me make you a card. I mean, I'd rather pay the extra money to guarantee myself the RPA, because getting a no RPA box is just like a punch in the gut, unless you get lucky and hit like a Logo Man box, but... And uh, I'll get the Slot Teemo box for you. Um, and show you right after this when I get Trevor's Mega Box. Z. That'd be worth more. Exquisite would definitely be worth more. Because they have, I mean, they have Jordan and LeBron. It's because of the exclusive contracts. That's why it would be worth more. All right. There we go, Fish. Good luck. Get to Gope. Caesar. Miles Michaelis, Lucky. Uh, rookie, Lord is Guriel rookie, and nice rookie performers, Raphael Devers. Followed by Austin Meadows rookie, Tony Watson, Pedro Alvarez, and Ryan Yarborough rookie. A lot of good rookies in there. Yarborough, Guriel, Devers, and Meadows. That's pretty much every good second tier rookie you could possibly have. Now let's get a good first tier. Ryan Flaherty. Sal Romano, Brandon Drury, Thomas Nitto, Didi, Now and Then, Jamie Barea, Drew Robinson, Adam Adovino, and Adeni Hechevarea. So a lot of good second-tier rookies in that first pack. Uh, probably headlined by Yarborough, Devers, and Meadows. But <laughs> no Otani or Acuna that time. But thank you, Fish. Um... 
We've got, I think it's Trevor, right? Yeah, Trevor, give me a, I actually have two of them sitting over here. So do you want top or bottom on the Select Red Mega Box? Let me know what we're thinking. Top or bottom on those. And I'm going to grab a team wall box to show Z. This is what Team All looks like. They're just a small little one like that. Uh, yeah, Trevor, top or bottom, buddy? Which red mega box do you want? And then this is, like I said, this is the Team All. So, bottom. All right. All right. Good luck, Trev. Make you a slip for today. Rack them and, uh, and stack them, buddy. Good luck. And J Block bringing the sapphire. I love it. A little soccer, uh, soccer fun. We haven't done any soccer today. I don't think we did any soccer last Saturday either. Good luck, buddy. Thielen, CJ Ham, red die cut rookie, and a good start. Turbocharge, Justin Herbert. DeAndre Swift rookie, nice. Patty Mahomes, and a Jerry Judy premier level red die cut. Peterson Turbocharge, Duvernay club level, T. Higgins rookie, and well, there it is. About as good as you can do. One per box. Field level red die cut rookie. And you got the best one in the set. Justin Herbert. Hello. Little retail magic, baby. Welcome to Buffs Breaks, Trevor. <laughs> we take care of you. What's up, Greg? When did you get in here, buddy? Two packs, two Herberts, piece of cake. <laughs> God knows. <laughs> Michael Thomas, Hot Stars, Thielen, James Morgan, The Loop Celeb, A.J. Dillon, <coughs> Drew Locke, Silver Prison, James Morgan Field Level, Derek Henry, and I guess we'll just keep the, uh, the red quarterback train rolling here. Mahomes, Club Level, very nice. I guess we got to hit a Brady next, right? Warner, Unbreakable, Claypool Rookie, Luton. My drinking buddy, Lawrence Taylor. Is this my hotel? And nice jersey match, Cesar Ruiz, Rookie out of Michigan. 
That is the bronze to 355. 123 of 355. Quintez Cephas, Jerry Judy rookie, James Robinson, red die cut rookie, LaVisca Chenault certified, Watson, Van Jefferson, KJ Hamler, red die cut rookie, and nice second one of these today, CEH, silver rookie. This is the premier level this time. Followed by Henry Ruggs, Palomalu, Raekwon Davis, Ramajama, Yellow Hama, give him hell, Alabama. Snorting the devil's dandruff, man. He was ch <laughs> chugging Johnny Walker Black doubles at the uh, the hotel bar. Not even knowing what hotel he was in. My guy. What a life. Hot stars, Aaron Rodgers, Zeke, Tyler Johnson, a Matthew Stafford, and LaVisca. Nice. What a good box. That is 78 of 355 on the Chenault. And finishing up with a KJ Hamler Premier Level Rookie. Great box, Trevor. Great box. The Herbert Field Level Red, the Mahomes Club Level Red, the CEH Silver. All very nice. Hit the Herbert uh, Turbo Charge, too. Why not, right? Uh, you're very welcome, buddy. I appreciate you. Thanks for checking out the stream. And again, if you guys haven't done so already, make sure at the top of the stream you uh, take advantage of the new feature here. Click on my name, click on the little bell icon, and you will get notified every time I go live. Uh, cards in the back are not for sale. This is all stuff that we've pulled today. So the Lamelo, quick uh, quick recap of our I guess I guess our four best hits today, which is debatable. Lamelo, <laughs> jersey number two of ten. LeBron patch five of six. This very nice Beau Bichette with half the letter E from the nameplate, 2020 NT RPA Gold, 30 of 49. And Trevor Lawrence, Elite 2001, Gold Rookie, 4 of 10. Then the other card in the back is mine. I always put one of my cards on stream. Where are you going, George? Don't fall down, buddy which is a George Russell Sapphire Variation Orange, 14 of 25. So it's always good to have a little eye candy, you know? A little bit of candy. All right, that's going to take us to, oh, Park's going, all right, he's going F1 Sapphire. I love it. All right, Park, my man. We're due for a good, uh, a good one. First pack today, we hit a Max Aqua to 99. Not the true driver, but that's been our best F1 card today. So where are we going? One through, I think, nine. Eight, one, two, three, four. One through nine. Four. Yeah, the Bichette's pretty tight. We were, uh, we were pretty happy when we pulled that one. It's pretty cool. All right. Good luck, Park. Starting off with Charles Leclerc, Great Britain, driver of the day. It's like we got all verticals here. I like this. All vertical pack. Nice. Carlos Sainz from McLaren. Now Ferrari. This is what Ferrari said they have the best one-two punch in uh, in all of F1 right now. That's what Bonotto said about Leclerc and Sainz. Pretty good duo, to be honest. Tied for third in the uh, Constructors Championship right now with McLaren, but I think Ferrari's technically third based off of tiebreakers. I think it's podiums or something. But next one, Yan Man Chao, Alfa Romeo Orlin, and... Ooh, that kind of ooh maybe is that sitting? I think we might have a nice card here. Is this a? I don't know what this is actually. It's kind of confusing. I don't know. We'll see. All right. Oh, bummer. Okay. Hamilton Grand Prix Abu Dhabi. I couldn't tell if it was someone sitting. I didn't know that. I couldn't tell what the hell that was down there. 
It was him holding his helmet. Abu Dhabi. Still very nice to hit a Hamilton. Hamilton and a Signs. So, and a Leclerc. I was hoping it was going to be George, but I was like, no, I, I literally have the variation down there. I know that his leg goes wide. Whole day, BGS. <laughs> Since noon. I got two hours. I got about two hours and 20 minutes to go here. No problem, Park. Sorry, nothing huge, but a couple nice cards in there with the Hamilton, the Signs, and the uh, Charles Leclerc. So. I'd go longer, man. I'd go 15 hours, 16 hours if the stream let me. It stops me. It won't let me. So, days like this where I'm like, I'm like in the zone, I would literally, I want to stream, that's like my, uh, my thing is I want to do a full 24 hour stream, um, no breaks, outside of obviously, you know, if I have to pee, but, <laughs> it's a safety feature to protect me. <laughs> yeah, the 16 hour day, it was, it was technically, it was just under 16, it was like 15 hours and like 30 minutes or 35 minutes, that was awesome. I had so much fun that day. Butters is thankful. <laughs> I would love to do a 24-hour stream. That would be so much fun. Uh, yeah, uh, these ones back here, Jordan. I can show them. I just showed them, but I'll show them one more time. Why not? Can never get enough look at uh, looks at the hits. So these are what I deem probably our best four of the day, which is this Lamella Ball, 2 of 10, jersey number. We also had a exact same card of Messi, um, the extra squares from that set to 10, which uh, just got dethroned. That was the most recent card to get kicked off the stand. Um, but LeBron James, cracked ice patch, five of six, which is an eBay one of one because if you add his jersey number together, it's five, and then if you multiply it, it's six. So clearly, mathematician's uh, one of one here. And this is not a pull. This is just my card of the day that I put back here, which is this George Russell, Sapphire Orange to 25, variation. This is a Beau Bichette 2020 National Treasures RPA Gold. Uh, it's got half the letter E from the name uh, nameplate. F1 is through the roof right now. I love it. It makes me so happy. I mean, I don't love it that it cost you guys too much to open it, but I'm just excited that it's finally... You know, we've talked about it a million times here about the price was, it was going to go up, it was going to go up, and then, boom, just like that. Uh, I just like being right. <laughs> so I like when I tell you guys stuff and it happens. Um, but in this case, I wish it was still cheaper so we could keep opening it, but, you know, it is what it is. Uh, but this was the last one on the, the stand. <laughs> uh, 2021 Elite first off the line. Gold exclusive Trevor Lawrence in the 2001 throwback design. Um, four of ten. <laughs> um, S Board Crew got the Boba Shed. Uh, they bought two full boxes of National Treasures Baseball today. So, a couple good cards, but we're up with uh, J Block now for some soccer. So, let's see what we got here. We've got two Bundesliga Sapphire packs and then a Finest UEFA mini box. All right. You hear Block? You hear, homie? I have seen NT NASCAR. We've opened a couple of them. Uh, it's loaded. It's absolutely loaded, especially for the price point. Um, give me two numbers, one through five, on Bundesliga Sapphire. I'm probably going to see if I can grab some uh, NT NASCAR. i got to get some, some NASCAR here in the store. I don't have any. And then let me find Finest Soccer. We pulled a Haley Deegan out of the last box we did. It was a long time ago, but uh, Haley Deegan on card to 25 was nice. <laughs> Minus the UEFA mini box, right? Brand new open mini box. I don't think so. Okay. It's UEFA, not Euro, right? You got finest UEFA. <laughs> finest UEFA, okay, cool. All right, front or back box here on the finest UEFA mini, J Block. Where are we going? She was nice. <laughs> the card was also nice. The card, it was nice. Haley Deegan herself, she was also nice. Just nice all the way around. All right, and there's our 
front mini. All right, let's start with the Bundys. Actually, let's start by making you a card. And we are 41 orders away from setting the record, folks. 41 orders. We got two hours. It's an order every three minutes. It's a tall task, but I have faith in you guys. If not, we'll try again tomorrow. <laughs> All right. A little soccer smorgasbord here. Some Bundy Sapphire and then UEFA Finest for my man J Block. Good luck. Let's see if we can get some Blue Coco, some Jude. All right, Josh Kimmich, Joaquin Nilsson, Omar Mascarell, and Dennis Zakaria. Sapphire Pack 2. Floor Inverts. Amini Hart. Oliver Bauman. And an insert. Marcus Ingvartsen. Future Stars from Union Berlin. So a couple of nice ones there. None of the big three, but a solid selection of guys. Well, Minga Tuka is the other one we are uh, looking for there in <coughs> oh, excuse me. Sapphire Bundesliga. But it is finest time. And this will catch us up on the queue, guys. So if anyone would like anything, please go ahead and place your orders now, as you will be up as soon as we finish these. start right on top it's our boy Pedri it's uh, one of the better base rookies to start Latura Martinez Malik Tillman rookie Ferran Torres and Speckle can't stop pulling this guy man Dennis Borkowski rookie I pull him non-stop in a uh, museum collection and Chrome UEFA just always that is unnumbered Lucina Traore rookie, Dimitri Payet, Kai Havertz, and hello. There you go. Hey, Jude. Very nice. Jude Bellingham, refractor rookie. Very nice. See if we can do better. I think we can still one up that. Kimmich, finest footwork. There's Borkowski again. Tete rookie. Nico Williams rookie. Prize footballers, John Terry. I like that too. Speckle Pulisic. Another good card. His stuff is uh, picked back up a little bit now that he's apparently healthy to start the season for Chelsea. Greetsman, uh, Noah Okafor rookie, Chris Richards, Brandon Williams. That's going to be our auto, I believe, that green wave right there. It is, so we'll save it. Uh, David Neris, Ronaldo, Trent Alexander-Arnold, Illich, Greetsman refractor, Mitch Baker rookie, Marley Aki rookie, Romero Barrow rookie, Eric Garcia rookie, and a prize footballers of Marcus Rashford. And Green Wave Auto, Neon Green, Refractor. Ooh, Junior Moraes. 
43 of 99 from Shakhtar Donsk. So, very nice box there. I like that a lot. Well done. Good pick on front box. That was good stuff. All right, guys. We are caught up. Caught up on the queue. Caught up. So if anyone would like anything, feel free to go ahead and grab it now. In the meantime, uh, if anyone would like me to put together a group break of sorts, we have uh, a couple things that we can do. Um, I do have another gold standard football hit draft already in the store at 115 a spot. That is a five-person draft for anyone who is interested. Um, all you have to do for that one is go ahead and pay. And when we fill up, we will do the randomizer. And the top three people in the randomizer will each get one card. Spots four and five will snake draft the hits backwards and each wind up with two cards. Um, I could do a divisional break of something. I could always do divisionals. I mean, I could do a baseball divisional mixer. Um, those are always the easiest for me to put together because I can just make them crazy with so many hits. Do you want me to do that? Should we put together a baseball divisional mixer here? I think we should. <coughs> I'm going to do it. Why not? <laughs> to Jason Arzy. I could do that. I could easily do that. Piece of cake. I will grab your <laughs> Fortnite Mega Box in one second there, card stash. Let me just finish accumulating product here for my baseball mixer. Uh, this mega box first for card stash same thing buddy okay no problem I will do that for you uh, let me do this for card stash and then I will put the mixer on the table after it uh, let me just find my Fortnite bag is where I got them hiding is the real question Fortnite oh Fortnite there we go So this is the box that you did not choose last time. All right. Good luck. That should make you a slip for today. And then I think we've got some Ginter after this. And then I will put the, uh, I'll get the group break, the baseball divisional right after that. As soon as we get caught up again here. But if anyone's interested in personals, feel free to go ahead and grab it. I think uh, the baseball mixer I put together will probably be in the, what is that, one, three, four, five, six, fifty, seven, eight, fifty, nine, fifty. I think it's probably going to be in the $160 range, $170 range. We'll see. Actually, I'll put that on the table real fast after we do this box. That way we can work on filling it while we do the rest of these personals that are going to wind up coming through. I'm going to try and open it so we don't spoil the back one. I'm just going to do it high so that way you don't see. 
All right. So we're going <coughs> to ship all those sealed, but don't remember who that is off the top of my head. But behind that, I know who that is, and that is a legendary Glimmer. So very nice. Two Mega Boxes, two legendary Crystal Shards for you. Glimmer, and the first one was Aura. So, nice one. Very nice. And I will ship these packs to you sealed. I can open them if you want me to, but if you want me to ship them sealed, I can do that too. It doesn't make a difference to me. Okay, sealed it is. Awesome. Good stuff there. All right, and very quickly, guys, I know we have a couple more purchases. Uh, let me just add up this group break here for baseball and see what the number comes out to real fast. You're welcome, Card Stash. Always happy to, uh, to do that for you. Okay. So bear with me here, guys. I'm going to need uh, probably about 60 seconds to add all this up. So this one would come out to 180 a spot. So a little higher than I thought. 180 is what this one came out to. But we've got <coughs> 2020 Tier 1 Baseball. This will be a divisional draft. So 2021 Tier 1 Baseball box. So that's two autos and one relic. 2021 Absolute Baseball box. Two autos and two relics. 2021 Onyx Vintage Baseball, two on-card autos. Then we have two boxes of 2020 Onyx Nimbus. So two more on-card autos in each of those. A 2020 Donruss Optic Choice, so three exclusive autos on-card number to 99 or less, plus five parallels and two silvers. 2021 Museum Collection Pack, one hit per, and then 2020 Tops Rip, so four rip cards number to 99 or less in there. So you've got 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 17 hits guaranteed. Uh, pretty much every auto is on card, with the exception of maybe Absolute. Um, and then another one in Absolute, potentially. And I tried to add a little bit more um, licensed stuff in here with Museum, Tier 1, Tops Rip. So that comes out to 180 a spot for the baseball mixer. Six spots, Divisional Draft. So if anyone's interested, go ahead and just say, yay, I like that. Um, in the chat, and then I will go ahead and add them in the store if we have any interest. If not, I can rework it. Um, maybe take out, take out the tier one and add in a couple more unlicensed products that give us more autos, like uh, some leaf, leaf stuff, but go ahead and let me know either way. In the meantime, let's get to T. Fornis for Ginter. He's got a four-pack lot here. Get you a slip today. All right, T. Go ahead and pick for me. Pick two, left, right, one through nine. Where are we going? All right, T. I'm going to throw that mixer in the store. I'll throw it in. It's in Baseball Divisional Draft Round 1, bottom of the baseball section, guys, for anyone who would like one. I can pick. All right, we'll go 3-7 on each side. And 
baseball mixer is in the store. Got about two hours of streaming left here I can do, guys. All right, good luck. This is the uh, Shirley Temple King, little kid Twitter guy named Kelly. A-Rod, Seeger, Alejandro Kirk, and we've got a hit. It's Mitch Garver. Relic, a Honus Wagner mini, and Birds of a Feather, the Hyacinth Macaw. Ooh, more than three feet long and with a four-foot wingspan, the Hyacinth Macaw is the largest of all parrots. It is also one of the most aesthetically impressive, cobalt blue with yellow patches around its eyes and sharp beak. These parrots, a threatened Central and South American species in the wild, look imposing, but typically have gentle dispositions. Dope. Little jumbo parrot. I like that. Love learning about stuff like that. The high synth macaw. Andres, that's the uh, chef. Yeah. Sixto Sanchez, Kyle Tucker, uh, Anthony is Mark Anthony. Okay, I thought that's who that was. Carlos Martinez, Josh Gibson, and a Kyle Schwarber, Allen and Ginterback, and a Murad of Juan Soto. Divisional is at the very bottom of the baseball section. Make sure you're um, under the All tab, Breaking Grounds, and not the um, Available tab. For some reason, there's a um, a little glitch showing up where if you're under the all tab, or if you're under the available tab, it's not showing up all the items for some reason. No, you're good, buddy. Uh, we I just opened it up, so we have one spot gone. So if it's available in the store, you are good to grab it. Vita Blue, uh, Luis Garcia, Nats rookie, Roger Clemens, Robert Stevenson rookie, and another relic. Estiana. Saratiana. Comedian. Huh. Kyle Hendricks is our mini. And another high synth macaw. What are the odds? Lot them up. I guess literally they are birds of a feather in this situation. <laughs> that was from this. Actually, that wasn't from this product. That was from a. Tops American Pie, but I actually also had one of those J Block. I also have a I had dirt from um, uh, the Grassy Knoll. So uh, seventeen guaranteed hits in the baseball mixer with a chance of an eighteenth, I believe. It was either sixteen with a chance of seventeen or seventy with a chance of eighteen. One of the two. Uh, Lavin, TJ Lavin, BMX star and TV host, Mike Trout. Uh, Albert Abreu rookie, <laughs> Barry Larkin, Rogers Hornsby, Teoscar Hernandez, Heimer Condelario, Mini Black Border, and the Caribbean Reef Shark. We already learned about him earlier, but um, they take naps, so they sleep on the ocean floor, and they're very friendly. So, cool stuff there, Fornis. Two relics for you out of that set of packs, so Kyle Lowry delivers once again. Packs three and seven doing work. Um, I saw we had another another spot or two go in the baseball divisional mixer, so I think there's maybe th maybe three left for those of you that are interested in that one. What's up, Snoop Slice? Uh, J Block, you got the other finest mini there. So we'll do this, but um, <laughs> that baseball mixer is at the bottom of the baseball section, so feel free to go ahead and jump on in. I like those those relics. I think they're neat. The ones that are funky. I like cool stuff like that. All right, here we go. Let's see if we can top the first mini box. Damn good mini box, the first one, so. I want to hit a super frack out of this stuff. I have not done that yet. No supers for me. Uh, it's going to be the very bottom of the baseball section in the all category. <coughs> so when you get to the bottom, you're probably going to have to scroll through stuff that looks like sold. 
Um, it'll be gone. It won't have the purchase there. Scroll through that and then check it, check out the bottom part of that. Because when I add it in late, that's where it goes. It'll go underneath literally everything. So it'll even, uh, even show underneath the items that I've already sold in baseball. Oh, nice, dude. That's huge. I think we hit one of those. I can't remember who it was. It was messy. I lied. It was messy. It was the one that we hit the Black Gold Fusion. It was awesome. So maybe we can get another one. Let's find out. Good luck, bud. Paul Diablo. Or Diabla, excuse me. There. Kareem Adeyemi, rookie. Serge Nabry. Mengi, rookie. And a prize football of Timo Werner. Messi. Amadou Hadara, rookie. Nice Kamavinga, rookie. Dodo rookie, refractor, followed by Conrad De La Fuente, speckle refractor rookie. Anthony rookie. Ocampos. Uh, Takayumi Minamino. Hakeem Zayich. And our auto, wow, literally, I told you guys, I can't stop with this guy. I just can't stop. Borkowski, every time, always. From Leipzig. That is going to be unnumbered on the refractor auto there. Ansu Fati, Lukaku, Musiala, Aki rookie, prize footballers of Lewandowski, Kareem Benzema, Odalin Cassano rookie, Rainer Jesus rookie, nice one, Dominique Smozalai refractor, the Hungarian, go hungry, I'm Hungarian, Jaden Sancho, finest footwork, uh, Pereira, Coletta Carr rookie, Yao Felix, Eduardo Mendy rookie, and a pink hyper. Rainer Jesus rookie. Nice. Not too shabby there. 104 of 125 on the Jesus. So, first box definitely better, but nice card to end on. And the Swozilla is not bad either. I will add it to your pile, sir. All right. Uh, breaking grounds. It's in there, man. Here, what I'll do, I'm going to do this for you then. I will, I'll take a spot out. I'll pull a spot out. I'll delete it. And I will, um, I'll add you your own little item to find. So just bear with me here one second. Let me just get to the divisional section. So much baseball stuff. Takes forever. Okay. Um, what spot number do you want? Would you like number... <laughs> i got to find it here. Um, two, three, four, or six. Which, which spot number do you want in the random? Oh, you found it? Okay, cool. Then just go ahead and grab whichever one you'd like. Perfect. Can't wait for that search function. It's going to be huge. All right, Boston's up with Father's Day. What's up, Boston? Bean Town. All right, Boston, I need you to pick two for me, bud. Six, seven, eight, nine, ten. One through eleven. Hit me with two. Well, Drew, give me a follow and I'll follow you right back, buddy. At uh, at Buffs Breaks. You can just go through my followers and just start hitting them with follows. They'll hook, they'll hook you up back. A lot of them are people on here. I pick. We're on three and seven. Three and seven is the... Uh, Three and seven is the number. It's the setup today. Oh, you're welcome, buddy. Go ahead, Drew. Go ahead, plug it. Plug your uh, plug your <laughs> plug your IG channel on here. Hit everyone with the uh, the at whatever right in the convo. I'll allow it. Spam yourself. <laughs> All right, Boston. Good luck, buddy. Starting off with Juan Soto, and. Clayton Kershaw, Team USA. Pack two. Ooh, 
Ooh, Mike Trout. Yay. And I think it's another one, Team USA. It is Ian Anderson rookie. So a couple nice ones there. All baseball that time. We just went through a nothing but basketball section, and now we've going, or we're going nothing but baseball. Trout, Kershaw, Soto, and Ian Anderson for you. So appreciate you. It's insane how much space I am running out of. <laughs> you guys are awesome. We might do it. Might set the record, the day, the one day record for orders. We're getting close. Well, thank you, Boston. I appreciate you. And again, guys, uh, three spots left in the baseball mixer divisional at the bottom of the baseball, all the way at the very, very bottom of the baseball section. All right, J Block's got a World Cup fat pack, and then we are caught up. Give me a number on the Mbappe hunt here, one through five. Where are we going? Number four. Okay. And I'll put the, uh, the visual mixer back on the screen after this to show you guys what is in there in case uh, you have just joined. Oh, these are fun. These are fun. Uh, it's actually a decent amount of content, too, um, with the three parallels and insert, and then you usually have one additional parallel, like a silver. Or we have a, looks like a red on here. So, all right. Good luck, buddy. Jamie Vardy, Kevin Morales, and we did it. There it is. All you got to do is try it once. Kaelin Mbappe. Kaboom. Very nice. There it is. Pew, 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 pew. A little late night laser. Well, late night for me at least. It's eight and a half hours into the stream even though it's not that late at all. <laughs> Allison, Lucas Fabianski. Ooh, that's a mouthful. Alareza, Jan Bakshish. I think I actually said that right. Hector Herrera, Andreas Granqvist, Yusuf Miskani. Fakal Far, Red, Joel Campbell from Costa Rica. It's FIFA now. <laughs> Fundamentals, Philippe Luiz from Brazil. And our three red, white, and blues, Tariq Hamed, Guillermo Ochoa. Nice one there. And Casper Schmeichel. I like that, too. No one loves goalies but me, but Ochoa and Schmeichel, two very good ones. And, of course, the Mbappe. That helps. <laughs> good stuff. All right, one pack, one Mbappe. Piece of cake. Cards are easy. <laughs> All right, one second, guys. I need to take a little swig of the water here. All right. And here's the baseball mixer that we are working on filling. Half spot's gone. we got three left. Uh, what do you mean, cap? Like, salary cap? No. No, 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 no. You, uh, you just literally just pay as much money as you want. Just throwing money everywhere. So, baseball mixer. We have three spots left. This is 180 a spot. We have 2020 tops rip. Four rip cards numbered to 99 or less. With a chance of an on-card auto in here. One in every other box. Or, sorry, every other box. Not one in every other. That's, that makes sense. Every other box, on-card auto. 21 Tops Museum Collection Pack. Auto or Relic Per. 2020 Optic Choice. Two Silvers. Five numbered exclusive parallels. And then three on card autos numbered to 99 or less. Two boxes of Onyx Nimbus 2020. So two on card autos per box in these. 21 Onyx Vintage Baseball. Two more on card autos. 2021 Absolute Baseball, two autos and two relics, plus a couple numbered cards. And then 21 Tier 1 Baseball, two autos plus one relic, although there are plenty of boxes that have um, three, uh, three autos per. Usually it's uh, two or three boxes per case that have three autos per box. But that is three, seven, 13, 
15, 16 guaranteed hits with a chance at a 17th. Right there. That is 180 for a division. That is a divisional draft. There are three spots left. Um, as soon as that fills, we will go ahead and do the random and tear into all this fun shit. Um, that is at the very bottom of the baseball section for those that are interested. And actually, let me get a card here for this. We're going to get there on this one. I know we will. Oh, Bethany's back. What's up, Bethany? Just in time for the baseball mixer. RLM Rob, Bigfoot. Thanks for checking out the stream. Hey, Beth. Beth. <laughs> All right. Um, let me mark down these spots for our baseball mixer. And then we'll get to, who F1 Sapphire. We are due for a numbered card or a variation. I think we've only hit one out of like four packs today. All right, breaking grounds in spot six. Fleming in one. Tangs in five, and that leaves us with three to go. Okay, so that is ready to go once we can uh, get the last couple spots taken. All right, uh, what are we doing here? Park. One through eight on F1 Sapphire. Number four. All right. Good luck. Let's do it. All right. So we're starting off with the horizontal. It's our boy Max. Grand Prix winner Brazil. How awesome is it to be to be like this guy, like in real life? Just sitting there, like, you get to be on, like, this card with Max. That's, like, my dream, is I just want to be in the background of, like, a card. Please and thank you. Or get my own card, but... There we go. Second time we've done this today. Hit a Max, and then right behind it, a nice Lando rookie. This is the car rookie. And a couple of verticals here. Roy Nisani, Future Stars, F2 driver from Trident. Yeah, no problem, Nash. Give me one second. I will take care of that for you. And one time. Ah. Oh, it's Claire Williams. Why couldn't you be George Russell? Damn you, Claire. But still nice Max and nice Lando there. All right, we got one spot left on the draft. Park, I'll put this in your pile, buddy. And give me half a second, I'll explain, uh, I'll explain the draft to you guys. All right, so the draft, it's a divisional draft. Um, these are the products. There are 16 hits guaranteed with a chance of a 17th. So the way it works is if you grab a spot, we will do a randomization, and then before we open all the products, we'll uh, draft divisions, and every single card that comes out that belongs to a team in that division, you'll get. So it's pretty simple. It is 2020 Topps Rip Baseball. That is four Rip cards, number do 99 or less. Uh, every other box has an on-card auto inside of one of the Rip cards. 21 Museum Collection Baseball Pack. 2020 Optic Choice Baseball, three on-card autographs numbered to 99 or less, plus five exclusive parallels numbered to 84 or less, and two Silver Hollows. 2021 Onyx Vintage Baseball, two on-card autos. 2020 Onyx Nimbus Baseball, two boxes of this, each with two on-card autos. 
21 absolute memorabilia baseball, two autos, two relics, and a couple numbered cards. And then 21 tier one baseball, two autos and a relic. And you can possibly get boxes that have three autos. So there is one spot left on that in the bottom of the baseball section. So I think we're gonna be doing that here in just a second. Um, and yes, Foolish, that is a hobby box for select basketball. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna be able to fill that one though. Um, I did put it in the store. We haven't sold any spots yet. Um, I only have about an hour and a half left on stream. So you can go ahead and buy one if you want. Um, and worst case scenario, I will have, um, I will have loop refund you if the break does not fill in the amount by the time that I have to get off. So that is the only, uh, only thing to note for that one, but caught up on personals and one spot left on the baseball mixer here. I'm going to go ahead and just get uh, get you guys set up in the random to start while we wait for someone someone to be our hero. Who's going to be our Arya Stark? Who's going to do it? All right, we got... Fleming in spot one, unknown in spot two, Boston in three, Bethany in four, Matt's in five, and Breaking Grounds in six. All right, so that is set up and ready to go. As soon as someone takes the last spot, we are good to go on that. In the meantime, we've got some more Ginter for Bethany. Uh, yeah, check the all section, and it's going to be all the way at the bottom, at the um, all section under sale items, the very bottom of the baseball section. You're, so you're going to get, you're going to see a whole bunch of stuff, then you're going to see a bunch of stuff that's sold, then you'll see a couple more baseball items that are available for purchase, a couple more that are sold, a couple more that are available available for purchase, and then a couple more that are sold, and then you'll finally see at the very, very bottom, the last thing with the baseball icon is going to be the last remaining spot for um, the baseball divisional. Uh, break but make sure you're in the all section not the available section there is a glitch right now where if I add items in midstream um, some people are not able to see them in the available section so all right Beth Beth go ahead and hit me with it one through I think eight on right one through eight on each side El Guapo Blanco What's up? One through four, uh, left or right? What's up, Will? All right. Let's do it. Let's learn stuff about things. Brett Anderson, not Brett Anderson, uh, Brian Anderson, I was like, that's not his name, uh, Bob Gibson, Cole Calhoun, Ruth, Jose Canseco, Jared Walsh, and a Kyle Tucker, that is just the regular mini, Deep Sea Shiver, the Lemon Shark, we already know about that, it's got a yellowish brown uh, hue to it, and um, where does it live, it says in here, Coral Reefs. Coral Reefs for the Lemon Shark. Can't wait to pull the, the Northern, Southern, Northern, Southern Shark again. Trevor Story, Jake Bowers, Will Smith, Frank Thomas, Daniel Kim, a baseball analyst for something, Brandon Woodruff, Jorge Soler, that is the Ginter back, and historical hits, David Freeze, October 27, 2011. That's got to be the, uh, the ninth inning double off the uh, the wall to send the game to extra innings, right? Tied 9 not Okay, so they're using the one in the bottom of the 11th inning for the walk-off homer. I prefer the same game, the... Or the game before that, it was um, Freeze 
with down to their last strike drives the uh, the double opposite field off the uh, I thought it was the left field wall if memory serves correctly that's the one that I prefer instead of the walk off homer the night after but still awesome stuff David Fries. Uh, Alec Bohm, rookie. Mike Lang, hockey announcer. I don't even know who that is. Who does he? Scratch my back with a hacksaw. <laughs> That's funny. Oh, Penguins announcer. Okay. Uh, Will Craig, Javi Baez. And we got an auto. It's the chef. Jose Andres. Or Andreas, I guess. Anders, don't know. Could go any way there, I'm assuming. Got the chef auto. Well, now you have. Done did it. Piece of cake. <laughs> See what I did there? Piece of cake, because he's a chef. Anyone get that one? No? Str <laughs> Strasburg. Mini. And, ooh, the red maple. We already learned about the red maple. Very big trees. But uh, 140 feet tall and 7 feet in diameter. Smoky Mountains, Red Maple, hot damn. One more pack, and then um, Nash, if you can't find it, I can I can take care of it for you. Vigio, Andrelton Simmons, Leody Tavares rookie, Glaber Torres, Kyle Schwarber, Don Mattingly, Christian Javier, mini rookie. Ooh, and the Scarlet Macaw. The little minx. The Scarlet Macaw is a rainbow of exquisite colors. These parrots, which grow to almost three feet, are brilliant with red splashes of yellow, green, and blue on their wing feathers. While their appearance makes them a favorite among bird odors, um, their energy, outsized personalities, and need for out-of-cage time require plenty of training and attention. That's the parrot that I think of. When I think of parrots, that's what I think of is that right there. Your multicolored Scarlet Macaw. Twite. Oh, hello, Lego parrot. <laughs> That's funny. That's a Tops' color blast. <laughs> That's a good one, Scythe. Good joke. Good card humor. I'll allow it. All right. Um, Mash, are you still looking for it? Because what I can do is I can just create a new item for you to buy. So just go ahead and type in the thing. Let me know if you still want in, and I can... Okay, it's all right. What I'll do is I can fix it real fast. Go ahead and I will just, I'm going to delete the one <laughs> that's in there. Edit. Deleted. And now I'm going to put it at the bottom of the three card section. So it's got your name on it. Mash 26. I'm going to say Divisional Draft. Round one. All right, it's going to be at the very bottom of the three-card section, so you, sh <coughs> you should be able to find it now. So... That is now in there for you. I'm going to mark you down here in the final spot. And I think we got one more F1 Sapphire pack to do for Park. Right? Park's got one more Sapphire. All right, buddy. One through seven. Four. All right. Race Lab. The Scuderia Alpha Torre logo. Uni Virtuoso Racing. And a vertical. It's Luham Grand Prix China. Luham China on this one. <coughs> oh, excuse me, guys. All right. 
right. Uh, no, that Russell, that was a mail day for me, Alex. That was a mail day. Um, so I usually put, well, I'll put, I'll always put one of my cards back here. So, yeah, I got some other nice stuff in the mail too, but that was the, uh, that was the one I wanted to use. So, all right, it is divisional draft time, folks. Let me get mash in here. All right. So very quickly, I'm just going to copy this just in case it craps out on me. Because um, I don't know, it might have a... Actually, I'm going to do that just in case. <coughs> it's got a... One of those things where uh, the screen went to, um, to sleep, so I don't want it to screw up the random. But, okay. Now we are good to go here. Uh, yes, it is. To, it's the variation to 25. So we got Fleming in spot one, Mash in two, Boston in three, Bethany in four, Tang in five, Breaking Grounds in six, seven times. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, and lucky number seven, Breaking Grounds. I think you were on top like four times there, buddy. Top pick, Bethany, number two. Matt, you're number three. Fleming with four. Mash with five. And Boston with number six. Good thing about this break. Helps to get the number one pick, but doesn't necessarily mean you're going to get the best outcome. So, that being said, breaking grounds. Where are you going with pick number one? And if anyone needs suggestions, feel free to let me know. Um, I know you are new to breaking. Um, I will just tell you this one. Um, AL East will always be the number one pick in these these breaks. Uh, so that's where you should go, is the uh, AL East. Um, they've got the best veterans, and they've got the best prospects. So, And we have a mix of veteran and prospect products here, so that's where you should go at number one. That is uh, just for, <laughs> for everyone out there. If I ever put together a baseball break consisting of uh, 2019 to 2021 products, the AL East should by default be the first pick. So, Bethany at number two, I think I know where you're going, of course. The NL East, usually the uh, consensus number two pick in these breaks. And this is where things get fun. All right, Matt, where are you going at three, buddy? <laughs> uh, so you can go a bunch of different ways at three. Um, the AL West is pretty good because you've got Otani and Trout, and they also have some decent prospects. Um, that's probably where I would go. Uh, you've got, like, Noel V. Marte, Julio Rodriguez. Um, there's a lot of veterans on the A's. <laughs> um, the other one that most people go with if you don't want the AL West is the NL West. Um, same thing, tons of veterans between the Dodgers and Giants. And uh, a lot of prospects, especially in the Diamondback system. Uh, the Dodgers have a fair amount of prospects. Um, so it's usually one of the Wests, but I think the AL West is a stronger play overall. So we're going to go NL West, all right. Again, not only it really matters until we open the boxes. But, Fleming, where are you going at four? Let's get funny with it, kid. <laughs> AL West, all right. And then, MASH, your choice at five is between the Centrals, the AL and NL Central. The NL Central has usually more veterans, um, Cubs, Cardinals, um, very veteran heavy. The AL Central is going to have better prospects and rookies with, you know, you've got Eloy, you've got Robert, uh, you've got Spencer Torkelson. Um, so you can go either way. NL does have Nick Gonzalez in the prospects, so you can literally go either way. <laughs> All right, AL Central for MASH, and that leaves Boston with the NL Central. All right. So, Breaking Grounds with the AL East, Bethany with the NL East, Tang with the NL West, Vlemming with the AL West, Mash with the AL Central, and Boston with the NL Central. I'll leave this up here for me to reference. And let's see, what order do we want to do these boxes? We'll do those afterwards. I think we'll start, yeah, we'll start with these. <coughs> we'll start with our... Three, uh, <coughs> excuse me, guys, let me, get, let me get a cough drop here. Woo! 
dry cough is getting me. We're close, guys. We've got about an hour and a half left. 26 more orders will set the record. Uh, right now, I got the vitamin C ones. So those are the citrus flavors, which taste like candy. Um, so I, I get down with those like real hard. I also like the Ricola ones that most people don't like. I like the lemons. So elderberry, maybe, you know, if I'm feeling frisky. What's up, Dan? I am back, buddy. This is my uh, second, <coughs> second stream back. But happy to be here. I'll tell you that much. Too long, too long, but uh, you'll see a lot of this. Uh, well, you won't see me. You see a lot of these hands, I guess, and hear a lot of this voice in the uh, the coming weeks. So I'm gonna be I'm gonna be going at it pretty hard, pretty hard. At least three days a week, hopefully four, um, hopefully five. Screw it, I don't care. I like opening cards as long as my voice allows it. Um, you can see I'm already struggling here, <laughs> but. All right. Starting off with Onyx Vintage Extended 2021. Marco Luciano for the NL West. Roderick Arias, prospect. I do not believe he has signed yet. Or no, he might have been, might have signed with the Red Sox. Red Sox or Yankees. I think he's the AL East. And there it is, the AL East. This is why they go first. Right out the gate, Adley Rushman on card auto. Boom. Followed by Felon Celestin, red ink. That is going to be short printed to 50, and that is going to get randomed off amongst everyone as Celestin is not yet signed. He is one of the top uh, prospects in the 2022 signing class. So that everyone's got a shot at that one. All right. Miguel Weiss. Another one I don't think he has signed yet. Uh, this is the only one I put up right now, Jay Will. Very nice. Marco Luciano for the NL West. Short printed to 25. That is the black border. Redemption. AL East. Doing their thing. Wander Franco. Redemption auto. Boom. And gold bordered auto for the Cardinals. Jordan Walker, that is short printed to 50 copies. So awesome box there. I mean, those have been two great boxes to start. <laughs> the worst auto we've hit so far out of these uh, the first two boxes is the like number like five international prospect in the 2022 class. Miguel Weiss again. Again, anything that anyone that does not have a team will get random off. Look at the color in this. Wow. I think we've got back to back black autos coming. Alex Ramirez for the Mets. That is a gold border. And back to back black autos. Nick York. AL East. Continuing to crush. That is the 25. Followed by. Rodolfo Castro for the NL Central. AL Feast. So black to 25 and black to 25 on both of those. So three great boxes to start from the Onyx products. <laughs> I'm telling you, Breaking Grounds, AL East is the... The other five spots can go in any order, and I would never say anything. The AL East has to go one. Let's do Optic Choice 2020. And again, anyone interested in personals, you can go ahead and grab them. I will do them right after this. We need 26 more orders to set the record, folks. 26 more orders. I've got about an hour and 20-something minutes or so. Or an hour and 20-something minutes, yeah, I think, to... Uh... Hmm. 
to get that taken care of, to set the record. Uh, the select bas basketball break is in the store. Um, we have no one's taken any spots yet, so we'll need a push on that to uh, to get it. But and I haven't put the Onyx box break in the store, so I'll actually um, all those are in the store already. Here's what I'll do: the Onyx box break. So those are the ones we just did. If anyone wants that, it's four spots of that. I'm putting it in right now. It's gonna be at the very bottom of the baseball section. Honest Nimbus. Uh, box draft so that is four spots sixty dollars per it's literally the product that we just opened that had all that good stuff um, so those are in and then the select basketball is at the bottom of the selects are uh, the basketball section um, again if we don't fill that in time I will have you guys refunded for it but that is in there so um, that is ten spots three random teams at hundred fifteen dollars a spot for a hobby box Brian Anderson it's our first hollow. Second hollow, Jalen Davis. Blue Stars, rookie for the AL Central, Zach Collins, 19 of 45. Max Muncy, Blue Stars, 18 of 45 for the NL West. Who is the NL West? That's Matt. AL East, that's pretty nice. Green Snakeskin, Vlad to 84. 65 of 84. Tim Anderson, Red Snake Skin, 3 of 88 for the AL Central. AL West on the board with a Brock Burke rated rookie. And uh, remember how I said, like, sometimes the top picks don't always get the best cards? Hello. And that's why we love our baseball breaks here. AL Central, MASH, fifth spot. Luis Robert, on card, rookie auto, to 99. We'll check the serial number in just a second. Behind that, NL West, Jonathan Deaza, to 99. And NL West again, Ronald Bolanos. The Bolanos is 70 of 99. Deaza, 34 of 99. And one more look at that sweet Lou Bob. 62 of 99. Welcome back, Luis. Happy to have you here on stream. Let's go with Absolute next. Mash is known for pulling the fire. I think this is Mash the uh, first time in my stream, at least first time I've recognized the name. But what an entrance you made. <laughs> All right. First pack of Absolute. Chris Bryant for the Cubs. Bogarts for the Red Sox. Matt Chapman. Kershaw. And this guy's pretty good. Brian Reynolds, 196 of 199 for the NL Central. That is the Pittsburgh Pirates. Also for the Pirates, rookie class. Cabrian Hayes, rookie. Very nice. NL East, Drew Waters prospect. No, Bethany's happy with that. And Royce Lewis, prospects red, 31 of 99 for the AL Central for MASH. On to our hits. Starting off with a baseball signature. AL East, very nice, Nate Pearson. You know what's happening, Diggit. That'll happen ASAP. He's so good. And, well, it says patches, but it's definitely not a patch. It's a jumbo jersey, Jonathan Gray. 64 of 99 for the NL West. And the Pearson is 80 of 99 for the AL East. Drew went ahead and got a box in the Onyx Nimbus box draft. So three spots left on that one. That was all the uh, the stuff with the crazy autos we hit. <laughs> the 25 and then the, um, the Wander Franco. So three more spots on that. We'll open up four boxes and we'll do a draft after the boxes are opened. And you'll be drafting the entire box. So that's a fun one. 
Uh, Nesty, these were 180 a spot for our division. DeGrom, Harper, Shoeless Joe, Colin Moran, George Springer, and there's Shoeless Joe again for the AL Central. 94 of 149. Another Wander Franco for the AL East. And more for the AL East, Nate Pearson, rookie class, blue, 17 of 149. We can do a Trinity hit draft, too. We can definitely do that. I'd love to get the Onyx one filled real fast. That's a quick one and a fun one. And then after that, we can do Trinity. My cup runneth over. <laughs> Same homies I ball with. I fall with on that Southern Drawl shit. 06 Rookie of the Year, Chris Paul shit. Anyone? Good song. Anywho, Dean Creamer. More for the AL East. Sometimes you just got to quote Drake. That is the Blue Stitch, which I believe is going to be short printed to 35. We'll check in a second. And Tools of the Trade, NL East, David Wright, Duel. Creamer is to 30. Excuse me, 6 of 30. So stupid. 35. What an idiot I am. And Wright, Unnumbered. Love you, David Wright. I don't think anyone can ever say a bad word about David Wright, ever. My guy. All right, let's go with Topps Rip. We'll be next. Three spots left on the Onyx Nimbus box draft. That'll be a fun one. As we continue on into our ninth hour here. 100% uh, Matt. 100% he would be. He's in my Hall of Fame. Love that guy. JT Real Muto to 99 for the NL East. That's probably getting ripped. George Springer, 38 of 99 for the AL West. Probably getting ripped. Black to 50. Edgar Martinez for the AL West. Probably getting ripped. And to 25, NL Central, Tommy Edmond. I think that's four rippable cards right there. All right, folks, let me know. What are we doing? NL Central is Boston. The AL West has got two for Fleming, and then the NL East is Bethany. Would we like to rip or keep sealed? Bethany says rip. All right, we'll start with hers. Fleming says rip. Okay, so I will go in this order. I will do the real Muto, the Springer, and then if uh, we happen to hit an auto and you guys want to stop, uh, we'll stop. But then I'll do the Edgar Martinez, and then it could be up to Boston with the Edmund at the end. Starting off with, this is feels like an auto. No, okay. It's Andres Galarraga. He felt like a player who would be in the auto set to me. It's just the base to 50. 15 of 50 on the Galarraga. Ripping and tearing and tearing and ripping. Um, did, did I'm got any penny sleeves for these. Okay. There we go. Springer up next for Fleming. Again, whatever comes out stays with the owner of the original rip card, so there will be no transference of uh, of cards inside. And here's a nice one. Randy Johnson to 15. That is 7 of 15 on the Randy. Breaking grounds like, I need more cards. I've only gotten like 80% of them. <laughs> I'm taking your minis. We'll do the Edgar. <coughs> Ozzy Smith Black to 40. That is 38 of 40. <laughs> I 
And then, uh, Boston, do you want to rip the Edmund? We have not hit an auto yet. So autos are not one per box. They're every other box, but... All right, let's go ahead and rip the Edmund. Sorry, Tommy, you're getting torn. 18 to 25, no moss. Purple, Keston Hura. And this is going to be to 10. Or no, purple might be 25 for the minis. I can't remember. Yeah, purple's going to be 25. Come on, Keston. Get out of there. To 25. 10 of 25 on the Keston Hero Mini. Bye-bye, Tommy. So I'll be honest, not one of our greatest boxes of Tops Rip. Um, didn't really hit anything huge in the actual rips and nothing in the minis either. But still a lot of fun. Ripping shit apart. Let's go to Museum Collection. Did get an Edgar to 50. Would have liked to see an auto out of that box, though. It's not uh, not very often we get to rip all four rip cards. So I would have liked that to be an auto box, but... All right, Museum Collection. Kershaw, Copper Parallel for the NL West. Tatis for the NL West. Mike Schmidt for the NL East. Shane Bieber for the Central. And primary pieces, quad patch, Elvis Andrus for the AL West, 48 of 75. Underrated player. And tier one time. Let's see if we can drill something big. See if we can go big here in our last box of the mixer. Started off real hot. Let's see if we can finish real hot, too. All right, we'll do the relic card in the back first. It is the ALS Michael Brantley, 278 of 344. Feel the same way, dig it. Love it, but so hit or miss. Back auto, 132 of 300. Going to be a breakout auto. Nick Nelson, rookie, for the Yankees, the AL East. The rich get richer. And <laughs> let's go Mets. Daryl Strawberry, 2 of 175 for Bethany in the NL East. The Tier 1, Tier 1 autograph set. Fun stuff. That was a fun break. <laughs> I would venture to say yes if I had to guess. <laughs> So in store, we still have the Onyx Nimbus box draft, which was the one where we hit the Franco auto, the Celestin auto, the two numbered autos to 25. Um, so there are three of those left in the bottom of the baseball section, and we have a couple individuals to do. Uh, Agent Zero is up with an update hobby pack. Uh, I can do it real fast for your breaking grounds. Sorry, I normally would have. I'm just kind of running out of time here on the stream, so I want to get as much done as possible. But um, recap here. Strawberry to 175. Nick Nelson to 300. Brantley, Jersey to 344. Elvis Andrus, Quad Patch to 75. Bieber, Schmidt, Tatis, and Kershaw Parallel. Um, Edmund and the Hero Purple Mini. The Edgar Martinez and the Ozzy Smith Black Mini. The George Springer and the Randy Johnson Green Mini to 15. And then the JT Real Muto and the Galarraga Mini to 50. Tools of the Trade, David Wright, Duel, Joe Jackson to 149, Dean Creamer, Rookie Auto to 30, Nate Pearson to 149, a Wander Franco rookie, bunch of base cards. Nate Pearson, Rookie Auto to 99, the Jonathan Gray, it's 
patches, but it's definitely just a jersey to 99 for the uh, NLS. Brian Reynolds to 199. Royce Lewis to 99. Drew Waters rookie. Brian Hayes rookie. Bunch of base. The card of the break right there. Luis Robert on card rookie auto to 99. Jonathan Deaza and Ronald Bolanos both to 99 as well. Brock Burke, Tim Anderson, and Vlad Jr. parallels to 84. Muncie and Zach Collins parallels to 45. Jalen Davis and Brian Anderson hollows. Uh, Onyx Nimbus, this is the box that we have a break in the store right now. This is a Nick York on-card rookie auto to 25. Rodolfo Castro on-card rookie auto to 25. And Alex Ramirez gold parallel rookie to 50. Miguel Blyce rookie. Jordan Walker gold on-card auto to 50. Wander Franco rookie auto redemption. Marco Luciano rookie to uh, 25. Miguel Blyce base rookie. And then from Onyx Vintage was the Felman Celestin, which I'll random off uh, after... When I'm doing sorting um, amongst everyone, and the Adley Rushman on card. The Celestin is a red ink short print to 50. So, yeah, those will, I don't have time to do those right now, breaking grounds, but um, I will do them at the end of the break when I go to sort. So, all that will get random off. So, someone's going to wind up with a couple, uh, couple extra cards in their pile. So, good stuff, but all right, Agent Zero. Sorry about the wait there. Update hobby. One through, I think eight. One through, one through eight. Where are we going? Number seven. All right. Make you a card for today. Good luck. All right. Archie Bradley, Jose Altuve, Tyler Skaggs, Reese Hoskins rookie, Danny Valencia, Matt Kemp, 1983, Matt Moore, Randall Gritchick, PJ Conlin and Corey Oswalt, dual rookies for the Mets, and... Jaime Garcia. So no Otani that time. We've been very hot with Otani today, but swing and a miss on that pack. No problem, buddy. And I love running the mash. I really do. <laughs> They're so much fun. You get to open so much product. So should get in the, uh, the Onyx Nimbus box draft. It's a fun, cheap one, too. And you, uh, you <coughs> obviously you guys just saw how good those boxes can be, so... Remember, I'm for $5. The good old days, Joe. Never again. Uh, Drew's in the Nimbus draft, and you's got Ginter. All right, you. No, no idea, Bethany, right? Especially with ink on it, numbered to, like, four. Definitely not. <laughs> All right, you. Uh, right, left, one through seven. One through seven on each side, buddy. I can pick. We'll go left, three, right, seven. Oh, what's up, Puck? You made it. Nine hours later. <laughs> All right, here we go, you. Sano, Taylor Trammell rookie, Tiana, Roy Campanella, Gonzalez rookie, Elvis Andrus. Our mini is Derek Lee. That is a short print mini. And Murad of Willie Mays. Nate Pearson, rookie, Adalberto Mondesi, The Beebs, Willie Castro, Kevin Nagandi, Carl Yastrzemski, Soto is our mini, that is just a base mini, and there she is again, oh, that Scarlet Macaw. The Scarlet Macaw, Birds of a Color Blast. Yes! I love this shit. <laughs> Too funny. We did it! We hit a top color blast! We did it! <laughs> You're welcome, you. Thank you. Thank you, you. <laughs> 
More birds. All right, Park, we got to get you a good pack of uh, F1 Sapphire here. One through six this time. Number four. All right. Got Mr. Vettel, driver of the day, Canada. Second one of these today, very nice. Carlos Sainz, true rookie. All right, Sam's in for the Onyx Nimbus box draft, so it leaves us with two left. Jack Aitken, Campos Racing. Oop, and a, all right, there we go. Finally, a numbered card for you. A black, black 70th. Oh, it's Nikita Mazepin. Oh, bummer. Sixty-two of seventy on the Mazepin Black. But happy we finally got you a numbered card there. And the signs is nice as well. I'm cold on F1 today, guys. Cold on F1. I gotta get some heat into my tires. Need a pace lap. But I appreciate the purchases, Park. <laughs> Mazespin. Always facing the wrong way, that guy. Do the swervy thing. <laughs> now you're getting Puck, yeah. Pace lap, buddy. All right, that catches us up um, on individuals. So if anyone wanted, wants anything, please go ahead. We have two spots left in the Onyx Nimbus draft. Um, and once we do that, we can do another draft. Another fun baseball one, if you guys would like. But... Got to get Nimbus done first. I have 60 minutes left here before the stream is going to uh, give me the boot. So, and then I'm probably going to go upstairs and eat my dinner that my wife bought me. Um, I think some of you guys were probably here when she bought me that at like 3.45 p.m. So I might go upstairs and eat that in about an hour's time. No, no, the dogs had grass for dinner, dig it. Come on, I got chicken. <laughs> I have grass-fed chicken for dinner. But <laughs> she straight up went, uh, or the dogs <laughs> straight up went and ate the grass. She might have swapped it. At this point, I'm so hungry, like, I wouldn't even know. I'm going to go in there, and whatever's in that box, I'm going to stuff it down my throat in all of two seconds. So, yeah. Whatever's in there, I'm going to eat it. All right, Bethany's got four more Ginters. Uh, 1 through 12, Bethany. Where are we going? Three, four, seven, eight. Okay. Three, four, seven, eight. All right. Giolito. Rizzo, Kim, Jackson, Reese Hoskins, Kim Ang, Kyle Hendricks Mini, Allen and Ginther back, and the Bald Eagle. We already know about that one, rallying back. We've already hit the Bald Eagle. Lester, Clark Schmidt rookie, Cody Hewer rookie, Kirilov rookie, Brady Singer rookie, Dave Roberts. Ooh, far, far away. Supernova. Here's a new one. Let's see. A supernova, the bright, powerful explosion of a star, is the largest blast that humans have ever witnessed. When a dying star with a mass at least five times that of our sun cools and collapses, it creates shockwaves that cause the outer part to burst. I still can't believe that that happens. Space is like a messed up freaking place, man. Like, there is some weird shit that goes on out there. We are just ants in the universe. The tiniest, most pathetic little things. Just... Literal ants. Puck gets it. September 24th, 1998. This has got to be Sosa hits number 61, right? Or 66, whatever number it was. We had number 66, his final homer of the 1998 season.
Pack Trace is Austin Meadows, Joey Bart rookie, six oh six or that's Jesus Sanchez rookie, Joe Mauer, Rangham, Kelly Rangham, softball player, okay. Hmm. An eight fifteen batting average, jeez, in twenty eighteen. My God. David Fletcher. Oh, yes. Mascots in real life. And, oh, a Ty Cobb. Oh, this is going to be a good one. All right. Mascots in real life. The Elephant. I, who who are the Elephants? What, what sporting team is the Elephants? Okay. The Athletics turned a 1902 insult into a unique, uh, unique mascot. When a rival manager... Derisively said the franchise was a white elephant after it made some high-profile player acquisitions. The team adopted an emblem that evolved into its playful pachyderm. It was a mouthful. Who knew? Who knew the story of the A's mascot? I did not. Uh, cold, Abe. Cold. I think there were 13 packs to begin with, and I think we've only hit two numbered cards. But, I mean, it was a mix of two boxes. So, I don't know. July 18th, 1927. Who doesn't remember the day? Detroit's at Navin Field. Cobb became the founding member of the 4,000 Hit Club. Having spent the previous 22 years with the Tigers, he was greeted warmly, I would hope so, when he came to... Bat for Philadelphia in the bottom of the first inning. His line drive to right field eluded the outfielder and was scored a double. And final pack of this Ginter section is Nick Nieder, Bagwell, Kirby, DJ LeMahieu, Yachty Molina, Todd Helton, Elvis Andrus, Short Print, and that Harper guy. Well, I'll tell you guys this much. If you guys want, um, I'll give you the option. We're down to a couple packs left here. We might be... Um, there are boxes, we've talked about it many times, of Chrome F1, where we're looking at like two hits per box, two numbered cards. That's uh, not, you know, it just is what it is. Um, if you guys wanted, I would be happy to open another box and shuffle them into here. Because I, these were so... I mean, these were, these were the same packs that were sitting here before I left from the National. So I have no idea if we drilled, like, three numbered cards out of the first three packs that we sold. Um, where if that was the case and we're shooting into, like, a low box or two, um, there might not be a ton of stuff. So it's up to you guys. If whoever bought that or them wants to do it, um, I'll be happy to do that because I was going to have to do it anyway for the next stream. So I'll, I'll be happy to do that now for you guys if you want. So... Uh, Nimbus is awesome, Puck. They're so much fun. Um, the last two boxes we did had two autos numbered to 25 and a Wander Franco auto. So it is a very fun, cheap uh, cheap one. I like it a lot. All right, Tang did get one. He says, let's, let's open a new box. So, okay, let me find one here, buddy. <laughs> do, 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 do. Where are you? Sapphire Racing. Give me a second. Chrome. Where the hell is Sapphire? Give me a second. I just got to find Sapphire. There it is. All right. All right. Puck's in the draft. And yeah, Matt, absolutely. Like I said, I'm uh, happy to give that option. Because like I said, I, I don't know if... Uh, I have like a vague memory of us pulling like when I first did these two boxes of us pulling a couple numbered cards right out the gate. But, like I said, vague is at best. Um, so, I just don't want you guys shooting into a a low, uh, low prize pool, I guess, here. If uh, we got one or two of those boxes that <coughs> might have been on the short side as far as hits go. So, they are now shuffled in. So, give me a number 1 through 13. And then, Puck, the Nimbus draft is at the very bottom of the baseball section, so that gives us one to go on that. We need one more baseball. Uh, Puck's going to get one, so that leaves us with one left. It's at the very bottom of the baseball section. Number eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. All right. 
All right, baseball sacks that he's in. So very bottom of the baseball section, guys. Onyx Nimbus box draft, round number one. Grab those last two spots, and we'll do it right after this. All right, good luck, Matt. All right. Starting off with Mr. Verstappen. Very nice. Driver of the day, Austria. Otmar Safnauer. Louis Deltraz, and a vertical, not numbered, maybe a variation, who knows, maybe just a Hamilton. It is a variation, it's the gas man, there we go. Very nice, Pierre Gasly, variation. Now we're back on track here. Good card there with the Gasly. Very nice. And a uh, Verstappen to go with it. Good stuff, buddy. Was uh, was that your first purchase today that wasn't group break stuff, Matt? I think it was. Okay, I thought so. First non-group breaker. Gotta get your cod here. Like me some ghastly. All right, and I think it's time to do our uh, to do our draft here. Just gotta get Puck to grab uh, that last spot. I'll set up the randomizer in the meantime. Very bottom of the baseball section, Puck. Gotta go to the. Um, all tab, not the available tab. There's an error popping up with the available tab where it's not showing the new items that I'm adding in throughout the stream. So you have to go to the all tab, not just the available tab. He might, <laughs> they might sign him back to that seat if they let go of Perez, which is definitely a possibility. I feel like there might be some interesting movement here. Um, so, we'll see. All right, baseball sack is in spot two. Sam is in spot four. Drew is in spot one. And Puck is gonna be in spot three. So we'll do the random after the break, that way we can all root for good stuff. Uh, I'll do those packs for you first, Abe, while we got Puck looking for them. Uh, Sapphire, one through seven. Two of them. Give me two of them. Two. Okay. And five. Three, four, five. Twenty-five, Mikhail Bridges. Starting off with Hyun Il Choi, number one overall pick in the Korean baseball draft, except he didn't go to the Korean baseball draft. He went to the Dodgers instead. Nice Garrett Mitchell, professional hitter. Another nice one, Austin Hendrick and Bryson Stott. And nice, we got an orange. <coughs> Excuse me. CJ Abrams. Seth, have yourself a beer. Oswald Peraza and our orange. Nice. Shea Longoliers, 56 of 75. On the Shea. So, nice card there. Your ninth overall pick in the 2019 draft. Thank you, Nate. I appreciate you, brother. And into the pile they go. All right, and Puck found Nimbus. All right, so here we here we go, guys. So here's what we're going to do. So Drew's in spot one, baseball's in two, Puck's in three, Sam is in four. We are not going to do the random until 
we open all the boxes. That way we can all root for good stuff. But I'm going to let each one of you pick a box. That way we can at least, uh, you guys can feel good. So first up will be, who's in spot one? Drew, you can go left, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. Left one through 11, right one through 10. Which box are you adding to the, uh, the pot here? Drew, you in here, buddy? I know you were the first one to uh, buy a spot in this. It was maybe 20 minutes ago. All right, we'll wait for Drew to pick. Um, baseball sack, 1 through 11 on the left or 1 through 10 on the right? Which box are we adding in? Right 8, okay. Boom. So now one through 10 on each side. Go ahead and give me a, a number there, Puck. Right, left, one through 10. Left eight, all right. That's Pucks. And then we have Sam. Left one through nine. Right one through eight. Or sorry, right one through ten. Uh, left five. Okay. And then looking for Drew. You in here, Drew? Drew? Did we lose you, buddy? All right. Well, we're going to have to move on without him, unfortunately, then. Uh, so someone... Someone in the chat, go ahead and pick left one through eight, right one through ten. One more box. Anyone? First one, right four, says Boston. Okay. All right. So here we go. That way you can, if, you can at least feel good if you pick the good box, even if you don't wind up at the top. So I got marker all over my thumb. All right, this was the box that was picked for Drew by Boston. So again, none of this really matters. Uh, this is just, I marked them down just that way you guys can see what box you picked, but we will do the draft order at the end here. So good luck, everyone. May all four boxes be awesome. Starting off with a nice Bobby Witt rookie and a Robert Poisson rookie. So two good base. We got a black auto to 25 coming up. Suli Matthias of the Royals is our first auto. And black auto to 25. Nice. Yiddy Cape signed by the Marlins. I think he was the number nine international signing this year. Or last year. And that is short printed to 25. So good first box with two... Uh, top-notch base cards and a nice black cafe in addition to Sully Matthias. Sam, this was your box. See, Sam. You are going to be contributing. That's my name, I'm famous! Be nothing if I can't get the damn pack open. All right. Miguel Geraldo base and Alex Canario gold base. The 50. First auto. Miguel Geraldo again. And second auto. Very nice. Robbie Poisson. The number two international signing 2019 class. Behind that guy, uh, Jason Dominguez, was the only player rated higher than him. So, very nice one there. Good choice, Sam. Puck's box.
Nice, Wander Franco, base rookie. Canario, and first auto, Taylor Trammell. In the majors now with the Mariners, followed by Jose De La Cruz of the Tigers. Let's see if we can get a big one here. Poisson, definitely our best name so far. Let's see if Baseball Sack can bring us a Dominguez or a Franco or a Rushman or, or someone one more time. Wow, what is with uh, what is with Alex Canario? Cannot stop with him on the base cards. Canario's for everyone! Yay! Another gold this time, that's crazy. Rushman base. So another nice one there. Canario gold. To 50, first auto. There we go. Jordan Walker, very nice for the Cardinals. And second auto, Cody Thomas of the Dodgers. So a couple nice boxes there. Puck, I think yours was the worst, buddy. Boo, Puck. <laughs> but let's go ahead and do the draft here. All right. We got Drew, Baseball, Puck, and Sam. Seven times. Good luck. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Six. And seven. Puck, you, pissed, you picked the worst box, but you get the first pick in the draft. So it's Puck, Drew, Sam, and Baseball. Hey, <laughs> which box are you going with, buddy? If anyone needs a recap, I'll be happy to provide. Uh, you're probably going to want the Poisson box. He's the best name, so that is where I would go. It's Poisson, Geraldo, one of the Canario Golds and Geraldo. That would be my number one pick. I will take the Poisson for sure. That is a first year card for him too. His first uh, Bowman was 2020, so that's uh, number one. At number two, uh, Drew, are you back yet? Is Drew here? Because I'll have to pick for him at number two if he is not present. Drew's back. All right, cool. Drew is back. Drew, you got the number two pick. Uh, do you need me to recap the boxes here for you? I don't know if you missed them or not. I don't know when you popped back in the chat there. So you're choosing between uh, Yidi Cape, Black Auto to 25, Suli Matthias Auto, and then base of Wit and Poisson is one box. The next box is Cody Thomas and Jordan Walker, base autos, Canario Gold, base to 50, and a Rushman Prospect. And then your last box is Jose, <coughs> excuse me, Jose De La Cruz and Taylor Trammell, base autos, with Canario and Wander Franco, base. Uh, I'd probably go with this box here. Take the uh, the Wit and Poisson base cards, both first years, and then the Sully Matthias and Yidi Cape <coughs> Black Auto to 25. That's what I would do. You want to go with this one? You like that card, Soccer? <laughs> yeah, it was my mail day today. So, all right, Drew's taking that box that I recommended. Uh, that takes us to, I believe, it's Sam was third. Sam, you're up next. Um, I would take the one with the Jordan Walker, this one here. He's the best auto left, plus you also get... A nice Rushman and the Gold Canario. So I would go with that one. Sam says that works. All right. Let me find your stack, Sam. I know it's here somewhere. There it is. And then Baseball Sack with the fourth pick. You're running at the last stack here on the table. 
still a pretty decent box with Canario. You got a nice Wander Franco. And then the Trammel and De La Cruz on card autos. Both short printed to 325. <coughs> and I think we're caught up again then, folks. Everyone's a big Canario guy now. <laughs> that was crazy. Literally every pack. <laughs> uh, you're welcome, baseball. So again, I've got about 45 minutes of streaming left. A little under 45 minutes before the uh, I hit the 10 hour mark and it automatically will kind of end the stream. So I could probably one, run one more group break if we wanted to, but after that I don't really want to do any more because I don't want to have um, anyone get cut off. But if anyone would like personals, go for it. All right, Sam's going to grab a personal 19 museum pack. Nice. All right. All right, Sam, top or bottom, where are we going on 19 museum? Bottom. Starting off with Yusei Kikuchi. Very nice bronze rookie. Kutch. Mookie Betts. Rizzo. And, well, that's stupid. Canvas collection of David Wright and totally shorted a hit. Oh, real good museum collection. It's like the third time this has happened in 2019 museum collection. Well, I'll send you the um, I'll send you the the box. Here, that way you can possibly get something, or hopefully get something from Tops. So I just broke it down, and I will send it to you, buddy. Sorry about that. It is not the first time that that's happened to us with 2019 Museum Collection, oddly enough. I, literally, I think the first ever pack we did of this was the same thing. Uh, you're welcome, Sam. Sorry about that, buddy. I mean, that one kind of sucked. Uh, don't like when that happens, ever, honestly. But. Not like seeing that happen. Caught up again. Not a ton of time left for me. Um, Buck, I didn't do uh, any other group breaks, so um, I would have to put one together. Select basketball is not going to fill. So if anyone buys select basketball, um, you're not. You're. It's not going to fill. <laughs> um, so gold standard, we could still run. Um, I did. I think I put that one in the store. Um, where did I just put the other box of museum for you, Sam? It was just in my hand. Oh, there it is. All right, here's the other one. <laughs> uh, we can do Trinity. Yeah, we can do 2020 Trinity. Actually, I'll do that one. So let me do this for Sam, and then we'll do a 2020 Trinity hit draft. Because that one will fill. It's six spots. It's cheap, and uh, it's awesome. A lot of fun. All right. Let's, uh, let's make sure there's a hit in this one, please, Tops. Thanks. Appreciate you. All right. Definitely a hit in this one. Woohoo! It's funny. We shouldn't be celebrating that. That should be a given, but yeah. All right. Strasburg, Tanaka, Sandberg, Gold. That's cool. Clemente, 130 of 150 on the Clemente Gold. And definitely have a patch of some sort because I just stuck my finger in it. Let's 
17 of 25, Michael Fulmer. Oh, boy. Former Met. Former AL Rookie of the Year. But he fell off pretty fast, did Michael Fulmer. 17 of 25 on the meaningful material. Prime gold. Quit <laughs> Sam. Oh, I appreciate the good attitude, Sam. <laughs> He's fine. Yeah, he was one of those guys. I mean, I was high on him when the Mets had him. Um, and he was doing fine. You're right. He was having a decent little comeback here. No longer a starter, that's for sure. But... All right, let's look at a 2020 Trinity Baseball here. So this would be, I think it's going to be 35 bucks a spot for a hit draft on this one. And you guys can continue to go ahead with uh, the personals. Let me just double check. I want to make sure I got my price right. I'm not going to have that. Trinity, where are you? Yeah, thirty-five dollars a spot on this one. So, I know uh, Diggett said he was in. Baseball <coughs> said he was in. So I will add that in six spots. Nice cheap one at thirty-five dollars per. So again, this will be the bottom of the baseball section. 2020 Leaf Trinity hit draft round one. Everyone gets an auto for 35 bucks. And in the store it is. You like that? <laughs> I went I straight smurfed myself. Oh, our homies from us uh, hit seekers are in here. What's up, guys? And nice purchase. So I actually made a typo on that one, but it's a typo in your favor. It's actually four cards per pack for the um select Cosmics, not three. We've done very well with these. Um, I, think, I think I had eight of them to begin with. Hit a Brady, we hit a Herbert, we hit a Tua. <coughs> um, a lot of nice ones. A couple Cam Akers, a couple Judies. So. Where are we going though? One, two, or three? Number three. All right. Get you a slip for today, guys. Okay. Let's do it. Fun one. Me and my purple thumb. Four cards per. They upside down. They are. Okay. Good luck, guys. You get one from each level. So you'll have one concourse, one premier, one club, and one field level. So they go in order. Starting off with the concourse. Not too bad of a start. DeAndre Swift, rookie. So, good start there. Premier level. I like quarterbacks. Oh, it's not a quarterback. He's catching. You would have thought he was throwing. Fake out. Amari Cooper. See an outstretched arm, one arm holding a football with a point going forward. Got to be quarterback, right? Nope. <laughs> Incorrect. Club level. Okay. 
Very nice. Possibly one of the running, well, I would say he's on the running back Mount Rushmore, Emmett Smith. Smith, Sanders, Jim Brown, and Walter Payton probably for me. My running back Mount Rushmore. So a very nice one there. And one more to go, the field level. All right, big name one time. Good luck, buddy. <laughs> it's Ocho Cinco. <laughs> Chad Johnson. Awesome. That is awesome. A lot of good names in that pack. Very cool. And obviously some of the best looking cards out there too. So thank you guys. I appreciate you stopping in and uh, grabbing that pack. I hope you guys enjoyed it. That was fun. Oh, my pleasure, guys. Thank you. All right, I think we're uh, full on the Trinity hit draft, too. We are. Diggett's got three, Sam's got one, Puck's got one, and Baseball Sack's got one. All right, guys, do you want to just use the box that I have sitting behind me, or does someone want to pick a number one through uh, one through four for my stack that's over off in the side? Diggett says box two. Okay. I will grab box two. We'll open it first, and then we'll do the random afterwards, so we can all cheer for good stuff. Right, Diggit is the Trinity Whisperer. Pulls the best boxes. Oh man, we're gonna do it, guys. We need six more orders in the next 25 minutes. Seven more orders in the next 25 minutes, and we'll set a new record. New stream record. Seven orders in 25 minutes. We can do it. Might have to just do another Trinity draft right after this. <laughs> Let me actually just double check and make sure we didn't miss any one. Trinity, Trinity. Okay, I did not. All right, so if anyone wants any personal, feel free to grab them. We'll do them right after this Trinity draft. All right, Bethany helping the cause. <laughs> Thanks, Queen. I'm going to take this off just for a second just to get the little stickers off. All right, this is a nice one. You picked a good box, I think, for, uh, for our draft here, buddy. Four jumbo patches, including the bottom card. So four jumbo patches and the bottom, <coughs> including the bottom card. And for those of you that don't know, in Leaf products, usually the bottom card is the best card, at least the best player, name-wise. All right, let's start off with number one. It was a good patch. I saw it, and I just sold an auto of this guy the other day. It's Connor Phillips, and that's a nice patch. So nice one to start. Phillips Jumbo logo patch there. Don't know exactly what that logo is going to be from, but next up to 50, 7 of 50. I think we know who that is. Hello. It's Yolbert Sanchez. Is that the Mariners? I mean, I thought that was the Mariners logo, but I'd never seen the color on that one. I didn't know if they had an alternate. Because uh, it's definitely black. It's not blue. But there's a nice Yolbert Sanchez with the bottom half of the White Sox logo, 7 of 50. Uh, I mean, that would make sense because, I mean, he is on the Mariners. It's just I, 
I didn't even put two and two together thinking because the color. So good call there, Sam. Whew. Wow, we actually have we have a bona fide number one pick coming up next. Bona fide number one pick coming up next. You guys are gonna be happy. Nine of fifteen here on Reed Schaller. Trinity clear. And this might be the best card we've pulled, or I've pulled, from Trinity coming up here. Platinum, patch auto to five. Player we were just talking about. Five of five, how good they are. When we pulled them in Onyx Nimbus, that is Jordan Walker with the MLB logo genuine merchandise tag. So, there's probably your number one pick. That is going to be real tough to beat. Good player, low numbered, great tag. We still have the bottom card to go. This is a great box, dig it. You crushed it. Purple. I think purples are to 10. Another nice one Antonio Cabello, Yankees. 2 of 10. This is a great box. There's not a single bad card in this box. It's Thanksgiving in this bitch. Everyone go eat. Nom, 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 nom. And our bottom card, probably going to be our best name. I know who it is because I have one. <laughs> this is good. It is our best name. 5 of 50. That, my friends, is Blaze Jordan. Hello. What a box. What a box. All right, we're going to do the random, but I don't think anyone's going <laughs> I don't think <laughs> anyone's going to be disappointed with where they fall. So, let's go ahead and do that. And uh, in the meantime, I'm doing it. I'm putting one more round in the store. Got to set the record. So round two of our Trinity hit draft in the store. Go and get it. Let's go ahead and do the random here for round number one. And round number two will set the record <laughs> for most orders in a single stream. Just a casual Wednesday night, folks. All right, so Diggits in spot one. Dig it's also in spot three and four. Baseball sack is in six. Pucks in five. And who was in two? Do, 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 do. Sam's in two. All right. Uh, it's at the bottom of the baseball section, Agape. I think there's still a couple left. All right, seven times, folks. Good luck. One, two, three, four, five, six, and seven. Baseball sack coming in on top. So it's sack, dig it twice, puck, Sam, and dig it. All right, Zach, you've got the tough choice. Which one are you taking at pick number one? Jordan Walker to five with the tag or the Blaze Jordan to 50? That is a tough call. Or if you want to take something else, you can. But um, I would say that these are 1A and 1B. Sacks go in Blaze. Can't be mad at that. Awesome choice there. Blaze Jordan goes 1. The baseball sack. All right, dig it. 
At two, I have to assume you're taking the Jordan Walker as one of them. I gotta think that one's gone, correct. And he, here are our other ones. We have the Cabello flat to 10. The Schaller red to 15. It's got a little bit of a, a lift here on the bottom corner. It's not like dinged, it's just, uh, it's, you know, it's fine. It's just, uh, I think the, the cutting machine, the surface is a little kind of funky there. The Yolbert Sanchez to 50 with the logo patch and the Connor Phillips with the Mariners, excuse me, Mariners alternate logo patch. Cabello would have been my choice as well. So we are on the same page there. Walker and Cabello. Pocket four. You've got the Sanchez, the Phillips, and the Schaller. Where are you going, brother? Everybody eats. <laughs> Oof. Gotta find your stack, dig it. It's here somewhere. There it is. Puck says, was thinking the Connor Phillips. Oh, man, this is a tough call. Um, I don't think you can go wrong with either of the patches. I think, for me, the Schaller goes last, but I don't think you can go wrong with either of the uh, the patches. Connor Phillips logo patch it is to Puck. Uh, Sam, are you going to go with the Sanchez or the Schaller? Sanchez is the patch. Sanchez for Sam, and then Schaller goes to dig it at spot six. Great break. That was unbelievable. That's like what every hit draft should be. All right, Bethany's got two more individuals. <laughs> I'll take the Schaller. All right, two more individuals here for Bethany's. Uh, Ginter times four. All right, Bethany, go ahead and hit me. <coughs> oh, my God. My throat needs a break, but we're so close to the end. I'll power through. Um, pick four there, one through eight, and then uh, one through three on archive sigs. One. Same cough, we're twins! <laughs> I've eaten so many cough drops this week, but I feel so much better outside of this cough, which it always takes me forever to get uh, get through it. So, whoo! I think I got you sick through the phone. <laughs> Number two on uh, archive six. Okay, Grandal, Cole, DeYoung, Brickley, Killebrew, Cepeda, Deion Sanders, short print, and we already learned about the tulip tree. They bloom in the springtime and have tulip shaped flowers that are orange and green and yellow that is an arboreal appreciation so i randy johnson dalton varsha rookie johnny bench jose quintana mark burley jd martinez and there's a nice one chris bryant black bordered mini Ooh, the horse chestnut. I have never heard anything about horse chestnuts before in my life, but I bet you that this is the tree that Ann Frank wrote about in her diary. Oh my God, look, it even says it there. The Ann Frank tree, who knew? Horse chestnuts. Yay. <laughs> We've opened, I think, uh, too much Ginter that I've already got all these stupid cards memorized. <laughs> Herbert Marquez, Duke Schneider, Tyler Glass now, Christian Pache. Nice, Trevor Lawrence rookie. Edgar Martinez, your boy. He is a short print. Very nice. Kevin Kiermeyer. And Sixto Sanchez is your Murad rookie. My guy. <laughs> and our final Ginter one here. Josh Bell, Daz Cameron rookie, David Price, Eddie Matthews, Justin Verlander, Kenta Maeda. Far, far away, Caldwell 44. I don't think we've done Caldwell 44 yet. 
No, we have not. Nicknamed the Propeller Galaxy, who could forget that? Because it emits a jet of radio wavelengths that bends in the opposite direction to the stars and dust in the arms of the spiral galaxy. No idea what any of that means. Nothing. That just sounds so badass. It's been home to two recent supernovae. In case anyone's curious, supernova is not supernovas. It is supernovae. One in 1990, the other in 2009. Blah, 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 space jargon. <laughs> and Jim Tomey, August 15th, 2011. That's got to be Homer number 500, right? Or 600. Aha! Uh -huh. Needed two homers to get to 600. Line out in a single. Connected in the sixth. Came up later in the same inning and tagged a three-run bomb for the milestone. So, so many dongers. I think dongers would be the better term there, Bethany, instead of dongs. <laughs> <laughs> I saw someone posted that earlier. Four ninety nine, so close. We'll get him on a card in next year's uh, historical hit set. Now let's get archive Sig's number two. <laughs> he hits so many dongs. <laughs> All right. Really, I always say dong. It's like my go-to word. Dong, dong, or any iteration of dong. Right there with the ass licker. <laughs> uh, that was good stuff. <laughs> ass licker. <laughs> uh, that was funny. All right. Oh, oh, this this got to be archives, right? Yeah, this is okay. <clears throat> I think this is a, it's an archives card. I want to say it's 2013 is the year that they remade the 1960s. It's 2013 or 2017 archives. I can't remember. But so this is way too sharp to be a card from the actual era. Oh, nice! I like this. Brad Lidge. And it faked me out. It's not archives. It's heritage. Don't see his autograph too much. My go-to closer back in fantasy every year when he was on the Astros. That is 2009 heritage. He was so money with the Astros, I feel like. Yeah, I literally had the guy every year, I think, in high school. Um, every year he was on my fantasy team. Couldn't get enough, Brad Lidge. <laughs> All right. I believe the Trinity draft is full. And we've officially done it, guys. We've set the record. 188 orders today. Pew, 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 pew. Everyone was a terrible Met, by the way. Audibles wants to dig it to pick the box. Thank you, Slack. I appreciate it. Uh, you guys are really the ones to thank, not me. Um, but I love setting records. It makes me happy. And dig it says box two. <laughs> so real quick, um, I'm going to explain to you guys what is going to happen in about eight minutes' time. So thank you, guys. Thank you, guys. Really appreciate that. Um, I was not expecting that tonight. That's for damn sure. <laughs> um, so here's the thing. In about eight eight minutes, I think I got on. Actually, let me check. Let me see if it was. I can't remember if I got on at twelve thirty, or. You know what? We've actually got a couple more minutes. We've got like twenty minutes, so we're okay. We're good to go. I thought I got on at twelve fifteen. I didn't get on until uh, twelve thirty. Look at that. So forget it. Let's just keep rocking and rolling, and we'll have this conversation that we're about to have now in 15 minutes. Let's freaking go. Can we get to 200 orders? We're so close. That's just two more boxes of Trinity. Uh, there's a 10-hour time limit where if you guys exit out of the stream and try and come back in, you won't even see my stream here. I can still be streaming, but once you leave the stream, you can't come back in, and no one new can join. That's the most that their server allows. So if it was up to me, I mean, I'd keep rolling. Shit, I'd go to 4 a.m. today. We're killing it. 
But, all right, let me move this off to the side here. Get these off. It looks like we got three jumbos, two flats, and a clear. Yeah, if my store didn't take three hours to add in, I would just do it again and keep going, but... <laughs> Still going, man. You know me, I don't stop. I'd keep going all night, but I'd ask them, I said, let me stream up the capabilities. Let's keep it running. <laughs> Butter is getting some quality reading time uh, done upstairs. Quality reading. All right, here we go. Trinity Hit Draft, round two. Starting off with a nice one. Red, eight of 25. We got a button, Gage Workman. <laughs> you can better believe I'm going to have myself a uh, seltzer or something upstairs. A little Wednesday night seltzer. Actually, you know what? I might just crack a wine and say, fuck it. Put on a James Bond movie and just down a couple glasses with my chicken. That's five hours old. <laughs> Gage Workman is our first one. First hit, so good start. Next card, uh, I think I know who that is. I believe it's an angel. It is. Nice one. Very nice one, actually. Reed Detmers. More old F1 TV races. Find Max's first win and just goo, 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 goo the whole time. <laughs> so very nice Detmers the 10th uh, pick in the 2020 draft there so I like that first year Detmers next up Diego Cartaya 27 of 50 flat auto from the Dodgers. Our last jumbo. That is going to be Seth Corey of the Giants. <coughs> Clear. Our one and only this box to 15. That's a nice one. Jared Kelly. White Sox. Very nice one. And our bottom card is a flat. Nice again. Ed Howard. Green. 20 of 25. So not as good as round one, but still a very nice box. I think four very nice cards in there, at least. In the Howard, the Workman, the Kelly, and the Detmers. All right. Let's get a draft order for you guys. I don't even know who's in this break. I didn't even look. <laughs> Round two has Sam in spot one. Audible's in five. Diggit's in six. J Will's in two. What's up, J Will? Welcome to the party, buddy. Je Oops, sorry, J Will's in four. Jelly's in two. And Dusky, you are in spot three. Okay. Good luck, everybody. Seven times. Oh, I'll show you back in a second, Dusky. One, two, 
three, four, five, six, and ba 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 seven audibles. <coughs> audibles in one. <coughs> oh man, the cough is getting me. Jay Will in two, Sam in three, Dusky in four, Jelly in five, dig it bottoms. And quick recap of the break here is the Ed Howard to 25, the Jared Kelly to 15, Seth Corey, unnumbered patch, the Kartaya to 50, the Detmers, unnumbered, and the Gage Workman, button to 25. So, Audibles, where are you going at number one? And if you need uh, advice, just go ahead and happy to help you out. Um, for me, I probably take best player available, which is Detmers. Detmers Jumbo Patch Auto for me is where I'm going at number one. Good patch, too, and uh, best player. So, if you don't want to do Detmers, uh, my next would probably be the uh, Ed Howard. He's probably your next best player here to 25. Detmers? Okay. Audible takes the Detmers at one. Good choice. At two, it's Jay Will. Where are you going, buddy? Jay Will goes Ed Howard. Very good choice. Can't go wrong with that. To 25. At three, Sam. Uh, give me one second here. This is a tough one. For me, I would go one of two ways. I would say either take the Kelly to 15. Uh, good player. And nice slow numbered. Or I would go with the Workman button to 25. I think if it was me, though, I think I'd probably take the Kelly. I think I would go Kelly over Workman. I'd probably go Kelly. But, I mean, the button's cool. So you can go either way. Going Kelly here. Okay. Kelly to 15 at 3. Very nice. Good choice. At four, it's Dusky. We've got two jumbos left, Corey and Workman, and then the Diego Cartaya to 50 here. The Seth Corey patch, you got it. Is that your first first purchase today, Dusky? I feel like you got something earlier, but I could be, I don't know, it's been so long. Yes, okay. At five, it's Jelly. The button or the Cartaya flat? Gage Workman is the, uh, the player who is on the button. He's a Tiger, Tiger's draft pick. After this, we've got Mitch with a thin pack, and then Alex has <laughs> an F1 pack. Lot, very nice. Kartaya off the board for Jelly, and dig it. You get the button. Not bad. Last pick button. He wanted the Kartaya, but you're a button. I mean, it's not a pretty good box. I don't think there was a bad card in there, so. All right. I mean, that's what you should be doing, Jell. <laughs> you should be looking them up. All right, Mitch. Silver pack thin. One through eight. Where are we going? Do you guys want me to put in one more Trinity draft? We can do one more. We got time for one more of those. 
number six. Yay or nay for one more Trinity draft? We got time for one more here. We got about 12 minutes left, so. Dusky says he's in. Dig gets in. All right, one more Trinity draft. All right, round three is in the store, bottom of the baseball section. All right, here we go, Mitch. Good luck. Legends, it's KG, 25 of 50. And I like that. Russell Wilson, 15 of 25. A lot of green going on there. Thank you, Mitch. Into your pile it goes. And then Alex is going to do some F1 chrome here. All right, Alex. Give me two numbers, one through, I think, 12. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. 1 through 12. Give me two. Four and ten, all right. And sorry I'm going so fast right now, guys. We just have uh, almost no time left here on the stream, so I'm trying to get through the last of what we can get through. Ten. All right, Alex, you ready? Prima Racing, Gio Alessi, Aston Marble, uh, <laughs> Aston Marble, Aston Martin Red Bull, the Pit Stop Award winner, and we got a track tag, that's Kimmy, the Iceman. Pack two, the Carlin logo, Nice one there. Gun Yu Zhao. Second place right now in F2 as a 21 year old. True rookie. And right behind him is Christian Lundgaard. And finishing up with a World on Wheels. It is the Williams car, the FW43. So thank you, Alex our first uh, F1 Chrome today. Did a lot of Sapphire. Oh, we got a push? Oh, man. That is bad timing for me. I'm going to have to sign off for like 30 people <laughs> in here. Because I got like 10 minutes left. <laughs> um, I think the hit draft is full. Trinity, is it not? One, two, three, four. We have two spots left in the 2020 Leaf Trinity baseball hit draft. That is the only one that we're filling right now. Um, bottom of the baseball section. And Mitch has got another silver thin. One through seven, Mitch. Where are we going? Number one. And again, for everyone that was uh, or just getting here, in about eight minutes, you will no longer be able to see my stream. I'm going to hit the 10-hour streaming limit max. So if you leave the stream, you will no longer be able to see my stream and come back in. So it... Once it hits 10.30 Eastern time, so eight minutes from now, if you leave the stream, you're not going to be able to get back in. So please keep that in mind, especially if you're buying something. Ah. All right. Puck's in for Trinity one more time. And Views finishes Trinity. All right. So Trinity is full. We'll be doing that next. If anyone wants any individuals, please get them now. <laughs> I'm doing, I guess we'll call it last call right now. Um, we'll do the box that's sitting behind me, because that was the one I was going to do to begin with. But um, get those individuals in now, and please do not leave the room. 
All right, starting off with nice one, Legends Impact, twenty-one of fifty, Jerry Rice. And Asher squares to ten. Oh, I like that. That's a good one, Mason Mount. And how about jersey number seven of ten? Very nice on the Mason Mount. Good stuff, Mitch. Uh, I guess technically it's box one, dig it, because it's the only one sitting behind me. <laughs> All right, one, two, three, four, five, six. All right, Trinity is full again. So close, we're four orders away from cracking 200. Four orders away from the GOAT stream, 200. Box two of those <laughs> left. We did shatter the record, broke the record for most orders in a single stream. Crushed it by, uh, right now by 11 orders but now i got i got 200 in my sights we got six minutes or so six minutes or so to get to 200 so anyone out there just make sure you don't leave the room if you buy something because you're not gonna be able to get back in <laughs> no what happened with blood and nt Three jumbos, including our bottom card. And our top card's a nice one. So I think I did okay here. Stupid stickers off. All right, everyone. Good luck. We'll do the draft order at the end here. That way we can all root for six stuff. Oh my god. <laughs> I mean, I don't blame them. It's hard to watch your customers get killed. Um, that's why, honestly, I don't even carry products like that. So good for him. <laughs> I mean, whatever it is, $5,000 a box, when you see $300 worth of stuff come out, it's rough. I don't blame him. Don't blame him. It is crazy. Well, speaking of crazy, let's start off with a uh, top five pick, number to 25. It's another button. It's Max Meyer. So, great start there. 7 of 25, Max Meyer button. Love me some Max Meyer. And let's go one step further on the crazy. Crazy patch coming at you. How about Keegan Aiken? Hello. Filthy little Orioles patch there. Next up, Flat Auto. That's going to be Wildered Patino. That is the base, unnumbered. I have drilled some uh, pretty... Uh, Pretty dope patches. Next level stuff. Clear auto. Purple. 7 of 10. Oh, that's a nice one. What a box. Yolkoi Cespedes. Baby Cess. Purple to 10. There is some competition here for the top pick. I don't even know what I would take between the Cespedes or the Meyer right now. I love that auto. <laughs> I actually love it. One more flat auto. Geraldo Perdermo. And all right, guys. This is how you end a marathon record-setting stream. This is how you fucking do it. 
You know it's serious. I don't drop F-bombs on camera. But this is how you fucking do it. This is our number one overall pick. 55 of 75. Look at that, Jason Dominguez. That's how you do the record-setting stream. Send it off in style. Because we're genuine as fuck up in here. That's three F-bombs for me in 60 seconds. That's more than I've ever said this probably entire month. The filth is overwhelming. The trash can oozing goo all over my table. Mmm. That's a restaurant dumpster of filth. On a Saturday night in the winter. Blech. All right. Well, that's our number one pick. Let's find out who's going to get it. And it is 1029. So again, if you leave the stream, you will not be able to get back in. So those of you that are in the draft, do not leave the stream. Because you will not get back in. And if anyone cared, we have three more orders to get to 200. <laughs> so, any last calls on personals are going now. Let's see, we got Dig It in spot one. Jelly in spot five. Dusky in spot six. Sam in spot three. Puck is in two. And Views is in four. Then DMS has got a national convention pack after this. And uh, what's up, ZM? Uh, so all you got to do is purchase them. Don't leave the stream, because my stream's about to end. Um, I'm hitting my 10-hour limit here, so if you leave the stream, you're not going to be able to come back in. But all you have to do is go to the sale items, purchase the item you want. Uh, you're, you'll be up. There's one person ahead of you, but um, you'll pick your packs that you want, and then we'll open them. It's pretty easy. But here we go, guys. Fighting right now to see who's going to land this Jason Dominguez. Seven times in the random. Good luck, everybody. One, two, three, four, five, six, and bop da bop 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 da seven views. Congratulations, buddy. Don't even have to make it official. I'm picking on your behalf. Congratulations. There it is. <laughs> Dominguez to views. Awesome. You are very welcome. And again, if you purchase something, don't leave the stream. You're not going to be able to get back in. We can always do. I have one box of Trinity left. If you guys want, I can put it in. The last box that'll clear 200 orders. But you guys just can't leave the stream. So, Jelly, you're up next. You've got the. I think you're choosing between. I think it's two cards, pretty obvious here. The Cespedes to 10 and the Max Meyer. Tough call. Both are good. Um, I don't know which one I would pick. That's a tough call. 35, or 35 bucks is that group break. And I have one more box here that we can do. I can put one, the last box I can put in the store. Max Meyer for Jelly. At three, it is Dusky. All right, I'm putting the Dusky's Taken Cess. I'll put the last one in the store. 
you guys remember, you cannot leave the stream. If you leave the stream, you will not be able to get back in. I cannot stress that enough. So our fourth and final Trinity hit draft is in the store. Take as many as you guys want. It's the last one I can do. Cespedes goes at three. To <laughs> Dusky, good choice. And again, make sure you don't leave the store, guys, if I are the stream. I think number four is a pretty obvious choice here. Um, four is Dig It. I think we're pretty obvious going with the Keegan Aiken. Sorry, I'll let you guys go ahead and purchase. There you go. Well, that's a, that's a good thing to go your way, Views. Congratulations, buddy. I'm happy for you. Diggett's got the Aiken, and then choosing between Perdermo and Patino here at uh, five, Puck. I would, I would go Perdermo if you're looking for an opinion here. Perdermo. Definitely Perdermo. And then spot six was, who is six? Sam, you're getting the Patino. All right. All right, DMS has a couple uh, individuals here we're going to do, and then we'll do our final Trinity hit draft. So I know there's Trinity, <laughs> hooray! <laughs> I know there's more Trinity boxes in the store. Please do not buy any, because <laughs> we use them all for the hit draft, so I have none left. So please do not buy an individual box of that. But in the meantime, all right. Dave, you're the man. You you put us over 200 orders by yourself there, dude. And we just went just like that. We are up to a... We are blowing records out of the water now. 208 we are now up to. And again, we can still do more. I can still do anything you guys want. Just you guys can't leave the stream. All right, so we've got a national convention pack. Uh, Allen and Ginter times two, or the two packers. we got three of those, and then... Or four of those, and then a heritage to some. Okay, so... Heritage, these are the last two I got left. Don't leave! <laughs> um, Top's National Convention, David. One, two, or three. Top, okay. And then out of the... You're picking eight packs here from the Ginter two-pack box. So, uh, one through six, left, right. Random. I'm just going to go ahead and take the top two off each side and give you the rest. Now, I know how much we love reading the back of the Ginter stuff, but in the essence of time here, I am not going to read them this time. I'm just going to go through them because, uh, again, time is not our friend right now. So, Unless there's one that we haven't seen yet, I'll read that. <laughs> Musil, Wood Jr., Acuna, Moustakis, Straz, Kruk, Nice Dick Allen mini black border. And uh, Buxton Murad. Dick Allen is it? Well, that's a nice one. First one of these. Black border short print mini. Private club now. For real. Shit just got real exclusive up in here. <laughs> Jalen Waddle rookie. Mookie. Solaire. Hector Yan. Or Peter Yan. Hector Yan's a baseball player. Just automatically default to that. Basabe. This guy was so hot in prospecting for a hot minute. Uh, Luis Basabe. He's got three names. Luis someone Basabe. I can't remember the middle name that he had listed on his cards. Uh, Alou, Pete Alonzo, Black Border, and Albert Poole, September 18th, 2020. That is definitely home run number uh, 600, right? Or 661? 661. <laughs> Two spots in the definitive hit draft. <laughs> Imagine. Right now, I mean, if we feel the definitive hit draft it right now. My God, Maris, Kiebert Ruiz, rookie Alonzo, Grenke, Liam Hendricks, Tim Anderson, Willie Stargell is our Allen and Ginter back mini, and we got to learn about the zebra shark. Haven't had it yet. Deep sea shivers, sometimes confused with leopard sharks because they are born with white bars across their brown bodies. Zebra sharks become yellow or tan with small dark spots as they grow, up to eight feet on average. These nocturnal foragers tend to hang on to near shallow 
They tend to hang out near shallow coral habitats and tropical waters, but have been spotted at depths up to 200 feet. Zebra shark. Let's <laughs> dig it. They probably would have been yours at some point. Uh, but the limit is because uh, it's for the streaming capabilities. It's all their server can handle. So, at for the first, I think first it was only like four hours, and then it was like six, and then it was eight, and I just kept asking them to make it longer and longer and longer, and now here we are again. <laughs> Same boat. Uh, Jeff Garland is an actor, apparently. Luis Robert, Ichiro, Kershaw, and a Nico Horner jersey. We're floating in the, uh, the, the, the globular clusters. <laughs> Reese Hoskins mini. Oh, haven't got one of these yet. Aboreal Appreciations, the pine tree. Pines are any conifer shrubs or tree species from the Pinus genus of plants, a group that includes more than 120 species worldwide. They are evergreens that can grow a staggering 250 feet or more and typically produce large cones. The number of leaves or needles in each bundle can help determine which pine species a specific tree belongs to. Who knew? that the number of needles in each bundle can tell you what genus of Pinus we're looking at. The, the genus of Pinus. So close. <laughs> uh, Kobe Arihara rookie, Casey Mize rookie, Lorenzo Kane, Jeter, DeGrom, Otani, Suarez, short print mini, and another new one, the mackerel shark. That's not a mackerel. Mackerels are tiny. This thing's huge. Mackerel sharks are unique in that they were named for what they eat. I knew that was going to be it. Mackerel and herring are frequent meal choices, also called white sharks, or meal choices, period. That looks like a comma. Definitely period. Also called white sharks, mackerel sharks are fast swimmers with pointed teeth that frequently grow beyond 10 feet. Before mustering a recent comeback, their population in the North Atlantic was threatened by fishing in the late 20th century. Big old great whites. What a good fucking shark. That's like a shark shark right there. That's like when you think of sharks, that's sharks. That's the image when you think of the shark. It's at least like a top four shark. <laughs> Manny Machado, Tristan McKenzie, Ozzy Albies, Charlie Blackman, Kutch, Crime Dog, and a Tristan McKenzie mini rookie, Ben Zobrist, historical hits, November 3rd, 2016. That is the World Series winner, the most significant hit in Cubs history, tied 6 6, top of the 10th. The go ahead double that gave them the lead. Yeah, players? Who cares about players? I'm, all, I'm here for the sharks. I'm here for the sharks, boy! <laughs> sharks in the trees! Nolan Ryan, Colton Wong, uh, Aaron Judge, Whit Merrifield. I don't know who that is. Michelle. Oh, that's, 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 yeah, that is Michelle Akers. I should have known that. I feel dumb. Zach Plesak, Trey Turner, Alan and Ginterback, and a Griffey Murad. I would love, oh my god, imagine like a shark fin, shark fin patch. Ooh, we gotta frame something. Alright, Eric Hosmer mini. Oh, a new Aboreal appreciation, the silver maple. We had the red one before. Ooh. Ooh, the silver maple. Their rapid growth and ability to adapt to many types of soil made silver maples popular planting trees among American pioneers who also preferred the sugary sap to that of other maples. Man, what a different time we are from. Can you imagine growing up and, like, you go out there and you just start licking tree sap, and you're like... <laughs> yeah, this is this is the one that I like. <laughs> Silver maple sap. <laughs> Don't want that red maple sap. <laughs> Gross. <laughs> Silver maple. <laughs> Silver maples, named for the silvery white color of the underside of their green leaves, grow 50 to 80 feet and are among the most common trees in North America. Well, in case anyone was curious, go lick the sap. It's sugary and delicious. I don't have any diamond icons or luminaries. 
Diamond Icons is the same problem I was having with National Treasures. I can only get it by a sealed case, and I don't want to drop that amount of money on those if I'm not sure if I can sell them. So, Maddox, Hosmer, George Brett, George Springer, and finishing up with B and Auto, not a relic, B and Auto. It's a relic, it's Yachty. We will have more Trinity for sure tomorrow. Well, that was fun, DNS. Let's do Heritage times two. Jackson Rutledge, Floriel, Nolan Jones, Max Muncy, Forrest Whitley, Cody Hose, Dylan Carlson, very nice, Ethan Hankins, and a refractor to 199, 136 of 199, Jordan Groshans. Okie dokes, I like that, and Braylon Marquez. I can't wait until tomorrow. My wife's going to catch me outside. She's like, what the hell are you doing? I'm just like, Babe, I gotta lick the silver maple. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be real stupid. Altuve, Zach Collins rookie, <laughs> Joey Cantillo, Bohm, Toro, Vivi Garcia, Nolan Arenado, Seth Beer, black and white, Daz Cameron chrome, and Nick Bennett chrome. And that finishes up that box of Bowman Heritage. And one more for you, DMS. This is our Tops National Convention Pack. Oh, look at that. Yerman Mercedes, rookie card logo. Is that, a, is that a red or an orange? We got an orange coming up. So Yerman Mercedes, rookie card logo. I believe that's his first one. Chris Bryant, Pete Alonzo, and orange to 25. Very nice. Nick Madrigal. That's a winner. Madrigal rookie to 25. Very nice. Noish. All right. Thank you, DMS. That was fun. And we've got one more Trinity to do. One more Trinity. Man, that Dominguez was filthy. I feel like I just have to do it justice. I have to do this. I have to pull the machete, which was for S board crew. And views, got to put it up there. I got to do it. Even if it's only for a minute or two, it, it belongs up on the damn, the damn screen here. Oh, but I lost my pen. No! All right, we'll write in Sharpie. Actually, I don't want to write in Sharpie. I want it to stick to the back of the card. What happened to my pen? There it is. Okay. They don't fail me now. <laughs> Sam. Wow. Look at that little, little foursome. All right, guys. Last box of Trinity. I'm getting close to dead battery here, or 20% batteries, <laughs> so um, we'll do one more last call on personals. Look at that. Wow. Those are damn good cards today. And we had to shun a lot of good stuff. Whew. All right. Final Trinity box. and eight orders. Unbelievable. That is absolutely ridiculous. Just on a, just on a Wednesday. Proof. All right. Whoa. This is interesting. This is interesting. We've got two clears, 
three patches. Well, if we have, I already said how many clears we have. I already said how many patches we have. And there's only another one other type of card in here. That's a flat, right? So we got to have one flat. No, we don't have a flat. No, we don't have a plate. We've got a redemption in Leaf Trinity. I've never seen one. This is our third case. Have not seen one Leaf Trinity redemption. But now we got one. So let's have some fun, guys, one more time. Starting off with a clear, 17 of 30. That's a nice one. Yidi Cape from the Marlins. So good start there. Then we've got three straight patches. 32 of 75. Kyle Nicholas. Lou Bob, is that confirmed? That would be nice. <coughs> Franco's been a redemption in other Leaf products in 2020. And Onyx as well. Next one, well, that's a patch for you. Hunter Brown, 3XL, made in China. I've never seen a Wander in Trinity. Actually, that's not true. I did. He is a redemption. 100% is Wander. I have one. I forgot. I pulled one out of my individual box when this stuff came out. He's definitely uh, in Trinity because I've got one somewhere sitting around. Luis Medina. I believe that is a bottom of a Twins patch down there. Or is that a Yankee? I have no idea. Kind of looks like it's a Mr. Twin. If he's like hair in here. All right. It's like a card shard. There we go. Yankee? Guardians? Hair? Who knows? I don't know what team this guy's on, but that's part of a patch for them. <laughs> I thought it was like... Could be a Yankee. It could be a Guardian. Could be a Twin. I have no idea. All the same colors, essentially. But... Not a player I'm familiar with, so... Three of fifteen... Drew Romo, very nice. Rockies, clear. Definitely a Yankee. All right, definitely a Yankee. And we were correct. No need to spoil it. It's Wander Franco. Why not? Boom. So you don't know. It could be a clear. It could be a patch auto. It could be a base. Uh, you won't know the type of card or the parallel until you redeem it. But one more time, fingers crossed in the random, everyone. Let's get that set up here. And then Buff's going to eat some chicken and uh, soothe his throat. All right, here it is. Dig it's in one. Sam's in five. Kang's in two. Diggit's in four. Puck's in six. And DMS in three, finishing us off in style. All right, here we go, folks. Whoops, almost put my computer on top of the cap. Good luck, everyone. One last random, seven times. One. Maybe. There it is. Two. Three. Four. 
five, six, and last time, good luck everyone, seven. Puck, you did it, buddy. You did it, Puck! <laughs> <laughs> Sam goes barf. I'm assuming this is where we're going, right, Puck? Puck wants the wander. All right. There we go. Wander for Puck. Second. Oh, sorry. I didn't even read the whole thing off. Uh, dig it's two. Tang three. Dig it four. DMS five. Sam at six. Digging it too. Where are we going, buddy? We've got Cap A to 30, Drew Romo to 15. The we don't know what team Luis Medina is on. Everyone is sure he's on four different teams. <laughs> unnumbered. Hunter Brown, unnumbered tag patch, and then Kyle Nicholas to 75. <laughs> Yankees, Cleveland, I swear. <laughs> <laughs> it's too funny. Maybe there's two Luis Medinas. It's not like that uncommon of a name. And the patch doesn't help because it's literally like the exact colors where it could be Yankees or Indians. So, who knows? Yeah, I love this. This is like the perfect hit draft product. <laughs> All right. We have multiple confirmations here on Yankees. Drew Romo, good choice. That's probably what I would have chosen there, is the Romo. Best player and lowest numbered at two. So Romo goes to dig it. At three, it's Tang. Where are you going, buddy? You've got Cap at a 30. Medina. Brown. And Nicholas to 75. Yiddy Cap. All right. Cap, Cap A, I don't know. I'll change it every time. But Yiddy is going three. At four, dig it. Where are you going? Look at that. Our patches. All three patches going last. Medina, Nicholas to 75, or Brown? <laughs> he says, I need sleep. <laughs> All right, Nicholas at four. DMS at five. Last pick of the draft, of the last draft. Hunter Brown or Medina? The Yankee Guardian Mariner twin. <laughs> Medina goes to DMS and not a bad one to get in the last spot Hunter Brown jumbo tag patch for you Sam so let me just put these last two in their stacks and wow what a wicked evening that was so now you guys are finally free finally free to go ahead and leave the stream because we are going to be done here. That is it. Ten and a half hours. Two hundred and eight orders. <laughs> two, four, six, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, sixteen, eighteen, twenty, twenty-two, twenty-four, twenty-six, twenty-eight, thirty, thirty-two, thirty-four, thirty-six, thirty-eight, forty-two, four, six, eight, fifty-two, four, six, eight, sixty-two, sixty-four, sixty-six, sixty-eight, seventy, seventy-two, seventy-four, seventy-six, seventy-eight. 79, 80, 81, at least 81 unique buyers. All got to be records. All of them. Whoo! Fucking wild. I'll be all right. I, <laughs> I get this dry cough literally every year. Last year, it took me two years. Two years, or two years, uh, two months before it went away. So it's almost the same time every year, at the end of August into the fall. It sucks. I hate it. But... Yeah, so, yeah, I hear you, brother, but um, I am good to go, so that's going to be it for me tonight, folks. 
Um, make sure, I know you guys probably have all followed my, uh, my, <laughs> my store at this point, so I'm going to go eat some chicken. I'm going to have myself an alcoholic beverage. I love you guys too. Uh, thanks for hanging out. Definitely some awesome cards, and I will catch you guys maybe tomorrow. Um, I'm, I'm planning for tomorrow at like 6 o'clock, so I'd love to run this back. So be on the lookout, and until then, you guys uh, get some rest. Have a nice, uh, easy day at work tomorrow, and then come hang with me at, uh, in the evening. All right, I got to do it. Got to sign off. Later, everybody. It's been fun. And we're out. Later, YouTube. Wild day. Good night.